um, well, we're kick kicking off the amazing sort of Easter weekend. Um, and there is going to be some really extra special little treats that we're going to be doing for you across the whole weekend from today right up until Monday. So just before we kind of talk about what's going to come up on the next five hours, I'm just going to kind of give you a bit of a heads up of what might happen and what extra little bits that you might get. So we are going to give one of you um, who shops at some point during the shows today right up until Monday, we are going to give one of you your basket, everything that you buy on one of those days for free. Okay. Now, each time you buy an item, you get it's almost like you get like a little entry, okay? So each item you buy, another entry goes in, another entry goes in. So the more you buy, the more chances that you have got to get that. Um, and of course, we always say you can check out as much as you want between midnight and midnight. It is that one-off postage and packaging fee, okay? Um, on top of that, did you, did you shop last weekend? So yes, somebody's going to win their basket. But if you shopped last weekend, then you should have had a little, uh, a little kind of coupon that's come through to your email address saying that you can have 10% off as well. So everything that you order over the next few days, you can get 10% off if you shop with us last weekend. If you did, and for some reason that hasn't come through to you, just give the call centre a ring. They're literally upstairs here. They're super helpful and you can ask them and they'll get that all sorted for you. Another little kind of um, extra we're going to put in is each day we're going to do a little game. Okay. And so today we are going to do, it's all about words. Okay. So it's about you kind of listening out for certain words that I might say. Um, if you go onto the internet, you will be able to see it's a little board of pictures that we've kind of got and that is um, the the words that you are looking out for so it's things like chicken for example it's things like basket I mean you know randomly randomly me and me and Corinne are going to be sort of uh, standing there in a chat and I'm going to be like right I'm that chicken and she'll be like what <laughs> so you know anything could happen um, well there you go there's a couple there already but if you hear any of the words and I will show you the graphics for that send a message in all you need to do is either get in touch on our website and there's a little box there where you can send a message live to us or or send us an email um, to studio at hobbymaker.co.uk and that will automatically throw you straight into the draw. Now, at random points during today's show, we will announce a winner and you will get £10 credited to your account, OK? It, I, I have no idea how many winners that Paul's going to go for, um, but you can have a look here. This is called Drop the Easter Word, OK? I don't fully understand why passport's in it. Do you? Is it holiday or is it passport? Oh, maybe it's holiday, yeah. I mean, there we are. Yeah. It would probably make more sense, wouldn't it? Uh, I, I'm thinking it probably might be holiday. You know, send in the word that you've heard. And if it's right, so it could be. So Corinne might be in the running now. <laughs> it's like, um, and then, of course, you can um, you will get entered and we'll, we'll announce kind of throughout the show. People who have won and £10 will be automatically kind of put in to your uh, your basket as well, which is a lovely extra. On top of that, please get in touch sending us your makes. We're doing share your makes now every single day. So you can send through your pictures of anything that you've made from bits that you've bought from, you know, Crafter's Companion, Burt's and Gert's are on in a little bit, um, but it could be anybody, it could be Hunky Dory, and any of these that get shown during our shows automatically, again, go into a prize draw, and on the last Saturday of every month, we will give somebody £100 credited to their account, so um, just for sharing, just for sharing your makes, and then one of you will win that £100 as well, so there's a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot going on. Okie dokie, um, let's talk about what we have here. Now, Corinne is with us. Hello. Lovely to see you. Thank you. It's really good to be here. I it's, it's off. I mean, I've done a few with Crafters Companions. Yes. First this show with this you. is my first solo show. So oh, I came out down okay. when we did a takeover. It was yeah. Dan and myself. Of course. And Sarah was on Zoom. Mm -hmm. So today, my first solo yes. show. So it's really, really exciting. Well, we've got a good show lined we up as well. We have. <laughs> yes. So we are going to be kicking off with this amazing oh. new bundle. Okay. Yes. Um, did you want, you can pop over. Oh, shall I come over? Yeah, right, yes. Kind of so this is a UK mm -hmm. exclusive. Yes. yes. Okay. You can't get this mm -hmm. anywhere else Amazing. at all. Yep. And also, not only is this a UK exclusive, mm -hmm. so it's not launched anywhere else, we've given you an extra die set. Okay, yep. so we are actually going to throw that in for free with this whole bundle. So if you want to own the full bundle, then this one, like you say, just today, exclusive here at Hobby Maker, we are throwing this one in for free. You can only get that from us here at Hobby Maker, um, which is absolutely amazing. And of course, as we always do here, yep. 
We always do a deal. Oh, so £74.95, price that you would expect to get all of these. It isn't going to be the price that, that you're going to get today. We're going to get the price straight in and then we'll kind of just discuss <laughs> exactly what each of these um, sort of Slimline dies actually give you the chance to get. So today, big, big saving coming in. We're talking at an over £15 saving. If you want to get the big bundle, there is as well on the web, which we'll come to shortly, two smaller bundles and the chance to get the exclusive one uh, to Hobby Maker as well. So each of these yeah. have three different they do. dies in. So they, we call them nesting dies. Now, mm -hmm. when somebody says to me nesting dies, I yeah. think of a set of circles or a set of yes. squares. Mm -hmm. Or if I'm being extravagant, maybe we've got a set of hexagons, you <laughs> yeah. know. Uh -huh. But not these. These are our decorative edged mm -hmm. nesting dies. Now, they're a slimline. And slimline mm. refers to the shape. And it's a shape, shape that um, Crafter's Companion do so well. Yeah. And it's a really lovely shape to work with. Mm -hmm. The dimensions are really, really nice. And the results are fantastic. Mm -hmm. Whether you're making them on boxes, whether you're using them as box uh, bag panels mm -hmm. and they're going to be on your cards I can even see these in scrapbooking pages yeah. they're going to work for them all and when you sort of just inter intermingle the different mm -hmm. colors maybe add in a drop shadow mm -hmm. they are going to look beautiful yeah. they are so so pretty they really are. And I sort of feel a lot like, you know, these sort of sizes and, and shapes that we're sort of talking about with these nesting dies, it has become so popular, hasn't yes. it? So it yeah. used to be kind of about those sort of bigger sizes and things like that. And yes. suddenly you're thinking, well, these are very letterbox friendly if you want to send, yeah. you know, anything through the post. And, and I just think that on top of that, the designs of these are, yeah. are really special. They're I mean, really pretty. Yeah. And they're very different. When you look yes. across the rate, if you sort of scan across the five of them, mm -hmm. there's no repeats, there's no duplication. No. Mm -hmm. They are very, very different. So should we jump straight in and Let's. look at the first one? Yes, definitely. So our first one is our Latina. Mm -hmm. So you can see I've got the actual dies on the board here Brilliant. so that you can see how big they are. Mm -hmm. So these are lovely. And you get the three dies. Now, there is no cutting blade on the inside. So although those look uh, those mm -hmm. look hollow yeah that's so that you can get the most for your money so we okay. use the the metal in the middle to cut the next one and the metal in the middle to make Brilliant. the next one yeah. so these are going to cut as solid mats mm -hmm. so if i sort of show you so i've got um what we call our concept suite you uh -huh. can see them on here how yes. they go down just in black and white just mm -hmm. to show you how easy they are the sorts of things that you could be creating mm -hmm. you could be creating oh, easel cards so mm -hmm. all we've done is we've just put some acetate in and popped it back in after we We've cut yeah. it out and use the smallest one as our stopper. Gorgeous. You can be using them across your cards, just like that. You know, you can yep, yep. Um, stagger them up together. Mm -hmm. Oh, for gatefold cards. Oh, now, now this is sorry, get the right way. This uh -huh. is actually a fold back card, but this would look lovely as a gatefold <laughs> yes, card. Yeah. It would be beautiful. So we've only used two of the three yep. on there. But then if I add in a pop of colour. Beauty. Wow. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So what we've yeah. done here is we've done a drop shadow mm -hmm. just on those two. Or how about joining two panels together? Wow. And, you know, then mm -hmm. if you've got your smaller um, dies yeah. from all your different brands, or, you know, like we've mm -hmm. done on there, the sentiments of different brands, mm -hmm. bring them together, all your gorgeous papers. Now we have got some absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous 12 by 12 paper pads on today. Yes. And I'm going to be using those in some mm -hmm. of my demos. Yeah. But they are so, so pretty. It's I feel just collection. sort of like when you look at them as well, you're sort of thinking, right, this could be your christening card. You know, this could be your wedding card. Then you could go just for your everyday card. Your yeah. Congratulations. They, they just work with everything. Yes, they're going to... Yeah. Into your and they're going to bring in well. all your other... Um, dies as well mm -hmm. like you can see there your yep. sentiments your butterflies exactly. your, your, all your other little dies that yeah. you've got yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah so that was the first one brilliant mm -hmm. and then our second one is our fer ferrara 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 ferrara, ferrara. It's nice, ferrara. Isn't it? yes. yeah <laughs> and so this you know absolutely mm -hmm. gorgeous so i love the shape on this mm. i want to, you can see it on here look at that this Wow. edging is gorgeous look at that with the lid look how fine they cut down there with those little um sort of slithers cut out and the detail they Amazing. are beautiful yeah so what have you got there you've got a gorgeous now that's got oh, an extra Mrs. piece look so, at this. there we oh. go it's an easel card there we go and that's what's so nice about having the three different cuts as well isn't yeah. it that you can perfectly do it yeah you've got your easel style, but yes. look at this <gasps> how about this for a gift bag do you oh. make your own products and you want to make a gift bag to mm -hmm. put them in 
or are you thinking oh wow. yeah i've got a little gift for someone mm -hmm. um you know are you are you planning uh if you're planning a wedding these yep. could be your favors or your mm -hmm. thank you gifts for your bridesmaids yeah. or something yeah. like that they're going to look beautiful okay. but then as soon as we sort mm -hmm. of change up the colors oh, i'll give you yes, oh, going to give you that one i'll take this one there really we go nice. look at these aren't wow. they beautiful just by bringing in your papers mm -hmm. adding them again keeping with that drop shadow wow that is gorgeous oh wow i mean that 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 is just absolutely fabulous isn't it like a How reverse fold out. back card isn't it? yeah. so so clever that you're actually seeing just there i just feel like they make everything look so much more expensive yes, as well they do don't they yeah very very elegant yeah. so those two Brilliant. if you want a one bundle yes. on their own if you wanted yep. them to so we have got a smaller bundle as well yeah. we can bring the graphics in so you can get them all individually if you just want one of them you can or you can get it in the full bundle with a bigger saving or of course this is the individual bundle mm -hmm. for those two so if you want to get them we'll bring that straight in and get the price up for you on that um, which is the the Nufo bundle it's lovely really as well because I always think what's so brilliant about what Crafters Companion does is you kind of make sure there's something for every person exactly you exactly know. I mean yeah you might you might look mm. at this and say oh I don't want all five so you can now cherry mm. pick at, yeah. but still get a deal exactly so that's still it. five pound saving yeah, so exactly. if you want to get two still saving five pounds on those um, so the other uh, one we'll bring the bundle in so this is for the next two that we're going to mm. talk you through as well so we can bring the price so this that. is your Medina mm -hmm. yeah Medina and I love this look at this 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 one yeah. reminds me really art deco mm. feels to it Definitely. so you you've almost got your oval here and then it's been elongated yes. can you see when you look at that I love that look at the curves on here That's now great. these are going to cut beautifully I'm going to be cutting these in very shortly mm -hmm. using my Gemini using my yes. new colour Gemini. Gemini yes this would be perfect it's look gorgeous. at this for your Z fold cards oh, how wow. beautiful mm -hmm. is that that works gorgeous yep. ah you see somebody's thought along the same mm -hmm. lines your gatefold cards they yeah. fit yeah. perfectly mm -hmm. and then let's have a look I give, oh i let you that that's oh pretty, yes isn't that's it? so pretty and then again look at this we've got an easel card mm -hmm. here so we've repeated the stepper and then we've just pop them along mm. there but they are so so pretty they really are and I, th I think it's the fact that they they layer up so well together i mean you yeah. could just use one they are nesting dies so they are yeah. they are consec concentric to actually to consecutive size let's yes. call them that yeah, one yeah yeah <laughs> Yeah, and that is why they do just look so, so spectacular together. Um, they're, in, you know, available individually as well. So that's that one. But that one with the bundle also comes with this next one that we'll yep. show you as well. Which is the Luca, mm -hmm. which is absolutely beautiful as well. Mm -hmm. Again, look at this. It's got this, mm -hmm. it still feels like it's got this art deco yeah. vibe about it. It feels too. quite Parisian to me as well. Yeah, it's, very it's glamorous. beautiful, isn't it? Mm. Yeah, look at this. Look at this detail wow. on here. Absolutely yeah. beautiful. But if you don't want to use all three just use yes. two of them um to, like that you know i'm mm -hmm. thinking then you could almost do another one on that yeah. side and the great thing is is you can cut into them so you could actually Definitely. use this uh -huh. one to cut an aperture in the next one and we're going great to do idea. a few things mm -hmm. like that yeah and then oh look at that i love the spring isn't that perfect spring color yes isn't it really beautiful oh. and then that's oh. so different i mean when you just think the difference of those two cards yes. that have been created together in it so that's a gate um gatefold card look there we go look yep. at that it's so nice there we are that. look at that oh so Very we're going at three o'clock yep. we've got some stamps with some sentiments yes, we have going to look lovely yep. they're perfect uh, thank you so much always get in touch uh hi jackie hello so happy to see corinne back on tv i followed her craft journey and find her really inspirational stunning in purple oh too. thank That's you nice. <laughs> <laughs> That's a lovely message. Um, so yeah, them two come as a bundle, and then this is the exclusive today yep. that you've thrown in for free if exactly. you want the full. Exactly. Oh, um, I'm going to do my first mm -hmm. demo on this. this Go is on. Okay. Pal Palari Palerino. Uh -huh. I've practiced this and I still forgot. Palerino. Palerino. Uh -huh. I just love this. Now, Me too. I think when you see this on the oh. die, you don't realise. Oh, Malting. Well, you don't realise what it's mm -hmm. going to look like till you actually cut it out. Now mm. look at this. Look at this beautiful scallop so good, edge. Isn't, it? isn't this gorgeous? Mm, yeah. I do love this. Now this cannot be bought yeah. anywhere mm -hmm. else. This is totally exclusive here, and yeah. it's not going to be available on no. anywhere else. So, it, so yeah, it's yeah. not. That in a week's time you'll find it anywhere, anywhere else. Anywhere else, no. no this okay. is so only exclusive to us here at Hobby Maker and first day today, brand yeah. brand new for you to be able to get that. And again, if you have a look at you know the couple oh, of bits that have been that. created. Oh wow. Aren't those colours stunning. <gasps> yeah. Striking colours. Yeah. Oh that just that just works so well. And it's lovely that you can change your sentiments, you know, as well, depending on whatever you're creating with yeah. these. And they all sort of work, you know, dream there, wonderful here, um, lovely opportunities. And like we say, we're bringing you the stamps in at the three o'clock hour. So if you want anything like that, you can get them. Mm -hmm. Now,
Now, these are all available, so we've got them all there individually in the two smaller bundles as well as the large bundle, which will give you the biggest saving. But on top of that, um, okay, we are going to give you the final chances to get the Gemini, which I know yes, you're going to obviously demo with. Now, we um, brought this to you only a couple of days ago, so on Wednesday, Sarah was mm -hmm. here doing the brand new launch. Candy yeah. Floss was the name that was. Yeah, in the it end. was. Perfect, isn't it's it? A, Perfect that name. works really well, yeah, doesn't it? It does. So we have got less than, I think we've got about 25% left, that's it. So the whole, almost all of them, apart from that last 25%, went on the first <laughs> show. So I do think they will completely sell out today. Yeah. Um, it's so different just in that colour. I, I yeah. loved the Gemini before, but now I'm like, I just... this. It, yeah, exactly. It, just mm. see how it, it's just going to fit in oh, with your deco. Beautiful. It looks just so pretty, yes. doesn't it? Uh -huh. And it's, it's, I love it. It's a full A4 size. Mm -hmm. so the, the plates are slightly bigger. Yep. But it's not going to be intrusive in that colour. It's it's Definitely. just seems to make it sort of mm -hmm. fit a bit more in the background, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, it does. And of course, we are throwing in with this first launch that we had. We are giving you the goodie bag for free. Oh, I didn't yeah. know that. But the goodie bag's worth over seventy-five pounds. Oh wow! So you're actually looking at pretty much paying a hundred pounds for the Gemini and then getting thrown in that goodie bag that is worth over seventy-five pounds. But it is an exclusive machine. I think there was only ever a thousand commissions, right. so it's it's a very very exclusive opportunity. But it's only the these first ones that we brought to the launch, which I think was the first 500 that come with the goodie bag. Right, okay. So once, once they've gone, you know, you will then just be paying the 179 yep. that you normally pay for the Gemini. So um, absolutely jump in and take advantage of this. <laughs> um, if you did miss out, you know, on the launch day, I know a lot of you are saying, we can't watch at this time. Well, you know, this this is the time to get it. Um, only a couple of days ago. Well, people were working on Wednesday. Mm -hmm. Bank holiday for a lot of people know, today, isn't it? Yeah, and that's why it's lucky you're back in and you're thinking, well, bank holiday for most yeah. people. And, and what a treat to get yourself for Easter. I know. I know what yeah, better than an Easter egg, isn't it? It's going to look better <laughs> on you than an Easter egg. <laughs> exactly. Get some nesting dies and then get this. And of course, it is that one-off poster and packaging between midnight and midnight as well. So you can get this whole, you know, this whole bundle, and then you can get that, and you're still only paying that one-off pay, which is the absolutely pounds, perfect, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, absolutely. Shall we see how it works? Shall we have a go? Yeah. Sure. Let me move so. over this yes, way then, yes. and we shall have so a we're look. Going to pass over to Corinne, and um, she will be able to just show us exactly kind of how you use the Gemini if you've not seen it before. Um, for me, I just think, you know, a die and embossing machine is something that every crafter yes. needs. Yeah. yeah. Now, you're going to get a full instruction mm -hmm. booklet with it to yep. show you how to use it. But the plate combination is so simple. For regular die mm -hmm. cutting, it's a four plate combination. So you have two of your cutting plates. You have a, a plastic shim and you have a magnetic shim. And the magnetic shim is mm -hmm. so helpful. Yep. You're holding everything where it wants to go. So all I do is I cut into one of my cutting plates and then I have my other the two plates and okay. uh, three plates together mm -hmm. so let's go let's go into that way so let's go straight away and let's cut our gorgeous palo palomo palomo mm -hmm. palomo. Brilliant. palomo yes if you say it quickly it sounds <laughs> yeah it's when I suggest and think about it. Right, so I'm going to take a piece of tape. I'm going to take this. So this has been cut and it's quite a uh, snug fit. So these these dies are just about the exact same width as a piece of A4. Okay. So you can yep. get you can see I can get that just mm. out of my A4. So then I'm going to put my um, magnetic shim on. Then I'm going to put my clear plastic plate mm -hmm. and then I'm going to put my other cutting plate on. Now the plates do bend slightly, but all you need to do is keep turning them round yeah. and yeah. it will do. So line it all up, offer it up to the mouth of the machine. They are felt it grab and as soon as mm -hmm. it grabs, it does. Now, if I only had a small die, yeah. so I did a little butterfly, put it in the top corner, I've got a pause and I've got a reverse button. Fab. So I can just reverse it back. So if I didn't have a lot of room on the other side, mm -hmm. I don't need to get it to come all the way out. Yeah. Now, it's such a quiet machine and it's such a quick machine. Mm. It's about so fast. 15 seconds. It's yeah. Just, uh, well, that that one felt, felt to me particularly fast. Mm -hmm. yeah. Now, look at that. I've not put in any shims. Now, if anybody mm -hmm. has followed me crafting, you'll also know I used to love a shim on my die cutting because it just felt like mm -hmm. I was getting the perfect cut. I didn't oh, need look. that at all. Look at that. Mm -hmm. I haven't had to poke a piece out. You know, I haven't tapped anything. Oh, I haven't poked anything. Yeah. That has just cut absolutely perfectly. Oh, yeah, amazing. I love this. So that was the largest one. Mm -hmm. Then I'm going to come down with my next ones and I'm going to come in this gorgeous, gorgeous. Let's mm -hmm. go. Now, this card, no, yep. this card, if it isn't on this show, no, it's not for this. Mm -hmm. We've got some... Um, our gorgeous, gorgeous uh, cardstock available at some point today. Mm -hmm. This yep. is yep. our 
we Centura Pearl. So yeah, if you look, we've brilliant. got the dark chocolate, mm -hmm. which is this one, the dark chocolate, and also the mink. Yeah, so these yeah, are the yeah. two that I'm using just now, just so that you know. Yeah. And uh, we've got them on at yeah, some point Yeah, we can bring today. them up live. Oh, perfect. Uh, yeah, no problem. Yeah. I should have said I was using those, but I wanted to just to use different colors. So yeah, now yeah. I can pop one on there. So I'm going to go with mm -hmm. my largest one with my chocolate onto there. Well, actually, no, I want that oh, one. It's 3 I've just realized as well for the 10 I know. pack. I know. Brilliant. But while you're not paying any more P&P, &P, mm. yeah, because yeah. that's not the sort of thing you want to be paying P&P &P no, on. No, it's true, yeah. But you know, throw it with free yeah. with anything else. So I can put my chocolate one on there and I'm just going to do white on here. Now, most of these I'm going to cut out. I've, I've already cut some, you so see, you don't need to mm -hmm. see. But I want to show you. I like people to see me die cut them mm -hmm. because it's I could stand here till the cows come home saying yep this is going to cut perfectly yeah. mm -hmm. but you don't know what I've done behind the scenes mm -hmm. to make it cut how many times have I run it through my die cutting yeah. machine yeah. how much have I had to poke out mm -hmm. how much have I had to shim I want you to see that I don't have to do any yeah, of that yeah, yeah, yeah. so uh -huh. I, I always like to at least cut them once mm -hmm. to show you yeah. even if I need multiple cuts so that you can see yeah, yeah I'm telling you to now I always look on the back what you should see when you're die cutting is what looks like a perfect pencil mm -hmm. line. Can you see that yeah. just looks like yeah. a grey pencil line? Oh. If I can see that, then I know uh -huh. it's cut. OK. That, that's actually almost like the edge of the die come through. Right. And that yeah. tells me that it's perfectly cut. Mm -hmm. Now, all I'm going to do is I'm going to give it a little tap yeah. just to release it from mm -hmm. the die. OK. But there we go. Look at that. Every piece has popped out. Isn't that perfect? Yes. And the same... For this one, this mm -hmm. one's already, it's half out the die. There we go. Look at mm -hmm. that. I haven't had to poke a single piece of cardstock. It's so clean and yeah. um, perfect, isn't it? So I've got three different layers. Now, just layering those up. What I could be doing is I could take this one and I could die cut. Oops, I've got a piece of tape still on there. Mm -hmm. I could die cut that mm -hmm. in there to give me a really beautiful mm -hmm. aperture and then mm -hmm. pay, put that one back yeah, in. And it's going to look absolutely beautiful. Yeah. We might have a go at doing that and show you just some of the different ways you can do that later. But let's make a card nice and quickly mm -hmm. just for the first one yeah. so we can see. So let's, where were we? We had one, two, and where was my third one? There we go. We've got those. All mm -hmm. oh, right, let's move those out of the way. Let's at least try and be a clean and tidy crafter for a few minutes. It's hard, isn't it? We've got so I'm, much oops, That was my tape pen. <laughs> oh, there we go. Right, I want that because I want to show you how perfect these are. Yes. So yes. I've got these. So I've got mm -hmm. some cardstock. Now, what was this? This is from our traditional florals paper pad. Okay. So absolutely beautiful. But look at this with the... Um, Beautiful, beautiful chocolate brown cardstock. Mm. So I'm using my tape runner, Crafter Companion tape runner. So the um, the solid one yep. is ultra strong mm -hmm. and it really, really is. It's absolutely brilliant. So I can pop my chocolate We've just on. actually got these back in stock. So the last show I did, um, we had the 4 for 3 deal and they all completely sold out. Did they? Um, and we've just managed to get 99 back in stock. So oh, wow. many. Um, but... How, Oh, we've got half, oh, 50. I'm wrong. I thought we'd got 99. I'm like, <laughs> Paul's like, no, we've got 50. So we will just pop those in as well because I always think that this is just an absolute essential. Um, and it is a four for three that you're actually going to get there. So you'll get two of the dotty and yeah. two of the extra strong. Yeah, and I'm going to show you how, right, I'm going to show you now mm -hmm. why you want to use the dotty. So let me just get a piece of scrap paper. So I've put my two layers on here. Yeah. So straight away, how strong is my card going to be? Because I'm building up that strength by mm -hmm. adding on those extra layers. And and then I'm going to get the white one that we've just cut. Yes. Oops, cut there. And I've also got the same in chocolate brown. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to come in now. I'm going to swap it around for my dotty tape pen. Yep. And what we're going to do is I'm going to run along here. So now how the dotty tape pen works is it won't, um, oops, going right to the edge. It won't um, give you strings and everything. Mm. So it'll really perfect mm -hmm. for when you've got detail. Yeah. For a bit of strength, I'm going to then... The, the, the straight one is definitely the stronger. Okay. It uh -huh. really is. Now, I could have done that straight on my glass mat, but then I would have just had to have cleaned up all the little bits of tape. Yes, so yes. you can see I've got no strings mm. coming through there. And then all I want to do is just create a tiny drop shadow. Mm -hmm. So a drop shadow is where I could put... If I put them level, mm -hmm. you can't see the chocolate brown behind. Yeah. So all I'm going to do is I'm just going to do them so you can just see... Can you see a little mm -hmm. border? Yeah. all the way around so i'm just like holding that there and it's almost as if i've gone round and i've edged it but can you see yeah absolutely beautiful drop shadow mm -hmm. on there and then i've got um 
the two, the next two layers, and I'm going to do exactly the same on there. Let me see. Actually, I could probably just, just do that down the middle for there. And then I can drop shadow. So this is the chocolate and the mink. Mm -hmm. oh, look at that. I've got a piece in there. Let's, there we go. I can see. Yeah, I love there. those colours together. They are really super smart, mm -hmm. aren't they? They look really expensive, I think. Mm -hmm. So again, just drop shadow. Now, I drop shadow off to the left. I always like to, there you go, that way. Yeah, yeah. I always like to drop shadow. It's just mm -hmm. my personal preference, yeah. how I tend to do. So wait, let's bring this back in. So we've mm -hmm. got here. So then I'm going to pop my first layer on. Now, I have put some um, foam tape on there. Yeah because I do like a little bit of height. I don't want to go Idea. too mad yes. that mm -hmm. it's not going to be postable. Um, yes. yeah. You know, if you go too high, then it's you're going to mm -hmm. struggle. Now, when you put tape on like this, obviously the two outside pieces are going to anchor it down. Mm -hmm. If you don't want, if you struggle getting the back off, you don't actually need to take the back off that. That's there uh -huh. for support. Yes. If yeah. you don't take the back off, I'm going to leave that one on, uh -huh. then it's still going to support your card mm. absolutely perfectly. Because uh -huh. you can see it's not dipping. Definitely. But it, yes. Yeah. It's just a yeah. quick tip if, you try, if you're in a rush or you're struggling. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So then I'm going to get the same paper again. Mm -hmm. So that's then going to give the... It's almost going to look like an aperture through. Can you see? Because... Mm. We can see. Now, the, oh, I love that. the pressure in the Gemini is so good. I haven't had to go in with my embossing mat, but I've got a gorgeous embossed detail mm. all the way around because I've got such amazing yeah. pressure on there. Then I'm going to come in with my next layer, and again, mm -hmm. we can go down here. Now, I'm just putting the tape down the centres, but I could easily go over the edge with my um, dotted tape pen, mm -hmm. but I think that's going to hold. But look at that. Isn't wow. that really, really uh -huh. gorgeous? And then the final one I'm going to come in with is the smallest one. And I have actually just put some more um, foam tape on the back just to give it a little bit of a lift. Mm -hmm. So those are our foam pads and they are super easy to release. I've never known foam pads yep. like it. So there we go. Pop that. So there is my card. Now, once I've got to this point, mm -hmm. it's entirely up to me how I go with this. This could be for so many yeah. occasions. We could just leave it like that. Mm -hmm. So all I've got is I've got my fabulous and I've done exactly the same. Still drop shadowing off mm -hmm. to the left. And I've we love to use our Xyron um, sticker maker. They are perfect okay. for uh -huh. putting the adhesive on the back. I could use my dotty tape yep. pen or yep. you could use um, your Xyron or anything like that. Or I could just go in with my um, glue mm -hmm. with my fine tip applicator. It's entirely up to you, whichever works for you. There we go. Mm -hmm. So I can put my fabulous on. And then these tape pens are so good. I can come in here with my tape pen. Yep. I've never been able to use a tape pen to apply ribbon that's before. There we go. And that's going to hold perfectly. Oh, and wow. how about that? Fabulous, because I think it is. Yeah, I think it is. And I mean, that was so, so quick as well. I know. To actually use all of them, you know, nesting dyes exactly. and stuff together as well. Yeah. And, and it just looks incredible, doesn't it? It does. Because of the layering it? that you've got. Yeah, I've got no gems, mm -hmm. no beads. No, didn't don't need, need it. it. It's all there in the detail, but how beautiful is that? Oh, it's fantastic. And like you say, you could have put any sentiment in the yep. middle there because that yep. would just work across yep. everything, really. But having the machine that yep. I knew is going to cut first mm -hmm. time yes. just takes the pressure yeah. off. And I just, it, that helps with the speed. Mm. I have, didn't, wasn't poking bits out and messing. Exactly. It just went through. Yeah. Now, that, remember, is your exclusive die. Mm -hmm. So yep. that die is only available here. So that's why I wanted to show you that one first. Yeah, which is amazing. So if you want to get just that, you know, the machine is available, as we say, just these first ones that we're doing, this first launch is, is giving you that, that free goodie bag. So there is, um, you know, £79.96 of the goodie bag. So it's making this about £100 instead for the Gemini. Um, We've, we've not got many of those left, so take them. But if you want to get that exclusive die as well today, so it's this one that is just here. And of course, in each of these um, little packs, you have got three of those dies, you know, all in those different um, sizes that you can see them, nesting dies that you can use together, as we were seeing Corinne do. But this is only here at Hobby Maker, okay? Only here. So yes, of course, if you want to, you can get um, all of, you know, these together, or you can just take advantage of this one 
on its own and, and get it as a one-off opportunity. As the bundle, $59.99 or this on its own, I think it was $15.99 on that as well. Now, it is of course Easter, so we are running competitions throughout the whole of the Easter um, weekend. So you can see this, win your basket. So every time that you buy something, it's like you get a little entrant into this. And one of you is going to win your whole basket for free. Um, Dave will announce the winner on Tuesday. But I mean, if you think about it, if you paid one seven nine for the Gemini, you paid fifty nine ninety nine for these dies. You know, you bought some of the uh, bunting that's coming up with Burt's and Gert's next. Almost like the the more that you shop, the more you could potentially save with this as well, which is brilliant because you know the sun's out. We we've got a lot of flowers around. Um, you know, you you might be out doing a little Easter egg hunt, kind of looking for your chicks and your rabbits. Um, and remember, of course, as well, if you do hear any of those words being said throughout the show, which we have on that little picture card that, that some of you will have access to, just send in a message to studio at hobbymaker.co.uk or onto the website and we will give some of you £10 credited to your account throughout the day today. Um, so there's going to be a lot of like little extras kind of celebrate the Easter weekend. So get involved and fingers crossed we will be giving you a little extra freebie as well. Um, so well, well done. So 59 99 on that big, big saving, over £15 saving. And remember that this die here you can only get today um, from Hobby Maker. It's a total exclusive for us at Hobby Maker. Um, and those dotty pens and the, the strong tape pens as well, just to let you know, um, when I've brought them before, They've completely sold out. I've had so many messages on social media saying, can you bring more? Can you bring more? We have just managed to get these back into stock. They are on a four for three. So normally they're five pounds each. We are giving you one for free. So you'll get two of the strong, two of the dotty. And I mean, just in that demo alone, you saw how much you use them. Oh, yeah. I've, I've just used them all mm. the time since I've, I've yeah. been working with Crafted Companion. They just are my go-to all yeah, the time. Definitely. Yeah, yeah. I mean, everybody that we hear from always says they are the best tape yeah, pens. they really know, that, are. That they used. really are. The strength in them mm. is amazing. Yeah. Yes. And the amount. I mean, it's metres and metres, yes. isn't it, yeah. actually, of, of how much is in there. So they're there on a three for two as well. So you can absolutely take advantage of them right now. So well, well done. Sorry, four for three, I should say. Four for three. So you'll be getting paying for three and you'll be getting the fourth <laughs> one for free as well. Um, I do have um, some some card that I'm just going to share with you as well, um, just really, really quickly. So you've got the opportunity to be able to get the Centura that we can give you a chance to see. So this is 100 pieces of the Centura um, that, that you can actually have the opportunity to be able to get. Good saving once again with this. So all, yes. of, all of this. Yeah. Wow. It's 310 TSM, mm. so for okay. it's really good All construction weight. So you're going to be able to make your boxes with these. You could use it mm. for your card bases. Perfect for your mats and layers. But it cuts like a dream. You just saw me cut the yeah. mink and the chocolate, and we're going to cut another one from the mink in mm -hmm. a minute. Yeah. And they will cut like a dream. And that's what you need. You ne yeah. They're not going to crack. They're not going to peel or anything like that. The strength on them is beautiful. beautiful. And they've all got that lovely pearlized mm. shimmer to them. Yeah, you can't take your eyes off it. No, they can't. feel so nice as yeah. well. And like you say, you can feel the quality. So they're all going to be coming in those packs that you're getting there. So that is a whole 100 sheets that you're getting. And you're saving £7.95. And of course, it is only that one off PMP um, between midnight and midnight as well on that. So good, good luck. And those colours that are in that as well, like you said, the mink and the chocolate that you were using yeah. is fabulous. So that's, that's pennies per sheet, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, literally pennies per sheet. I mean, oh, let's, let's try and work that out. 27p a sheet. Can you? Oh, well done, because you can just take the. Yeah. <laughs> Tell maths wasn't my strong subject at school. I had a tutor on a Tuesday night to try and get my GCSE. So there we go. Managed to pass it after that, but uh, took a lot. <laughs> Thank you. <It's> okay. <laughs> uh, yeah. So yep, yeah, you can come through on that as well. Um, did you want to move across to we, another? We day? can, and I'm going to yeah. bring in just so you've got yes. it in front of you our luxury mixed card stock. Okay, brilliant. So this is beautiful. So I'm going to use the regal rose gold. Yeah. But we've well. got three we colours have. here. These are beautiful. So these are 250 GSM, mm. but they are, look at this one. Wow. Look at that. It's double sided. Mm. Absolutely gorgeous. And then you've got this that's encapsulated glitter. So nice. It's 
some people don't like glitter. I've got a friend who cannot mm -hmm. touch glitter, hates glitter, yeah, yeah. but would be quite happy to touch this because it doesn't yes. feel glittery. It's completely encapsulated. And yeah, isn't that gorgeous? Wow. Really beautiful. Now we've got three yep. different colored packs. Have you got all three there? I have, yeah. So we've got a bundle. So if you want all three of them, then you can get these on a three for two. Um, so you'll be saving 19 99 They're 19 99 so that's each. buy two, get one free? Yeah. Wow. That's good, isn't it? Yeah. Buy two, get one free. And again, I mean, you can just see that, that gold that you were talking about. It's actually really lovely that the yeah. glitter doesn't come off, isn't yeah. it? It doesn't, it's not, it's, it feels totally mm. smooth, doesn't it? It does, yes. But look yeah, at yeah. that. Um, yeah, the, you know, you can see that. Look at how the two colours work so well Don't together. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's amazing. It really is. It, Isn't it a classy gold? Yes. Some golds can be a bit yellow and a bit mm. uh, tinny Definitely. looking. Yes. No, these look really, really smart. Very so that's your gold. Yep. So then you've got your gold. silver. Uh -huh. so oh, wow. Look at that as well. I mean, the luster that's coming off I like know. that. <gasps> Beautiful, isn't oh, it? Yes. I feel like you, you wouldn't need, you know, to use much of this at all, no. but just like yeah, a little bit of that. just use little slithers yeah. of it, yes. And with those um, dies that we've got there, I mean, they're just going to work perfectly. I'm going to show you how you can cut that glitter card with these dies, because okay. you might think, no, yeah. they're not going to cut those, but they will. They will cut perfectly. Oh, yes, exciting. Okay, okay, so should we go through that yes. then? So yes. as we said, I'm using the Regal Rose Gold, mm. which I think is beautiful. Mm. It's almost got like a, a coppery tone it has, to it, yeah. hasn't it? Absolutely beautiful. And we're going to use our Latina die set. So this, you know, quite an intricate die mm -hmm. set to be tackling glitter cards. Yeah, but yeah. I can, you know, I have to stand here on TV mm -hmm. and, you know, and I put these through and I have to know that it's going to work. Yeah, and I never yeah. have any fears mm -hmm. about that. So I can pop my, put it the right way up, card yeah. stuck on, and then I can put that. And the great thing is, because it's a 12 by 12 pad, these are going to fit so easily. Mm -hmm. Now, when I tape, I always tape to the outside. I'm not going to take to the inside. This actually probably is not the best example because that wouldn't peel. Mm -hmm. But if I was using white card with the low tack tape, it might mark. Yeah, yeah. But it's a habit. I always tape to the outside, yes. yeah, to yeah. the waist, so I know it's not going to do. Now, yeah. if you want to, you can just put, sometimes people like to put mm -hmm. their dies on at a slight angle so that when the machine comes to them, it's, it's gradual. Instead, nice. if you put it that way, it's a hard start. Mm -hmm. So if you just turn your dies just slightly, it mm, just gradually. Really point, yeah. We often do. It's like, I think the example that was given to me mm -hmm. is when you're die cutting, think of it as if you're on a bike and yeah. a sleeping policeman, you know, the humps. Yes, yeah. So if you, if you started at the edge of a sleeping policeman and tried to start your bike there, yeah. it'd be really hard to go. <laughs> if you pull back a little bit, mm -hmm and pedal and then hit the sleeping okay. piece is so much yes. easier. If you went at a little bit of an angle, it'd be mm -hmm. even easier. Think yep. of your die cutting like that. So never ever, if you can help it, mm. start with your die up at the top because the, it's got to take the yeah, plates and the die. Mm -hmm. Always pull back a little bit and if slight you can angle. just slight angle, mm -hmm. you're giving it the best, the best start. Now, look at this. Look at that. Oh, Every oh, little nice. piece, I'm going to give it a little bit of a tap. Yep. There we go. This wow. is the regal gold, so I'm just going to poke a couple out just to, because I don't want to, am I just going through, yeah. I'm just going through all the waste ones here. It's amazing. Typical, isn't it? Right. Let's go, let's do it this way. Go through there. <laughs> yeah, there we yeah. go. That's the easiest way. Do it from that way. There. I didn't want to, there we are, look. Oh, wow. Look. There we go. Beautiful. Look at that glitter card. Uh-huh. Just poking those. I've never seen glitter card as good as that, you know. No. In terms of just how the light is coming off of every single part of it. But it's not peeled. It's not no. cracked. It's and look, you know, we can how close. I'm not hiding any bits. I'm not. I've not got my hand strategically yes, yeah, yeah. over a little piece. I can show you that and know that every single piece mm. has die cut. Isn't that gorgeous? Mm. So then we're going to come in with our next layers. Again, I'm just nesting. I'm going to show you some in a minute where we actually use these to cut apertures. But for a minute, we're just going to use them. Mm. So I'm going to take my. I've got my. Um, Mink again, mm -hmm. I do like that. that yeah, again, that was in nice. that um, bundle. So I think we have it singly, but together it's just gorgeous. Yep. And then let me trim this down. I've got some white. Mm -hmm. I can just, and then I can get them all through in one go. Brilliant. Mm -hmm. We can put that on there. Yeah. And let's just reuse that bit of tape. There we go. And we can pop that on there, there, and run those through. Again, just mm -hmm. pull them back a little bit. So it's not having to open. But look at this. This is the power of this machine. It's amazing, isn't it? Yeah. Every single time, every little piece. 
comes through. I feel as though, like, even if you're a complete brand new crafter, with that machine, you suddenly look like an expert. Oh, because it just does the work for you. And dies for me are a leveller. Mm -hmm. A die, I, I, if I, I've just done something for Crafters Companion, yeah. and they said, what is your favourite um, crafting, you know, mm -hmm. thing in crafting? It's die cutting. Yeah. Because die cutting for me is a leveller. And I don't know, do you craft? Yes. You yeah. do. But if you never crafted before, mm -hmm. and I gave you this die and this piece mm -hmm. of paper, mm -hmm cardstock rather you could get the same results as i could yeah exactly it, die yeah. cutting is such a level it, the experience is what you do with them after you've yeah. die cut them but i was saying this to my friend because she's just been left um a house uh, by her her aunt and she's got a craft room and her aunt oh, used wow. to kind of come to it and it's this amazing i went around to see it the other day and she was saying i don't know what to do with these things and she's got a die, die cutting machine machine. and she's got her stamping press and she's got like just so much you know cardstock and everything and she was like you know should i sell this i was like no <laughs> enjoy it you know yeah. like, you can literally start right from that sort of beginner's level but it's going to look so amazing with what yeah. you know kit she's actually got exactly. there exactly yeah now look at this Look at that colour combination. Oh, wow. Doesn't that look beautiful? Now I'm not going to go over top with this, uh, top with this at all. I'm just going to make a really simple card. So I've got a, pe a piece of card, and I did cut this myself. I promise. So I've got nine, nine, just over nine inches by eleven and a quarter, yeah. and then I've, I think it was three, three and three quarters. Yes, it was. I've scored at every three and three quarter. Can you see? Mm -hmm. You see it on that side a bit better. Yeah. So all I'm going to do is fold down there and fold down there. So I've got mm -hmm. three panels at three and three quarters. And I'm just going to just, sometimes I do that. And that's all I'm going to, that is going to be my card shape. A yes, really, yeah. You don't have to go out and buy fancy cards. Mm -hmm. So you've just got one, two, three, yeah. just from a piece of 12 by 12 cardstock. Mm -hmm. So I could have used my glitter card or anything yeah. and that's going to give me the perfect card base. Mm -hmm. And then I've just looked around and found some of my favorite card stocks. Mm -hmm. But I wanted to use that um, Regal Rose Gold. So if you remember in that pack, you had the glitter and then you had the satin. Yep. Isn't that, oh, the pearlites, isn't that absolutely gorgeous? Now, I thought this cut paper really worked because it was picking up the orange tints. Yes, now, I could have, yes. if I had put a purple, it would have looked completely different. Mm -hmm. But I thought, no, this is going to work yep. really, really well. So we can then pop this it's a double-sided mm -hmm. paper it's from our farmhouse collection just okay. in case anybody has already yep. got them and just wants to mm -hmm. have a look i've put a couple of little um liquid pearls on i've done that in advance just for for speed mm -hmm. because I, I do like those but i've only done it on the panel that's going to go in the middle just yep. i'm not going to do it on the outside ones mm -hmm. so i can put these on i did do a little bit of sticking before because yep. i thought once you see me stick once, you don't need to see me stick mm -hmm. three times. So we can pop these on here and go all the way along. But don't worry, you know, about fancy um, card bases. Mm -hmm. You can make them, you know, if you've got um, a, the scoring board that um, Sarah brings you, then, you know, that's going to be um, perfect mm -hmm. or, you know, your score. Yep. scoreboards that you might have whatever you've got you're going to be able to make the most amazing amazing card bases let's make sure I've and you can that. always jump onto our website now as well now it is live so if there's anything that you know we're mentioning here and you're thinking oh you know it's not in today's show it's really worth just jumping on to hobbymaker.co.uk and then you can find all of the different um, brands and, and companies that we're working with so if you go on to crafters um, com if you go on to crafters then what you'll actually find there is maybe like the scoring board you know maybe like the farmhouse uh, paper pads that you were saying about and you can go on there add them on and it doesn't matter how much you buy off the website alongside shows you'll still only pay that one off um, £3.95 uh, postage and packaging between midnight and midnight so you can see that they're really really easy to kind of get them so just type in whatever you want and fingers crossed you'll be able to find that as well which would be absolutely brilliant so just keep adding on anything that you'd like okay so let's just put a few foam pads mm -hmm. on the back of that gorgeous um, panel that we've just cut out so we can put yep. those on to there mm -hmm. just like that and then I've got some I haven't put a photo tape, I need to just put some foam tape onto those as well. So if I put, just make sure I do it the same. Yes, yeah. I've just used my, yeah. I've just got a really fine foam tape mm -hmm. I'm going to put onto here. Let's just, yes, let's do it this way. Yeah. So really fine foam tape. I'm sure people have got lots of foam tapes. So this is 
just about a one millimeter tone foam tape and it just it's enough to give it a little bit of a lift so it's almost flush yep, but yep. not quite mm -hmm. which i think is really really nice so take and take the first one i'm going to take my next one and yep. then we can lift one on there we go so mm -hmm. we can just lift and that's going to go on here now straight these are so easy to center up because look you've got mm. markings there markings there so you can just you don't have to worry about are these going to go what because look at that you can see that's going to line up there yeah that's going to line up there you never are going to create a wonky card with these because yeah. they just line up uh -huh. so so easy i was doing it i was thinking i've got all the markers mm -hmm. it's almost as if someone's so put me clever. a grid on and uh -huh. and helped me to line everything up because it just works yeah. perfectly and then that one's going to go in Lovely. there i've just yeah. got look at that how annoying is that there we go mm -hmm. there we are right so that's now going to go down the center of my card Beautiful. so we can put this on here put this one in the middle mm -hmm. there we go all the way down turn that over and put that now don't those colors look beautiful you'd think mm -hmm. You'd think when you first looked at that paper from the farmhouse collection, it's not going to go with a glittery bronze, but it I think it really yeah, does. Okay. It works mm -hmm. so well. Yeah. And then Maybe. there we go. Put that wow. onto there. Oh, nearly, nearly knocked that off again. It's all right, it's only the lid. Is it okay? <laughs> yeah. Oh, do you know what? Mm -hmm. I always say, every time I craft, I drop a yeah. die or I, oh, <laughs> just so clumsy in my craft room. Don't expect me to have a tidy craft room because I certainly haven't. Right, so we're going to pop that one on mm -hmm. there. Then all I've done is if you um, tune in at three o'clock, we've yes. got some stamps mm -hmm. and this is one of the stamps on the collection. So Lovely. I just thought we'd use that mm -hmm. and pop that in the middle just there. And then you can put that oh. like that. And how easy is that going to be? Mm. to transfer now if you wanted to you could be putting bows on you could be putting mm. butterflies down yeah. but i wanted to keep it quite clean and simple mm -hmm. really because i thought we've got a lot of detail in the mats and layers exactly. and i yes. didn't want to sort of digress yeah. away from that but how beautiful oh, look at that it's amazing so isn't it? pretty isn't it yeah it really is oh it just comes together so so quickly as well so when you think about it just by getting some of these nesting dies yeah. by obviously having the gemini and if you want that brand new exclusive color as well we've got the last few chances available um but you know by just kind of getting both of those things you can create something like that so so quickly as well and i always feel like when something is sent to you that has been made, you know, individually by somebody. It means so much more. Yeah, it, it, you there's keep a, it, don't you? Then there's cards. a difference between handmade and homemade, mm -hmm. and these are handmade, not yeah. homemade. Mm -hmm. It's that step up, that yes. next yeah, level. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. yeah, when my little boy sends a card, that's totally homemade. Do you know yes. what I mean? And it's like <laughs> it's just a mess. But you know, he's doing his best. He's yeah. great. But yeah, it's sort of like learning to just make it look, you know, so much better, which you can do with these amazing kind of, you know, opportunities that we have today. Um, so just to kind of recap on what we have available for you. The best way to get these, if you want the biggest saving, is to get all five. Now, that does mean, of course, that you will get the exclusive die as well. So this one is basically being thrown in uh, as a little freebie because $74.95 is the price you'd be paying for all of them individually. We are giving you this today for under £60, which is absolutely brilliant. So um, an in incredible chance. And of course, with that, that does mean that you are going to get 15 pieces because obviously there's three of these nesting dies in each one of these brand brand new today and you know you've you've really seen of course just how you know when you when i just sort of you know if i just pop a couple of these up you can just see just the quality that you know you can create from what corinne's been creating into some of these that have been done as well they're absolutely incredible and any sentiments you know any occasion i just yeah. think these work with um, so amazing opportunity with those. You can also get the smaller bundles. So if you're thinking, well, I'd love them all, but £20 a month at the moment, you know, I've not got, no problem. You can get these two together on their own um, as a bundle. We'll bring them straight in as well. Um, so those two you can get at £23.99. So again, a £5.99 saving. If you want the other two, you can get those as a little mini bundle. We're trying to make it so that everybody can get, you know, exactly what they want. Um, so those two are available 
in a bundle again with that £5.99 saving. But also all of them are available individually. And remember this one that we saw in the first card demo is completely exclusive to us here at Hobby Maker. So it is the only um, chance to be able to get that. I'll bring that straight in as well. But all of the others are, are there on the website as well, um, ex, you know, where you can get them as one of a kind pieces as well. Um, yeah, well done, well done. Right. Okay. I'm going speed. to whiz yeah? through <laughs> another card. I'm just going to okay. do a couple of cuts just Fabulous. to show you. I want to show you. Mm -hmm. So this one is the Fer Ferrera. 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 Yeah. So <laughs> I'm going to use um, my pink card. And I don't think that was in the bundle, but this is the same mm -hmm. as your, uh, well, it is Centura Pearl. So, you know, if you've got yeah. your Centura Pearl, you can be doing with that. Let's see, I can probably get, yes, I can get these two on. And then I've got the silver glitter mm -hmm. card mm -hmm. from that um, 12 by 12 pad. Yep. And we can pop those on to there and then run that through. And it's just, you know, it's going to work perfectly. So while that's going, mm -hmm. I have just taken a piece of A4. Um, no, this wasn't A4, it was just slightly bigger. So it was 12 by 12, that's right, to get it mm -hmm. to, to work. And I've just folded in the top over. So it's really, really easy to do. And there we go. Mm -hmm. And then we can cut these off. There we are. Look, at, look at that. This is through the glitter card. Yeah. Look at that straight through. Just pick that one mm -hmm. out because it's just hovering in there, but it's popped out straight away. How perfect. Look at that. Wow. So yes. classy, isn't it? <gasps> Beautiful. And then we've got our big die as well. Mm -hmm. And then we go. So I just need to poke out a few little bits and they just come straight out there we go perfect absolutely so let's have a look at what we can do so because this is going to be an easel card we, if we fold it over obviously we're missing a bit off the front mm -hmm. so i've just got another piece of cardstock to put onto there so that goes on really easy now always tape on your base mm -hmm. now if you try to tape onto this piece that you're going to stick on yeah. you might get the tape in the wrong place Course. You might over tape mm -hmm. and then it's not going to be an easel card anymore. You've, all you've done is just reinforce the front. Mm -hmm. So tape on the base, you know it's going to be in the right place and then there we are. Now, because we're using the gorgeous silver glitter, I've used the matte from that pack mm -hmm. as well. But how quickly does this come together using your tape runners as well? Yeah. It's amazing. So, there, so this is our Positive Thoughts paper pack, which mm -hmm. I think is beautiful. Yeah, and that's going to go on there. But doesn't it work well yeah. with the with the um, gorgeous silver? Mm -hmm. And then I've got another piece, and I'm going to put that inside. There we go. Mm -hmm. Speed crafting, and isn't you it? Can, you can speed. You can speed craft with these. These. This mm -hmm. is so easy to do. So we can take that, and then I'm going to do a very similar as I did before. We're going to pop this down here. And I'm just going to drop shadow the pink with that grey. And we can pop that on to there, just mm -hmm. like there. And then we can pop one. Yep. We're nearly there. I can mm -hmm. see Pauline and Jason waiting in the wings. <laughs> Look at that. So, so pretty. Wow. And then we can layer up so fast as well it is isn't it <laughs> yeah so good <laughs> <laughs> and then i'm going to put one on here now actually i'm going to take this mm -hmm. one i think yeah and then we're going to pop mm -hmm. this onto here and let's drop shadow i'm not going to go too much height mm -hmm. otherwise we will we'll struggle to post it yeah and then so that can go now look at that even though this is glitter the tape sticks perfectly yeah, to it. i don't have to it. worry at all uh -huh. now because i've got an easel card i need a nice stepper mm -hmm. so i've just done exactly the same so everything's running through can you see we've got the same we've yeah. got the same drop shadow the gray and the white pop that mm -hmm. down here and then make sure it lines up because otherwise that would be really annoying Pop yeah, that yeah. on there. There you go. You can Perfect. see this coming together. Mm -hmm. Next, we have our birthday. Let's grab that piece of paper that we've had. Oh, really quick. Just see if I can just yeah. get my sentiment mm -hmm. on. We can oh, put <laughs> that on to there. 
and I've got a little happy Incredible. put that on there and if you wanted to make it even prettier uh -huh. we can then take a couple of butterflies oh, yeah. which can come on to oh, our stopper wow. just there now I might have been tempted to have put a couple of gems on but mm -hmm. we're running out of time so <laughs> how about that just amazing. like that and you can be making so those up. I'll even straighten up the stopper in a minute <laughs> <laughs> yeah that, that's amazing it was like less than less than a, less than five minutes I think you yeah. managed to put that together so that shows how easy it is to use these nesting dies you know keep on coming through everything is on the website um, so you can of course snap those up we'll be doing stamping in the three o'clock hour so Corinne will be back with us Berts and Gertz is coming up though with us next we've got amazing bunting so stay where you are here at Hobby Maker we love seeing what you've been making, and it's our job to keep you inspired. So how does a £100 credit to your Hobby Maker account sound? Every month, we're going to be giving away a £100 credit to one lucky Hobby Maker's account. And all you have to do to enter is simply send a photo of your crafty makes to studio at hobbymaker.co.uk. We will be picking one winner each month at random, and we'll announce the lucky winner on air in the 5pm show on the last Saturday of every month. So what are you waiting for? Get crafting, get motivated, and get inspired with Hobby Maker. Our call centre is based in the UK and available 24 seven. Just call 0800 001 4433 or email help at hobbymaker.co.uk. Sandra Rushton and I am the owner of Sandtangle, which is a small business in Lincolnshire where it's only been going uh, three years or so but uh, we are really really passionate about what we do. So it's a very mindful form of art, that's its basic core. So if you can hold a pen and draw a line, you can tangle. And it's about that mindfulness, that relaxation and about you having a moment just for you. But as a result of you having that moment of putting pen to paper, you can create wonderful works of art. We do a lot of live videos, so we're very, very invested in education. We like to have people come to classes, but then of course the products that I design, we make ourselves. So we're involved in every step of the way, from the very, very, say the very first drawing, to how it goes onto the computers, to how it's machined, to even books that we still hand make. Oh, I'm looking forward to seeing where we go. It's the start of something new, and I honestly, I feel that. I feel that it's something exciting, and I'm, I'm so glad I'm in at the beginning, because I don't know where it's going, but it's only going somewhere good. This is the place for me. Join us this Easter bank holiday weekend here on Hobby Maker for our Easter extravaganza. On Friday, brand new slimline nesting dies from Crafter's Companion and Stamping Essentials. Burton Gertz with brand new Jubilee themed MDF. On Saturday, we've brand new woodware bubble balloon stamps from Creative Expressions plus Cosmic Shimmers. Be creative with Stamper's Friends Show Special and Screen Pal. And on Sunday, hunky-dory Easter deals with Dreamies and their launch show. And on Monday, Creative Expressions, Native Lighting and Crafter's Companion. Also, shop between Friday the 15th to Monday the 18th and one lucky person will win their Easter basket for free. Now, if you shop with us last weekend, don't forget to use your 10% off discount code. So a great lineup. Make sure you stay tuned this Easter weekend here on Hobby Maker. Hobby Maker are proud to work alongside some of the biggest brands in the industry. Keep watching for these brands and many more here on Hobby Maker. When you purchase anything on Hobby Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee, meaning that you can shop with confidence. Happy shopping with Hobby Maker. It is time to reveal our five Search for Star sewing finalists. Earlier on in the year, we asked you, our viewers, to apply to be our next 
Sewing Street Sewing Star and we were overwhelmed with the amount of applicants. We have watched hours of audition videos and we have somehow managed to narrow it down to our chosen five finalists. Our five very talented finalists will be on your screen next week from Monday the 4th of April to Friday the 8th of April. And we've dedicated an hour each day to each contestant to do their demonstrations. We're handing over the choice of the winner to you. So on the Friday after everybody's done their live demonstrations, the voting will be open. Join us all next week to help us choose our Sewing Street Sewing Star. Okay, we are back. Um, Berts and Gertz is here, so we've got Pauline and Jason. I, I mean, I know you've been here a few times, but it's my first day with you, which is lovely. Oh, I'm excited, I have to say, as well. <laughs> um, what we've got, and you can see a lot of this in front of me, it looks absolutely incredible, doesn't it? Now, a lot of you will know I lived in London for a long time, so as long as, you know, as soon as I saw these signs, I was like, oh, I love that, I kind of want that in my, my... I've just got a new house, so I've got, like, a record room at the moment. It's like a record oh. wine room. My only, like, child-free space, <laughs> everything else is just toys. And I'm like, I want that up. Um, so they're going to be coming up for you shortly, but we're going to kick off with the bunting. Now, we have got, obviously, Jubilee coming up. We were talking about the Commonwealths that are coming soon. Summer, you know, summer, it feels like the weather is really picking up at the moment. So if you're thinking of your barbecues, you're wanting to dress, you know, outside, maybe you've got birthday parties, weddings, you know, fates, anything like this, I think this bunting is going to be absolutely perfect. Now, we are going to give you the, the opportunity um, and the chance to actually get uh, a full, if you'd like to, you can get like a full um, bundle. So you are able to get the Union Jack and the, uh, and the plain as well I just sort of thought I'd just give you a little look just at these closely because it's beautiful the the detail that you can actually do on these as well yeah. um, and that they're just the perfect size yeah and with the union flags as well the crosses come mm -hmm. with them but they pop out so you can use them on uh, their own okay. if you want to cross a St George yeah um, you can use them within that or you okay. can use you know there's multiple different ways of using them yeah definitely that's that's so incredible and of course when we've got a bundle so you can see here that we are giving you 24 plane we're giving you 12 of the union flag and we are going to take money off of this so it is going to go to an under 20 pound opportunity for you to be able to get these and you can see the difference that's just there between both of those I feel as well that MDF so I mean behind you we've like dressed our set okay and you've got some bunting up there which is just material uh, which is fine but whenever you have material it doesn't last very long you know particularly if you've sort of you're ripping it up and down and things I think that because these are made from such a durable material you've got something you can use so much and for so long as well yeah absolutely you can use them you know uh, for a variety of different things mm -hmm. You could um, reuse them, yep. you know, for we've got numbers and we've got letters yes. within uh, the uh -huh. embellishments as well. You could even, you know, Velcro those on if you wanted to, if you wanted to take, reuse it for different birth, yes. you know, milestone birthdays. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And all of those embellishments will be coming up for you as well. I think we've got um, bits on the web, so you can always jump straight onto the web and take advantage of those as well. Um, but that is 19.99 for you to get all of that and I don't know about you but where I live we're talking about street parties at the moment for the Jubilee and you're sort of wanting to dress your house oh absolutely I mean the thing is with this you've got so many ways in which you can decorate the MDF yes you can you can glue fabric to it mm -hmm. you can um, ink it stain it spray it paint it mm -hmm. paper it there's, there's, there's just so much you yeah. can do uh -huh. it, you know it, it opens up a world of opportunities yeah, yeah. And, and I sort of feel as well that actually with the kind of deals that you're doing today I mean we've got there a pack of 12 of the union flags so if you just want the union flag on its own you can get that uh, and it's going under 10 pounds today which is crazy in my opinion but it sort of makes me feel like my little boy you know we he's just turned three so he's just at that beginning of being able to you know start with crafting and things like that but I feel like for 10 pounds I could actually let him get involved whereas I'd look at this and almost probably think maybe it'd be too expensive for me to let my children loose on but yeah. it's a sort of a whole family activity really but the fact that uh, one of the embellishment sheets that, mm. that Jason has, uh, has designed yeah um, is alphabet yeah. so you can then put alphabet on mm -hmm. and personalise things so Definitely. yeah it's really good and we we've shown you previously we've got the alcohol markers on the on the shirt yes yeah, yeah, yeah. you can use those direct to the mdf so even if you want 
Okay. It's try, you know, that yeah. it doesn't have to be messy with paints and things. Yeah, you can, you can just still just straight to those. Straight to yeah. straight to the MDF with it. Amazing. So glue, the alcohol uh, uh, glue and glitter if you want. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Wait, yeah. exactly. Uh, yeah. At the most simple kind of opportunity. <laughs> yeah. um, so this is the um, embellishments. This is the alphabet embellishments um, that we've got here as well, um, which of course you can get. And I really love that each letter is slightly different as yeah. well in terms of the font. Yeah. We, we don't do straightforward, <laughs> do we? <laughs> no, no. We don't want to. Do you? No, you do. <laughs> no. They're, they're all just that, that little bit quirky. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. They're beautiful. Um, and are they just really easy as well just to pop out? Yeah, yeah. yeah. They're just held in place by little tabs. You pop mm -hmm. them out. Fantastic. Um, and then, you know, you can use the waste as well to make... Mm -hmm. Um, you know, mixed media projects and things as well. Yeah, yeah. Another thing I love about them mm -hmm. is that you don't have to remove them and then um, yep. colour them. Mm -hmm. You can colour them within the sheet. Ah, okay. So it's less messy, yes. uh, you know, much easier mm -hmm. to do that. Definitely. Um, you know, like one, mm -hmm. wondering about whether I'm going over the lines or whatever, yep, yep. you just do it in there. It's fine. Fantastic. Um, and of course, you know, so you can pop those onto the bunting if you want to. You can have them individual. It's totally up to you. Now, we do also have um, an amazing bundle that I can just share with you just here. Now, just have a look at how much you are actually getting with this. Okay, I mean, the fact that you're getting the crowns that we're seeing. I mean, where did your inspiration come from for this? Um, the, the Pearly King and Queen are kind mm -hmm. of based on kind of childhood toys that I had. They're kind of a mixture of a couple of different kind of well-known brands, the kind of faces you'll yeah. probably recognise, uh -huh. um, and uh, certain toys that I had that wouldn't fall down. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. So th they, they kind of got that built-in kind of retro mm -hmm. with them because they're okay. that kind of style. Yeah. Um, and then, you know, I remember, you know, the Jubilee in 77 mm -hmm. when we were all taken out at school for picnics and we were all given a mug that for many years afterwards had toothbrushes in. <laughs> <laughs> it's all that kind of nostalgia yeah. for me that, you know, so the kind of royal events, the weddings mm -hmm. and the Jubilees, mm -hmm. we all know where we were for them. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and that's what kind of inspired it, really. Yeah, oh, it's fantastic. It's just so nice while you're here to kind of get first hands <laughs> of, you know, where it all, all comes from. And you can just see there's so, so much that, of course, is, is actually going to come with that. Um, beautiful with the crowns, you know, the way that you can decorate all of this as well. Uh, and, and yes, Queen, I like the, the sentiment. <laughs> a little bit of attitude. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I'm like, do I do a rap? Do I kind of uh, you know, get involved with that? You don't want to hear me do that, I'll be honest. <laughs> I... I I, sh I so wanted to get a hairband <laughs> and glue the crown mm -hmm. onto it and wear it. Yeah, that's I just didn't idea. get round to it. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, you can do it ready for the Jubilee. But imagine yes. um, going on a hen night, mm. a, a, a hen weekend or something like that. You idea. could decorate them up and. Uh, yes you know, go glitzy, whatever you wanted. Yeah. That's a really, really good idea. You know, you could almost put like a little sentiment on it for the bride on the back or something yeah. and like gift yeah. to them afterwards as well. Yep. Um, yeah, lovely little kind of activity to be able to do that. So all of that is coming within this one um, one bundle for 31.46. And it includes the street signs that I was talking about as well. So it's everything on this top row. Um, so we've got Carnaby Street. I mean, one of the best places yeah. in the world, in my opinion. <laughs> um, <laughs> just cool. And, and you've got to have Lambeth Walk if you've got a mm -hmm. Pearly Queen and King. Haven't you? You've literally got, yes, got you to have You just that. so want to just burst into song there. <laughs> I, I've been doing that at home all the time, making the samples. I've been driving my husband crazy. Really? Singing, yeah. <laughs> you but... can always do it here. <laughs> <laughs> we have Paper Dynamics, um, one of the people here. And every time I'm, I'm with Keith, he's like, did you know I used to be a dancer? Did you know I used to be this? And then I said to him, says, I do think he's winding you up a little bit on some of these things. I was like, so he wasn't a ballerina, no? You know, like, so maybe, you know, I... join forces with him. Yeah, and... yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, definitely could. I'm a dancer in my, as a hobby. <laughs> I, yeah, I've been dancing uh, jazz classes for the last 16 oh, years. Wow. I absolutely love it. Okay, yeah. I think take the first <laughs> we'll, we'll put our little, put our crowns on and be ready to go. Yeah. With, with the street signs as well, we've given you two yeah. layers to them to make yep. it easy to decorate them. So you've got the back layer you can just colour singularly. Mm -hmm. And then, as Pauline said, you can colour the letters in the frame that they're in, yes. pop them out and then just glue them down. I love and that. with that one, I used um, the... Uh, Inca Golds the, in the new colours that we have on the okay. show. Yeah, so the Inca Gold, so we'll be coming across to those um, as well. So we'll get all of those bits up as well so that you can colour those also. So you can see the two sizes, that, the, the two uh, parts that we've got to that and just how easy that is to put together. One of the bundle, I just want to get everything um, in for you at the lowest prices so that, of course, you can then 
take advantage of them and then we'll come across of course to some demos as well so we've got one uh, other chance here with a bundle which is the embellishments so um this is actually going to go to under 30 pounds for all of those so the fact that you are getting the the letters the numbers i love the mustaches i love the the queen toppers that we've got there as well look at that so, oh okay. Yeah, I mean, we'll give you just a couple of looks, actually, at, um, a couple of cards as well that have been made, because how amazing, thank you so much, is, is this? Look. And the fact that it has that, that sort of 3D element yeah. then to it, doesn't it? I mean, it's, it's so easy to do that, and the kids can do that for Father's yeah. Day. Yes, yeah, not, not long until Father's mm. Day, is it? And again, you know, something like that by using the crown, I mean, perfect for engagements, uh, hen parties, yeah. you know, baby showers, anything like that, Mother's Days. Look at this, every single one, lovely little jubilee um, opportunity that we've got there as well. Oh, this is fab, isn't it? Look at that. So that one in the background, I've used the stencil that we've got with the paper pad as well. Okay, yeah, so that stencil is going to be coming up with the paper pad as well. And this one, the adventure one, so if you are going travelling, some of us are getting to go on holidays again, <laughs> soon, maybe. <laughs> um, so you've, you've got that there. And I mean, we've got this on split pay as well, so we are talking £15 pounds, um, if you want to get this on split pay per month, which is absolutely lovely. There's so much you can do with these. Yeah, yeah. Aren't you? again with that one, I've used the twine, so it all just goes together I've tried to yes. kind of match it all together yeah so any of these kind of extras like the twine they will all be coming up you can always jump just straight onto the website and um, bits will be in the website as well so then of course you can just kind of add anything on that you want as well um, that's incredible amazing price shall we have a look at uh, your first demo with the bunting yeah sure right so I've got one of the um, filled in blocks not the Union flag, the, the other. So what we're going to do is we mentioned the paper pad, which we're going to feature more later in, mm -hmm. in the four o'clock show. Yeah. Um, but it's, it's Tim Holt's pad, so everybody wants this. Um, and we, we thought that the pad that's been chosen is great for the theme that we've got, mm. but great for correspondence and travel, which you will see later how it works yeah. so what I've done is I've picked out you see we've got pattern on the back and then we've got the uh, world map on here and we are actually <laughs> here right on the the map this little tiny bit there the British Isles um, I can't pinpoint Redditch but we're somewhere there okay so what we're going to do is take the bunting um, and I'm, I, what I'm going to do because I want to put something else on here I'm going to try and get the British Isles to the bottom now if I go sort of there and then straighten up I've sort of got it yeah yeah so what we're going to do is use my Gertz glue. See, I've lost it now, but I'll, get, I'll come back onto it. <laughs> and we've got the holes already in for the bunting, so you don't have to worry about that. That's far too much glue, so I will spread it out mm -hmm. a little. This glue, um, you really don't need a lot. It, a little goes a long, long way. Right, okay, Pauline, come on. Get yourself in gear. And British Isles. There we go, and then just straighten it up. Fortunately, it's got a pattern that I can straighten up. Yeah. Right, so give it a second to dry. You, you will have a little bit longer than I have mm -hmm. because we want to get more demos done. Okay, but then take, don't worry about scissors or whatever. I mean, yes, okay, I could have gone to the edge and not be so wasteful, but I did want the British Isles mm -hmm. in there. So all I'm doing is taking a craft knife, running it along the MDF, and out she comes. Yeah. Okay, yeah. as easy as that. Mm -hmm. So then now, British Isles, we've got down here. Lovely. Okay, that's lovely. Now the holes, all I've done is gone where you can use your knife and just poke, mm -hmm. right? Obviously, again, you have more time to let it dry. There we go. And then if you take the end of your paintbrush, perhaps a smaller one, something that will go through, or let's use scissors, and we can go through and just round that up a little bit. Mm -hmm. Okay? Let's get that one back on there. There we go, a little bit. You would say you have more time to, to do that. Yep. So then we've got that. So let's think about what we're going to do to decorate it. Now, on here, we've got 
adventure. So let's pop the adventure out. And again, what I like to do is perhaps use something just to push against. And sometimes it comes out one way better than the other. So whether you want to do it from the back, you see how yes. one way will come, it, you just go with it. So we've got adventure um, and perhaps we'll use one of the planes on this one. Mm -hmm. So let's pop that out there. Okay. So let's then think about what we're going to colour with. So I think, on, let's, let's go with the new colours that we've got. So on the Inca Golds, we've got the glorious blue and red. And this one is called um, Lava Rot. Lava Red. Lava... <laughs> <laughs> Lava red. Yeah. It's got and we've got, um, I'm not even, Stanley Blow, uh, steel blue. Okay. <laughs> so I think what we will have is a red airplane. Yeah. Okay. And just look at that. Now, if you didn't see the Incas before, they are a glorious product because they have so many uses. Mm -hmm. We can use them straight from the pot, we can use them with a brush. We can water them down and paint with them, uh, but they have this glorious sheen. Now we have the ink daubers. Mm -hmm. Go on your, your finger and a little bit of that on there. Yeah. And then our plane is suddenly gloriously red. Uh, okay. Mm -hmm. And I mean, it, it's great for kids to use as well. So easy to um, use. You just got to watch that they don't want to go right in the pot and get too much <laughs> out in one go. But the sheen on that mm. is really good. Yeah. So it's, yeah, it's really nice. Now, if you just go a little bit more, you can then get the colour a little bit more intense. But what I wanted to show is on the MDF as well, there is no need to um, prime it with, with gesso or anything first. We can go straight in with this. Mm -hmm. Now, these are lovely. Okay, um, when you're finished with your colour, you put this under the tap, it's water-based, so you just wash it away. And then, as you can see, we just can then use them and use them and use them. Mm -hmm. You can use them then on your inks if you want. Look at this blue. That is fabulous. So then we have our blue for our adventure. So, I mean, it doesn't have to be this colour, but I'm just, I'm trying to keep on the Jubilee theme, but with a difference. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we've got those. So let's pop those if back on there. Anybody's a child of the 70s like me. Yeah. And they remember the Jubilee cakes we had in the 70s. The icing was that, those colours. That colour. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that, that's what uh -huh. really struck me with those colours. <laughs> now what I'm going to do as well <clears throat> is just take this and with, with the residue that's on, I'm just going to ink that edge and just give it a little bit of colour there. You can bring a bit of the red in if you want as well. Um, and it just works so well. You can get more inky, messy and more colourful if you want. I'm happy with that. So then we'll take the plane mm. and I'm going to put it at an angle like there. Now I've just noticed I've got a little bit of the inca that's gone on the edge and hasn't blended so with my brush I can just pop that over we'll take our Gertz glue wonderful stuff really is okay so that is going to go at an angle on there and then adventure is going to go across so I only want to glue that middle bit so you can see how tiny little bit on there and that is going to go straight across there like so. And then we would be ready with our twine, which I have got somewhere. Here it is. Ready then to put, cut a length off and pop through and then away we go. Mm -hmm. So as easy as that, we've used the embellishments and uh, mm -hmm. it looks so good. It does, doesn't it? It's so nice. There we go. Wow, yeah. So you imagine if someone mm. is, go you could put that on a card. Someone's Country, going yeah. abroad, Yeah. Um, yeah. A, a bon voyage, you know, go perhaps they're going to 
you know, they do all these charity work yeah, and abroad. Yeah. I mean, that on a card would look God, would look exactly. great. Or if you're throwing them a farewell party, mm -hmm. yeah, there's your bunch. Yeah. yeah, you yeah. could put little notes, couldn't you, on the back, and you yeah. could have them as your little notelet. Oh, That's absolutely, because yeah, 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 it's, as well. it's yeah. Um, and you can sort of see when you actually look at them as well, the sizes of them, they're really decent sizes, aren't they? You know, these are not small or anything like that. So, yes, you could use them on cards, but also, like you can see behind me, you know, it's making such a, a statement if you kind of put these together with the twine as well. Um, and you've got the plain and you've also got the Union Jack. So you can see the two differences that we're seeing just there. And like um, uh, Jason was just mentioning, you can just see with this just how easy it is to actually pop that out. I just want to show you that firsthand. So you've actually got the opportunity to keep it to take it out yeah. there's just so many different ways that you can kind of work with each of them you could stencil through it that would be nice you yes. know it Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's just so much you can yeah. do. And when you think as well, so we're actually giving you 36 parts to the bundle um, with this for less than £20. So it's less, well under a pound each per, per piece. And in, in general, bunting is quite pricey. You know, when you actually buy it and it's just the material and it's pricey. And this is MDF where you can actually do it your own way and, and make it into your own project. Yeah. Um, amazing. Absolutely amazing. Now, don't forget as well, if you have uh, bought with us last weekend, you will have that little 10% off voucher. So you could get this and you could actually get an extra 10% off. So almost £2 off of this as well. Uh, we'll have sent you a, a code to your email that you can use. Any problems, call the call centre. They'll get that sorted for you. And there's this competition. So every time you buy, you get put into this, uh, this competition where one of you is going to win your whole basket. OK, so we'll, we'll pay for the lot. Uh, and you'll get it all for free. That will be announced on Tuesday with Dave, OK? And it doesn't matter how much is in that basket, somebody is going to get that for free. On top of that, remember today we are going to credit a few of you with £10, OK? All you need to do is we can just show you this image and um, it just shows you the fact that we are looking for certain words, OK? So any of these words that you hear, so say like right now if I was like, ah, oh, so I absolutely love rabbits, rabbits. <laughs> Then we've just said rabbit, which is one of them words. You could now email in, OK? You could go to studio um, at hobbymaker.co.uk, say, Paul, I've heard the word rabbit, and you could well get £10 taken straight off of your, uh, your, your account as well. Or, or sheep, you know, any of these words I'm saying, chick, um, Easter egg. Do just email in, and we will, of course, announce a few of you who will get £10 given to your, your, uh, your, your account. So we think of that. If you got the £10, you're paying a tenner for this, if you're lucky enough to win that. It's amazing. And 10% off, you could be paying... Eight pounds. It'd be brilliant. <laughs> um, right, well, well done with that. I've got um, a crafter just coming in and getting involved and asking about the Tim Holtz. Um, yeah, so what we've got is we've got this bundle that you can see, which actually comes with those aeroplanes that we were showing you. Um, so this is this is the bundle here, isn't it? So you've got the cardstock and you've got the um, the, the, the pushouts as well. Yeah, so you've got the um, MBF embellishments, mm -hmm. you've got the Tim Holtz pad, Brilliant. and we've got the stencil as well that, as we've, well. that we've put in as well. Oh, wow. OK, so you've also got, uh, as you can see, that stencil will come with that also. So it's the pad, uh, it is those um, aeroplanes, Place, it's got the stencil and all of these also. Can we have a quick flick through the pad? Is that possible? Yeah. Or, um, should we have a little look? I just, I mean, I, mean, I, I love the look of it. <laughs> Thank you so much. So, yeah, I can understand why a lot of you are asking about this. Let me just stand there so I'll make sure I don't knock those bits off. I can just picture myself doing that with how, how I am sometimes. But you, you can see, I mean, I love, love, love this. So, it, it's got, as Pauline said, it's, it's called Correspondence. Yeah. And it's got kind of an air wow. th theme to it. Mm -hmm. It's all red, whites and blues predominantly. Yeah, yeah. So it just fitted really well. And it's even got Beautiful, you know, isn't flag it? in there as well. Double-sided as well, which is, is really fantastic. And it feels very much like it's that, that sort of pad where, you know, you could cut out bits you wanted. You can use, you know, the exact bits like Pauline was doing. And none of it's ever going to go to waste because you've got that double-sided and the really um, nice thing as well. with, with the tin pads is it gives you the large sheets, then so they're repeated in the, the smaller squares and there. then repeated yep. in even smaller squares as well. Wow. So you can use a large sheet and make mm -hmm. a matching tag or... Yep, yep. So you could layer them up or anything yep. like that as well if you wanted to. So these would be great whether you wanted that, you know, on your cardstock, whether you want that on your bunting like we were just showing. So all three of those things coming to you. Um, and today with that extra saving as well, so we're at £25.99 on that. Uh, I'll pat them back across to you and then obviously Jimmy can always get the, the, the whole shot as well um, if you want to. Okay, what would you like to... to well, do? firstly, the stencil yeah. that you've got with it, 
Um, <clears throat> if I get Jason to show you there, mm -hmm. I, I used it yeah. through a die cutting machine mm. with the stencil. Brilliant. Just on white card, and yeah. you see how good it, it embosses. Doesn't it? Now, I think that is fabulous. So then you can colour that by hand. Yes. Or, or just, but I love white on white I anyway. Mm -hmm. um, but one of the words, are, you know, the adventure across yes, it. Yes. Or anything like that. And, or even one of the crowns or uh -huh. the tiaras. Yeah. yeah. You know, it, it's... it's Mm. You could put like little initials. It's anything, you yeah, want today, yeah. You know, things like that. It's oh, it's lovely. It's just endless possibilities, yeah. really, of how much you could use this for. Yes, you could do it for your jubilee if that's what you're wanting to think of. But you could just consistently use this as well, not just for your bunting, but like you say, for your cards to emboss scrapbooks. This would be great for as well memories. Definitely, yeah. Wow, that that's a, that's incredible, isn't yeah. it? I, love I that. just I wasn't sure if it worked, so I thought I'd give yeah, it a have go, a go. And I'm really pleased with how it yes. turned out. Yeah, I think so. Um, I mean, I'm even thinking now, you, you've got some boxes, haven't you, here, that you've made as well. So you can Coming create all four of those boxes. Four o'clock, we'll be making them. Yeah. Okay, yeah. four o'clock, we'll be making the boxes. So if you want to get the paper pads or anything like that, then obviously they would be um, super to make these boxes that we'll be showing you in the four o'clock hour as well. Um, did you want to do another demo? Make a card. Yes, shall we? Okay, yeah. <clears throat> so um, we brought them to you last show. Mm -hmm. I'm going to bring them again. Yeah the um, Distress Oxide Sprays. Okay. And this one is Villainous Potion. Mm, like that. <laughs> okay, so I've given it a little bit of a, a, a shake uh -huh. to wake it up. So what we're going to do is just, mm -hmm. just add a little bit. In, in fact, I don't think I want any more than that. Mm. Or perhaps just a tiny bit there at the bottom. Mm -hmm. And then it's like, don't overgild the lily. Yeah. When it's like that, and then I'm just going to, can you see that? It's just mm. fabulous. So we'll put that to one side for a moment. See, I'm trying to, trying to be not too messy. <laughs> um, and then I'm going to bring in my mat. Mm -hmm. And then I've got here, um, that is a six inch square and I've got a seven inch card here. So what we want to do, oh, actually I'm jumping ahead of myself. We want to take a Tarara. Ah, nice. A yeah. Tarara. And I'm like, oh, have you any any choice? What would you like? I'd go third one down on the one that's already out, you know, above the... That one there? Yes, yeah. Or pretty? Mm -hmm. Pretty one. Right, OK. So, again, just give it a little push. Yeah. OK? Try not to do a pointy thing, because mm -hmm. you could go into it, I'm you know? Yeah. Right, OK, so now I'm going back with the ink gold in the blue, because mm -hmm. that's going to look good with the oh, villainous so nice. purple. Yeah. OK, and we are going to use our finger dauber again. And then I'm going to put this on here. The coverage mm. you get, and it's so easy to do. Yeah. Um, and because it's water-based, it washes easy, so you don't have to worry about... Um, it's not like using alcohol markers where everything is permanent. Mm -hmm. So you could let kids loose with this as well. Yeah. But the colour is fabulous. Right. So that's that on there. Now, I've got a little bit left on here. This isn't quite dry, but I'm going to just give it a go. So what I want to do then mm -hmm. is just bring a little bit in the corner there. Yeah. Just a tiny bit down here. Mm. See, just like that. Mm -hmm. So not too much, just a little bit. Okay, and a little bit up here. And Lovely just bring it round. Now, another thing you can do is take it and just run it a little bit more. Try and keep this lid on because it will help keep it longer. Okay, yeah. Um, and if it does go dry, spray it with a little bit of water. Mm -hmm. That's when I say dry after after some time, yeah. um, you can spray it with water and it will rejuvenate it. Mm -hmm. I wish I got rejuvenated when I sprayed, <laughs> sprayed with water. It doesn't have me that too. effect on me. <laughs> We'd right, spray okay. anything across the studio, wouldn't we? Like? <laughs> <laughs> right, so now I'm, I'm, for, a, for a moment, I'm switching hats mm -hmm. and, and I'm bringing my hunky-dory in. <laughs> Um, and I'm going to use Hunky Dory Gems, uh -huh. and I think I'm going to go with, oh, <laughs> let's, they've got these blue ones here. But I've got which ones, which ones? This one's here. Oh. Right, so I'm going to take these little ones, mm -hmm. and I'm going to put them just in the 
middle here. Yeah. Okay. Now, you, I mean, you all you here will probably say, oh, that colour is a certain gem. Mm -hmm. um, to me, this is like turquoise gem. That's <laughs> that's about that's about my my knowledge. <laughs> you yeah. sparkling. <laughs> well, we... I um I know, I know a diamond. <laughs> <laughs> that's how I was when I first started, and then you go through all these um, other trainers, and then like you say, you look at that, you go, oh, the Marin Bialen, all oh, the Swiss blue, all oh, the this. <laughs> uh, and <laughs> then, but I mean, you could use any of your um, embellishments, your you know mm, your, anything definitely. that raises something up yeah and then we'll just pop those across there let's put another one in the middle mm -hmm. there and i think that'll that'll do but it just okay. gives that you know we, mm. we have another one that um one of the large crowns i've decorated put more on yeah yeah go to town you can cover it yeah. with glitter if Beautiful. you want to mm -hmm. okay so what we're going to do now is take our card um, and I'm going to put some pads on the back of this. I can find my my pads. Here mm -hmm. we go. So let's pop pad on the back of here. Oh, curled that one over. <laughs> be fine. Okay. Yeah. On there. Another one on here. Mm -hmm. And one more over there and we're going to pop this onto the center of our card like so i love to have the um the lovely white edge on there mm, definitely and then we're going to take our crown our girt's glue again mm -hmm. and just again um with mdf you don't want to get mdf too wet because it can um What's the word, Jason? Warp. Warp. Okay. Thank yeah. you. Mm -hmm. That's what we, I'll bring him along to <laughs> fill, it, fill in the missing gaps. Have my uses. <laughs> we're, we're constantly on the phone. And it's like, what is yeah, it? Fill this so in. <laughs> and then we're going to pop that in the centre there. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. And then, um, do, 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 got it somewhere. Now I'm just going to, again, a bit of hunky dory mm -hmm. yeah. because, um, and let's go with one of the word ones. Let's yeah. get my scissors and, um, oh, but it, there you go, one. Yeah. It just shows that you can use MDF with other yes. things in your stash. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That you can. Mm. Oh, absolutely. Definitely. I'm just so fortunate that I get two bites of the cherry. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. And I've got this one. This is off one of their pads. Mm. I think that's what's so lovely, actually, and we've been saying it on quite a few shows, that, you know, you, you do a show like today with, with Crafter's Companion and then we do a show with you and you can buy from both shows and combine yeah. them together. And the same with, obviously, when Hunky Dory's on or anybody else. And especially because we do that one-off poster and packaging, which is £3.95 between midnight and midnight. So it, you can just kind of cross shop, which is, is just brilliant. So um, there we go. We yeah. have Live in the Moment. Lovely. Just... Right, there we go. Mm -hmm. So if I hold that up, that's fab. Right way round. Mm -hmm. and, and I mean that is so quick, and you get all yeah. those. Uh huh. I want to say tiaras. <laughs> <laughs> tiaras on the uh -huh. uh, on there, but how quick was that? And you, so that fast. could be done in any yeah. colour way. Mm -hmm. But you, you can want. see that other one that obviously you brought in with you as well. Um, this one here, you know, totally different. So yeah, but you know, on a pink. smaller card, lovely as well. As well. Yeah. And, and I actually think as well, I mean, it's only £6 to buy the tiaras on their own and you are going to get two, four, six, eight, ten as well. So ten tiaras. Now, if people were selling on their cards, you know, if they've got their own stores. Now, when I've seen in my independent, you know, little shops and you get to see the kind of MDF looks like this where they're stuck on, the price skyrockets on the cards. Oh, yeah. And, you know, I've, I've actually bought something that is quite similar to what I basically have in my hand here. And I paid like £6.50 for the card. I didn't mind. I felt it was well worth it. But that means if you were selling these on, you're paying £6 for 10. 
And then, you know, I always think if you want to make a profit, there's always good ways to do it in many <laughs> cases. And we're always more than happy for you to use it for, you know, for your own, um, you know, craft stores and shows or if you go into school fates or anything like that. So 10 tiaras, if you want to create these bits, for £6 on that. All of them MDF really have that kind of thickness um, to them as well and that kind of hard wearing opportunity, which I think is brilliant. Yeah, there's another one there as well where I've uh, embossed it, the small... One. This one. Yeah, so I've yep. embossed the tiara there. Oh, yes. So I've added that. the UT on that we've got on the show as well, mm. and it just gives it that, again, kind of enameled effect. Yeah. You almost kind of lose the fact that it's MDF. Yeah, you do, don't you? It's, it makes it look like totally, totally different. They're all sort of equally as beautiful, but so different. So, yeah, I wouldn't have even thought about embossing, and actually, yeah, you see that, and you think that works so well. So £6 if you want to get the tiaras. Remember, all the other embellishments are there and available as well. Um, so, of course, you can snap all of these bits up as well. Um, and don't forget the bunting, the bunting, the bunting, the bunting. If you are, you know, so many of you are coming through and getting that. This is plain bunting. It's also the opportunity, of course, to get the Union Jack bunting that we have as well. So you get both. So you can put them together. You can mix and match them. Um, go on, you can tell me a fact for... is it oh union jack is only when it's on the water on the ship and it's union flag there we go that, that's New probably fact. why they call the sailors that. the jolly jack tar <laughs> <laughs> There we go. <laughs> I'm going to be learning so much. I'm going to be going home saying, right, I'm, I'm general knowledge up now. <laughs> I can do some maths. I'm like, <laughs> yeah, thank you. But I don't remember very much random facts. So any to take in is going to help me, to be honest. <laughs> um, so, yes, if you want to get the bunting, 24 plane, 12 of the Union flag that you can get as well. Um, and a big, big saving if you get the bundle as well. So you get it at £19.99 today. Ready for your Jubilee parties, ready for birthdays, ready to just dress your garden, uh, put it in your bed bedrooms couldn't you it could literally go everywhere on your cards like we're seeing fabulous um barbecue season i know i know <laughs> um <laughs> barbecue i'm doing up my garden at the moment that's why i'm always thinking right dress your garden do this everything <laughs> like that are we coming to a sign we are oh, we are oh. yeah okay. um so I've, I've got pal mal yes yeah not paul mall <laughs> 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 um and, and what i want to show you is um you, you may think oh if i've got to get all these letters out mm. and color them and it's going to be yeah. so hard so let's show you how easy it can mm -hmm. be so this is your base layer and it's engraved so you know that your letters are going to, you follow that so that you know your letters are going to be the right way up at equal distance mm -hmm. jason's done all that for you so what we're going to do first is pop the edge out which is going to be on top of there now we could use our um gesso in black or but i'm going to go with the the blue blue and red theme again yeah. just because i can uh -huh. but it could be anything yeah. so um i'm going to take one of our markers and just show you how quickly this going over so i'm using a, a nice royal blue here keeping in with the theme. And again, you can see how the MDF, no priming. I mean, by all means, if you want to prime it. I always say, if you prime it, you get different color than if you go direct onto the MDF. Mm. So the, there always will be a difference um, whether you do it that way or just it's direct with him. If you use your alcohol markers onto craft card, you'd get a more subdued Course. colour. So yeah. because it's picking up the natural colour of the MDF as well, mm -hmm. it just changes it slightly. But yeah. you can see, you still get a really intense Yeah, you do, yeah. 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 And actually, it just makes it so easy to be able to do it straight on. So. Yeah, yeah. So then now, we want to colour the background here. Um, and I'm going to go, if that's going to be blue, I want that to be red. So I'm going to go with the red. I mean, we've got all the other colours as well. Um, red. Right. OK, so here we go again. And then what I'm going to do is, because that's going to cover that up, I haven't really got to worry yeah. about going over the lines. Uh -huh. So this one, OK, is going straight, straight over. Mm -hmm. But look at that. It's absolutely gorgeous. Mm. Um, and the fact that you've got the sheen with it is just lovely. I mean, I'm trying to keep within the lines, but it really doesn't matter. matter. 
Um, and I love this because if you've got a study or something Definitely. like that, that mm -hmm. you know, or it might mean something to you. Yeah. If you live in Pall Mall, you know, <laughs> contact us. Yes. If you live in Pall Mall, I'll send it you. Because <laughs> that would just be amazing. <laughs> Okay, we'll there we go. There's about 12 pound mouths around. The yeah, suddenly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and right. of that one. The pound mouth. Yeah, Let's cool get one. that the one. Yeah. Okay. Can you imagine? I'll have like 50 to send out. Yeah. <laughs> Me, Jason. Right, okay. So we've got the colour on there and you can see that fabulous sheen. Mm -hmm. And you can still see where those are going. Now I'm going to do the same kind of thing again mm -hmm. with the letters. So going back to the blue, okay. Um, what I did with my other one, I used the gesso and I did the, out, the outer edge in the uh, black gesso on there. Yeah. But you know, you, you can do whatever you want. Yep. Now the letters, look at this. It's just oh, fabulous. Yeah. So if you wanted to keep mm -hmm. um, on with, you know, with the uh, Jubilee theme, mm. this is it. Can, uh, do you know what? Fancy having um, Monopoly Monopoly night yes. <laughs> and like like decorating up with yeah. these. It's I just, just think uh, signs generally now, like whenever you want to buy anything, you know, to go on your walls or, or anything like that. Oh really yeah, expensive. Absolutely, and they're really really popular. So the fact that you're going to get all three of those, you know, you can keep them all for yourself or you can gift two away. You could put them, them on a stall and sell them. Mm -hmm. Less than a tenner for all of them is amazing. Yeah. By 20. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we we don't mind. <laughs> right, okay, so what we're going to do now is, um, let's use this again now. So these, mm -hmm. can you see now? We'll just uh, pop out and they're ready done. And I'm going to take the, what, the little bits out. What yeah. I've done with them, with the, you know, as you can see with the P and the A, I've, uh -huh. I've kept the middles in as well. Yeah. So yeah. If you're frugal, the, the waste that you're taking the letters out of you can use you can use that as well yes yeah yeah absolutely so that goes straight in. and then you've got another another sign yeah so but you can see how easy they come out yeah. how easy they color and this is the same for all the mdf mm. we you know it it really is fantastic stuff to work with yeah it just takes the paint in doesn't it so easily but it's yeah still really so let's color. just show you with the p if i take mm -hmm. that middle out Okay, I think I'd, you know what, take the middle out first and then you can hold it easier. Mm -hmm. Okay, but look, you just pop that back in. Yeah. You see, and you've, uh -huh. you're good to go. Yeah? Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's yeah. just take this one out the A's. Yeah, as well, yeah. Just as kind of funkier mm -hmm. font. <laughs> yeah, no, exactly, you can, yeah. Or as a stencil or anything, you can mm. use it yeah. for as well. Okay, so what we're going to do now is just pop the letters on. Mm -hmm. And because you've got that there ready, you know that they're straight, you know that they're level, you know that they're equidistant. Don't worry if you've got a bit of glue, it does dry clear. Mm -hmm. So that's nothing to, to worry about. The hardest thing is holding them. You can use tweezers mm -hmm. if it helps. Okay. Yeah. I'm rushing, so I'm going a little bit heavy handed with the glue, um, but... Uh, You've got more time. Yeah. We never have enough um, time to <laughs> demo properly. Do know, I know. <laughs> You've okay. always got it in your ear, realising where the time is. And <laughs> yeah, I think I've just got... There we go. Mm -hmm. um, Lovely. This one. Yeah. Re nearly done. Yeah, it's really effective because of it being the two layers. You know, rather than having yeah. it painted on straight into the MDF, it's that two layer that really pops out, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, oh, absolutely. Um, I think, you know, Jason's really thought about it mm. um, and to make them Brilliant. look their very best. Yeah. Okay, and the last mm -hmm. one is on here. There we go. Unfortunately, this glue does dry mm -hmm. really quickly, but it does still give you enough time to get right mm -hmm. in there lift it and just see that one needs to go up a little bit that one up and over and if you want you know if you've got the too much glue go in with your paintbrush okay don't forget to wipe it uh, wash it after mm -hmm. okay yeah. yeah little bit there and then all we do is once again 
a little bit glue round here for the finishing edge on there. Yep. Wow. And there we have a mm -hmm. uh, sign. It's just a little bit of glue mm -hmm. just there. But as I say, it does dry okay, clear. Anyway, yeah. Okay. So, uh -huh. And there we go. Wow, that's that's brilliant, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. ignore the glue where I, that will yeah. dry and will vanish. Yeah. That's fantastic. But there you go. And, and when you look at as well the, the Carnaby Street one that you did, the, the Lambeth Walk as well, and you just look at how different they are. So it just shows that depending on sort of which colours you choose or anything like that, yeah. they're, they're so different. And so you can really make them work for the space that you want them in. Or if yeah. you're, you're gifting them, you, you can sort of look at somebody's house and think, right, that's the colour I want, which is just brilliant. Um, yeah, like a camper van, for example, or something like that. As well. <laughs> My parents have a camper and they're away for their first um, week this week. You know, it's like Easter it always is when it starts and that's sort of thing they'd love in there you know it's uh, have it on their dashboard and just brightens up the space doesn't yeah. it all of these yeah. and they're, they're very cool they're very funky as well yeah oh absolutely mm. um and I, I said to jason i said i think they're just something totally different yes totally yeah. unique um but it but it, you know it just might mean something to you exactly yeah if, if yeah. you have a look on the yas queen that you've got in front mm -hmm. of you the, the pink one here yeah i've used a couple of our plaque hangers on the top so you just attach ah, them to the okay. back yeah. Um, so you could put those onto the street signs as well if you wanted could. to make them into a hanger. Yeah, yeah. So there's, there's the plaque hangers that you can see here and then you can see the twine as well. So um, like Jason was saying, if you just wanted to join them onto the back of the street signs, that would just, yeah, work brilliantly, wouldn't it, as well? Yeah. Um, and this is another one that's just, just great, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, it's great. I kind of feel like, um, you know, especially, say, if you've got, I don't know, like a teenager or, you know, something, oh, maybe a 13th yeah. birthday, something like that. It's the kind of design they would absolutely On a love. teenager's door. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> completely. It's like I'm the queen, you know, I'm the most important person, right? Here. <laughs> um, <coughs> well, to be honest, yeah, toddlers are, are basically there and, as well. And I didn't have it hanging off the um, rear view mirror in my car. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, this is, this is me. <laughs> yeah, I love it. I really do. And again, you can kind of choose the colours you want to do. Very, very easy to be able to just, just hang that wherever you want to. Look lovely, like on, uh, you know, if you've got like your own little room or your own little shed or something like that as well, and you kind of want to put things like that there. Um, and 749, it's a big size. It is, yeah. Mm. And then, you know, it's like, uh, because you've got the outer edge as well, yep. um, you can use that again as a stencil exactly. to spray through it. You know, it's, I, I love, because Jason does give you the mm -hmm. extra. So when those, yep. those letters yep. pop out, you do have that to play with. Yeah, so you've got that extra there as well. I mean, that's just, just lovely, isn't it? So there's the box, then they pop out. And like you say, you've then got the secondary, exactly the same as the signs, haven't yeah. you, that you yeah. can use again? Something I like to do with the words, mm -hmm. especially with the alcohol markers. Yeah. And I, I've showed it on things we've done in previous shows, is start with a colour and work okay. ombre, ombre the colour down. Oh, very nice. Um, and think anything with, with lettering. Mm. And again, if you did it while it was still in that, frame yep. work um, it would hold it in place so you could do straight like rather than try and match it up individually on the letters yes, yeah. do it while it's still in the frame uh -huh. yeah that's a really really good idea so yeah that makes it easier doesn't it as well because then yeah. you've got to kind of be you know as, as kind of worried about where the rest of it's going to go so seven pounds 49 on that remember all of the embellishments are still available as well so you can get these as separate uh, little entities or you can get sort of all of the embellishments with the letters the numbers the crowns that we've got the tiaras the the flags as well um, everything is on the website so you can jump on and of course um, take a Advantage. It is that one-off post and packaging fee between midnight and midnight. Um, should we have another quick look at the um, the bunting? Yeah. Because, of course, there is an amazing opportunity to get the bunting today. I mean, you can see a couple of a couple of bits that have been made behind me here behind me here and it, do you know what I really like about this as well is the fact that we've actually put the the crowns with the bunting as well so you can kind of mix and match a lot yeah. of these together yeah. my favorite of the embellishment sheets is the one where you've got the mixed where you've got the London buzz mm -hmm. the, the 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 flag uh, the tiara yeah. the crown you've got a little bit of everything on yeah. there and the telephone box I yeah. love that I called that one London baby if anybody remembers the uh, the London episode of Friends when yes. Joey yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> love friends so much yeah that's brilliant um so we can um oh. 
We can bring uh, the big bundle in of the embellishments, so you can have a look at this. So if you want to get these, um, you can do, which is, of course, the, the numbers. You've got the, the letters that we were talking about. There is that one that we were saying about the London baby, um, but also the moustaches, the, the hats, everything we, like this Shall we this do a well. quick card? Yeah, we've got time. The... Oh, yeah. OK, let's, uh, let's get the... Let's get my moustache out. <laughs> yes. OK. Can you so. get these individually as well, or are they...? Yeah. Yes. OK, so we'll bring the graphics in for them individually as well. So if you want to get them individually, you can, or if you want to get the full bundle with an extra saving, you can do that. So the, the gentleman one is £6, which is just, just brilliant, isn't okay. it? OK, so with this one, I've got um, a 5 by 7 card. Yep. And um, I'm actually going to turn it inside out because I've just noticed that I've got a little bit of an ink splash on it, mm -hmm. which is nothing unusual when I'm playing. <laughs> so here we go, five by seven card. And then um, what we've got here, I'm going to go with the glasses. Now I've got, these ones are more, um, look at that, <laughs> fabulous. Let's just put that there a minute. Then if I go with this moustache, mm -hmm. Well, I do love that one. That's very steampunk, isn't it? The, uh, the, the, look. <laughs> Brilliant. Very. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, yeah. Um, or that is like the horns of a ram. Uh, yeah. <laughs> that way. Yeah, you did the way around. <laughs> so we'll have that one there. And then this time, instead of a hat, we can go with the tie. Mm. Okay, so just move those up a little mm. bit. And that one down. You could perhaps even do these on a DL card or something like that. Mm -hmm. But then let's go with some colour. Now, for quickness, I'm going to go in. Now, I, I do think black is the way to go yeah. with these. Now, again, we could use our um, black gesso. Mm -hmm. But if I just show you how quick it is to colour with the pens, it's so wow. easy. Mm -hmm. It's like by the time you've opened the gesso, you've done it. Okay, nothing wrong with the gesso, it works wonderfully. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But, um, you know, it's, and just as good coverage. But this is just so easy, so good. So here we go. Mm -hmm. Now, don't forget, if you wanted to make these shiny, we could heat emboss them. Yeah. Um, and put the, and we had the ultra thick um, on the last show. So, um, if you bought that, you can use that over. So just ink these and then add the embossing powder. Okay, so we've got nice, even coverage on this. So here we go. And it just shows how different everything can be just by the change of a shape, a colour or whatever. And now I just need something stronger mm -hmm. to hold my card down. Oh, hang on, we'll open it. <laughs> there we go, we'll open it. So, right, glasses. Now, again, if you've got acetate, mm -hmm. or buy some goggly eyes mm, <laughs> and, yeah. and put, put a, a goggly eye <laughs> in, the, in the centre of it. Again, mm. you know, I've said it before with MDF, but the world is your lobster. Yeah. And you can do whatever you so wish. That on there. And then I'm going to put the tie at the bottom first, and then I know where my moustache will be. Mm -hmm. That doesn't sound right. It <laughs> <laughs> I don't want anybody to know where my moustache <laughs> will be. Right, and okay, make sure it's the right way up. Mm -hmm. And then we'll pop that on here. Yeah. Now, look at it, just plain white card. Mm. If you wanted, you can do it on a piece of white card and then cut, you know, like I did this this one here, yeah. put it on and then change it to yeah. add on to a card. Yeah. But that now is stuck in place. Yeah. And there is, mm -hmm. greeting on there, happy Father's Day, yeah. happy birthday, dad, mm -hmm. happy retirement, yeah. it, uh, granddad. It just yeah. works so well. And there's the other one that you made, obviously, before the show as well, that you can see the... Now, with that one, I, I had the words across yeah. the hat. Yeah, you know, really like you have idea, Kiss Me it? Quick yeah. on there? Yeah. And I, that, it just reminded me of that. So. It does. Um, so we've got... The other hat, there, if I show here, the okay. other hat is a, is a top hat. Yeah. Um, so, yeah. So you can make that difference. So that one there 
you get a top hat on that one. Brilliant. A couple of hats, you know, three um, scarves. We've got uh, four moustaches, two sets of glasses as well. I think that's brilliant. And I mean, you, you can like use, like we've showed on those, like three into one. You could just put a glasses or just put a hat onto yeah. a card, couldn't you? This, have it I think this is, this is a great one for the kids. It is, yes. To do for granddads and, and fathers. Yeah, but I agree. They could frame them afterwards. You well. could, yes. So, yeah. yeah, yeah. Yeah, it looks, looks very much like something you then would want to frame. It, and the kids could the actually draw round those and cut the shapes yeah, out as well yeah so and that's only six pounds for you to get all of those embellishments remember all of the embellishments are separate so if you want to go onto the web and you're thinking well, i want the numbers because you know you we always know how much you need numbers you know for birthday cards or, or anything like that um if you're wanting the uh, letters as well then you can spell out obviously anything that you want they are there separate or the whole bundle is here at 30 um well actually not even 36 pounds is it under 30 so 29 pounds 99 and that's got what we've just showed you there with the gentleman it's got the the letters the numbers that I was talking about it's got the London baby it's got the tiaras it's got the crowns as well just so so much within that that whole um that whole bundle I mean the amount of time that you're going to have that you can spend with that because they're yeah. going to go really far I mean if you would if you are going to be doing a jubilee mm. party you could get some friends together and yeah. and have a party doing uh -huh. the part the things for exactly. the party. Yes, yeah. And you could create you could almost put like little sticks, you know, onto them and you could have like the glasses on little sticks yeah. and tiaras on yeah. a stick on cupcakes. Exactly. How <laughs> nice you know, does yeah. that look? Yes. Yeah. So just so, so much you can do with this. Um, keep on going through and snapping up everything that you want to get. We will be back, of course, in an hour's we time. And we're going to be looking at the box. More new products. Mm -hmm. OK. Um, so, so, so much more still to come. Um, so don't go anywhere. We are going to be back as well in a moment with Corinne. And we have got um, this, this amazing stamping show. We'll be kind of coming back and showing you the Gemini again. But the stamping um, sort of opportunities that we've got in the next hour are absolutely amazing. Amazing. So uh, jump on the web if you would like to. And remember, if you've got that special little discount code, there's 10% off everything this weekend if you shop with us last weekend. And one of you is going to win your whole basket being bought and paid for by us because each thing you buy, you get put into the competition. So the more that you get, the more entries you have into that. And one of you will win. That will be announced on Tuesday to get your whole shopping basket for free. Don't go anywhere. Burts and Gerts will be back with us in an hour's time. But Crafters Companion is next. Here at Hobbymaker, we love seeing what you've been making and it's our job to keep you inspired. So how does a £100 credit to your Hobbymaker account sound? Every month we're going to be giving away a £100 credit to one lucky Hobbymaker's account. And all you have to do to enter is simply send a photo of your crafty makes to studio at hobbymaker.co.uk. We will be picking one winner each month at random and we'll announce the lucky winner on air in the 5pm show on the last Saturday of every month. So what are you waiting for? Get crafting, get motivated and get inspired with Hobbymaker. Our call centre is based in the UK and available 24-7. Just call 0800 001 4433 or email help at hobbymaker.co.uk. Sandra Rushton and I am the owner of Sandtangle, which is a small business in uh, Lincolnshire where it's only been going uh, three years or so but uh, we are really really passionate about what we do. So it's a very mindful form of art, that's its basic core. So if you can hold a pen and draw a line you can tangle and it's about that mindfulness, that relaxation and about you having a moment just for you. But as a result of you having that moment of putting pen to paper, you can create wonderful works of art. We do a lot of live videos, so we're very, very invested in education. We like to have people come to classes, but then of course the products that I design, we make ourselves. So we're involved in every step of the way, from the very, very, say the very first drawing, to how it goes onto the computers, to how it's machined, to even books that we still hand make. 
Oh, I'm looking forward to seeing where we go. It's the start of something new, and I honestly, I feel that. I feel that it's something exciting, and I'm, I'm so glad I'm in at the beginning, because I don't know where it's going, but it's only going somewhere good. This is the place for me. Join us this Easter bank holiday weekend here on Hobbymaker for our Easter extravaganza. On Friday, brand new slimline nesting dies from Crafter's Companion and Stamping Essentials. Burton Gertz with brand new Jubilee themed MDF. On Saturday, we've brand new woodware bubble balloon stamps from Creative Expressions plus Cosmic Shimmers. Be creative with Stampers Friends Show Special and Screen Pal. And on Sunday, hunky dory Easter deals with Dreamies and their launch show. And on Monday, Creative Expressions, Native Lighting, and Crafters Companion. Also, shop between Friday the 15th to Monday the 18th, and one lucky person will win their Easter basket for free. Now, if you shop with us last weekend, don't forget to use your 10% off discount code. So, a great lineup. Make sure you stay tuned this Easter weekend here on Hobbymaker. Hobbymaker are proud to work alongside some of the biggest brands in the industry. Keep watching for these brands and many more here on Hobbymaker. When you purchase anything on Hobbymaker, you have a 30-day money-back guarantee, meaning that you can shop with confidence. Happy shopping with Hobbymaker. It is time to reveal our five Search for Star sewing finalists. Earlier on in the year, we asked you, our viewers, to apply to be our next Sewing Street Sewing Star, and we were overwhelmed with the amount of applicants. We have watched hours of audition videos, and we have somehow managed to narrow it down to our chosen five finalists. Our five very talented finalists will be on your screen next week from Monday the 4th of April to Friday the 8th of April. And we've dedicated an hour each day to each contestant to do their demonstrations. We're handing over the choice of the winner to you. So on the Friday after everybody's done their live demonstrations, the voting will be open. Join us all next week to help us choose our Sewing Street Sewing Star. Hello, gosh, we are right in the midst of this. So we're here right up until six o'clock. It is the Easter weekend. You can see behind me, we are doing as one of our kind of big promos this weekend is win your basket. So one of you will get everything that's in that basket um, for free. We will mention who the winner is on Tuesday with Dave. Um, Every time that you buy something, you'll kind of get another entry into that and then one of you will get your complete basket. It doesn't matter how many products you've got in that free and we will announce that winner, as I say, on Tuesday. Plus, don't forget, it is Easter. You know, we're, we're having a, a lovely time kind of looking at all of these eggs, probably thinking about eating our chocolate. And if any of you kind of see those little, or hear me say any of those key words that are on that little print sheet that you can see on the on the uh, website, then just, just email in, email in studio at hobbymaker.co.uk or message us on the website and we will be announcing that some of you have got £10 credited to your accounts as well, okay? So if you are sort of enjoying the show and you want to get involved with any of that, then please do, and you've all got a chance to kind of get an extra £10 gifted to you, with it being Easter also. Corinne's back. Hello. Um, totally different show. To totally the different. Absolutely different. Mm -hmm. I put my Gemini away, but then I thought, oh, I need that for my embossing folders. So uh, we're yes. not die cut. We're uh -huh. not going to die cut no. once. Mm -hmm. We are going to emboss. So that's going to show you how versatile mm -hmm. this um, um, yeah. Gemini machine is because we're now going to take it to embossing really? and we're not going to just really? emboss, we're going to 3D emboss. Amazing. So that's up to the uh -huh. next level. So I'm going to show you how versatile that is. Yeah. We're going to do lots of stamping, bit of colouring. Mm -hmm. I think I'm going to have to do a little bit of jumping around so we yeah, can get a couple okay. of demos done. Definitely. But I can show you the principles of all the stamping, mm -hmm. whether, with, whether you prefer to use your rocker block or whether you yeah. use the stamping platform. Mm -hmm. Give you those choices and show you how there's different options out there. Yes, it's fabulous. Get lots of inks involved. Yes, yes. Oh, amazing. So all of this, of course, will be coming up. The, the Gemini is on the screen at the moment. It is just because I only uh, literally launched a couple of days ago, this brand new candy floss colour. It has got that, that special goodie bag coming free with it. In the future, it will be 179.99 just for the Gemini, which is a great price on its own. But for that brand new launch, you're getting almost £80 worth of free goodies that are coming with this as well. So do take advantage. There's not many of them left. I think there's less than 40 now available so good good luck if you want to get those right shall we kick no, off with the yeah yes. with the discovery bundle that right we've got. discovery bundle i think this is because if you perhaps haven't 
um, done any um, stamping before, this is going to be the perfect okay. way in. Yeah. But if you have stamped before, this is just going to be an extra um, element to add to your stash. Yes. So uh -huh. first of all, we're going to start with the cardstock. Mm -hmm. So this is our white stamping card. Yep. So this is going to be perfect for doing your, your stamping on too. Mm -hmm. So when you're stamping, you need an ink. Mm -hmm. And you'll see down here, we've got our finesse alcohol proof yes. ink, which okay. is perfect. I, what I love about Crafters Companion mm -hmm. is they don't they don't try to hide what a product does. Mm -hmm. So this says it's alcohol proof ink. Okay. Therefore, you know it's you can use it with your alcohol pens. It's yes. not going to yeah. smudge. Okay. They they're really clear mm -hmm. about the products. They yeah. label them as there is. There's uh -huh. no mystique about them. Mm. If you want a uh, if you want to colour with your alcohol pens, then get an alcohol proof mm -hmm. ink pad. Yeah. There's no. Yeah. Opposites, you use your opposite, which you do. You, yeah, you, yeah. you know, you use your water base for your alcohol pens, your alcohol base for your water pens. Yeah, but they don't need, yeah. you don't have to worry about that. They label it up so it's, it's so much better, isn't it, really? Yeah. Because I think that's why you can always tell that it's crafters that actually do this and kind of create yes. these products because you don't want to be kind of going around your craft room, spending ages like reading on the back, what can this go with? Yeah. You just want to know, right, I go to that for this, exactly. and, and that's the exactly. simplest way. Then we've got our rocker blocks. So, our rocker blocks, I've got some here. So, the rocker I've not blocks, seen these have you yet? not I'm seen them? So, how this. they are is they're, um, they're like a stamping plate, <laughs> yeah, but you've got your rocker. Down here, you've got mm. your rocker block. So, if, 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 can you can you see it's slightly yes. curved? I don't know if I turn that way, that way. You can see that. Yes. Can you see that's got slight curve. So you've got a little lip at this side. So mm -hmm. you put your stamp on, and that lip is perfectly sized. Brilliant. To let your stamp just be proud, mm -hmm. and then all you do is literally rock. Oh, okay. Backwards and forwards, yeah. and it will give you perfect pressure. I'll do mm -hmm. some stamping with it. Yep. One of the stamps I, I need to use my um, platform because it's a bit bigger, yeah, but if it's the right size, we'll use that yes. one. Yeah, yeah. So you've got your four different sizes. So you've mm -hmm. got your, your largest one, and then going right down to ones that are going to be perfect for your sentiments, mm. your butterflies. Yeah, of course. You know, sometimes you only want something little, so you've mm -hmm. got all the lovely little sizes there. Fantastic. And then it's... Um, what we wanted we've got mm -hmm. some stamps so we've got these beautiful beautiful collections look, look at, at that. that isn't that gorgeous yeah. so that is our butterflies mm -hmm. with our I gorgeous sentiment in the middle and we're going to use that in our first demonstration because it's so so pretty i just love that sentiment if nothing ever changed there would be no butterflies i know and i think with you know with sort of over the last few years kind of what so many of us have had to yes. deal with all yes. everybody in a different way i think that's just the perfect sentiment to yes, give to anybody it is, to keep it is. You going it's absolutely gorgeous mm. and then the next one is our yep. positive thoughts sentiment Brilliant. so these are ones that are not going to be put away mm -hmm. these are the ones i don't know if you have a box on your craft table that yeah. has maybe your um, foundation dies mm -hmm in it has your everyday sentiments in these are the ones you're going to pop these in there because uh -huh. they're just you know they're they're not necessarily your birthday mm -hmm. or your anniversary but they're just your mm. ones that you're going to use on your cards and we used yep. it on one of the cards earlier you know just to show yeah. you how beautiful they it's are brilliant. i love that one don't be afraid to be great i'm like we yeah. all we all should have yeah. we should all yeah. have that um you can see a couple as well that are here uh, of the butterflies so if you wanted to have a quick look at just those different um, shapes different mm. sizes just the way you mat and layer them yeah. and where you colour don't be afraid mm. by be frightened of them they are so easy to use no exactly and then of course all of those sentiments that we have as well and on top of it as always we're going to bring you an amazing saving with this Ooh, window yes. so if you wanted them all individually this one's done by monica from the positive thoughts collection so um you know you would have been paying that full price that's on instead we are going to give you this saving at 27 pounds oh, wow. 99 wow that's that yeah. third off and that's amazing yeah. yeah yeah pretty much third off the price so yeah under th i mean you wouldn't expect all of that under no. 30 all five I? elements mm. and i know when we actually first launched the rocker blocks it wasn't on my show i think it was with dave they were so popular yes. um and i think they all sold out on that initial show so the fact that they're within this as well yeah. is just brilliant and i love how you've got the different sizes mm, for the different too. elements yes. yeah it works perfectly so you're getting all of that, all of that today for this price for under £30. So that is just absolutely incredible. So did you want to do some stamping first or do you want to go across? We have a look. Should we go across got everything first? first yes, and then yes kind of because we're yep. carrying on with the stamping theme. This yep. is our sassy butterfly. I love this. Aren't they absolutely yeah. gorgeous? I put them all here to show you. Uh -huh. So sassy and classy, but we have a look. Mm -hmm. So what we've got is we've got dress to impress. Now, do you, this is perfect for this <laughs> chat, you know, around here with the channel. Dress to impress. Do you know a seamstress? Do you know somebody mm -hmm. that likes their 
clothes, you know. How perfect is this? The world is your catwalk. Cute and classy, short and sassy, dressed to those. impress. Yeah. How perfect are those? So the, you mm -hmm. absolutely perfect, you know, your stamps on there. Yep. And then we've got our next one. Let me, this one is Hello Gorgeous. Mm -hmm. Isn't she, you know, she's yeah. got the sass there, hasn't she? She's absolutely... Um, Beautiful and too glam to give a damn. <laughs> too, yes, wake up and make up. Absolutely mm. perfect. Now, if you love your colouring, these are going to be absolutely yes. perfect. And if you've got, you know, they're all going to work with your rocker mm -hmm. blocks, but they're also going to work with your alcohol inks if you're going to want to then colour with yep. alcohol proof uh -huh. if you then want to go with your alcohol Brilliant. pens. How about this one? So this one, I think, mm -hmm. is going to be partners in crime. How wonderful is that? We'll always be friends. You match my level of crazy. <laughs> How gorgeous is this? Mm -hmm. I love this. Colour them whatever you colour yeah. you want to work with, whoever. Colour the hair the right yes. colour. It yeah. works beautiful. And this is the one we're going to use true mm -hmm. friends we're going to hopefully get to a demo to do that one i love this true friends the cat and the little girl looking out the window oh. true friends are never apart maybe in distance but never in heart so lovely. how lovely mm. is that mm. so yes yeah, so you're going to get all of those mm -hmm. so you're getting all of those uh, and the mm -hmm. um, photopolymer so photopolymer are the highest level quality that you can get in a stamp mm -hmm. so you're going to get the you know you're going to get the perfect print so if i yeah. start to show you some of the stamped images you can oh, see yes. how brilliantly mm -hmm. these stamp you don't need to worry that you're not going to get the full stamp mm -hmm. they're going to work every oh, single yes. time but look at that look at how change the color mm -hmm. how mm -hmm. different it looks yeah. really does and then we've got our lovely little yeah, one look looking one. out of the part and that was partners in crime mm. wasn't it and if you get them all you could kind of use the different sentiments to kind of mix oh yeah match, don't, what, you don't well, think your brilliant. sentiments can have to stay yeah. on one you know you're going to be able to mix and match and again look at that change yeah. that change so the colour different. and it just looks different mm -hmm. again absolutely gorgeous have we looked at that one oh there we go a little yeah. bit of spectrum noir sparkle pen yeah, over there beautiful. to give it a little bit of a lift oh, absolutely brilliant amazing. Um, and all of that again we're going to give you all of that that opportunity there's 27 elements all together in terms of the stamps and the sentiments and again another huge saving 27 pounds 99 um, i think you can probably get them individually on the website if that's what you wanted but this mm -hmm. is the way to get the biggest saving and i think under 30 pounds is just amazing I know. it's brilliant isn't mm. it really good that quality of yeah. um, stamp and i feel like they make you smile you they know do. Like they're as soon as you see them yeah they're really uplifting really happy yeah. stamped yes and they're they just are. going to you know whether you're going to be doing home decor whether you're mm. going to be doing cards whether you're going to be doing you know scrapbook pages yeah, however exactly. you want to use them they're going to work yeah. perfectly and it's so nice to have something ready to send to your friends or your cousin or your mum or anybody special to you where yes you could make these into you know a birthday card if you wanted but it can be a just because yes. and I I always think it's the nicest thing to not get a bill through the post and to actually get yeah. like a little sentiment yes, or something exactly. like that exactly how perfect would these mm. be just a girlfriend like you say yeah, your sister exactly. or somebody yeah Perfect. Yeah, they're lovely. Um, so that is the price on those £27.99. So you can really sort of, uh, and they work beautifully as well with sort of the butterfly stamps and everything like oh, that. Oh, yeah, you're we're going to so really mix and match with stencils mm. and embossing folders and the stamp and the sentiment stamps, yes. or we're going to just mix everything together. Yeah, which is just brilliant. So well done. Keep on coming through for those as well. Uh, so then we've got here stencils. the stencils. Yes. Now, these are fantastic. So, Brilliant. I love a stencil. You can do mm -hmm. so many techniques with these. So, you're going to get all of these stencils in um, in this bundle. And there's some really lovely different ones. You know, the Isn't bubbles there? and the butterflies, mm -hmm. you know. All, Hearts. Yeah, oh, look at that. The sort of the zigzag. Nice, yeah. Absolutely gorgeous. That roses one you're oh, going to. Oh, wow. Now, there is, these have been named because they when they were first um, brought out, mm -hmm. they were brought out with... The specific so ink it. bundle in okay. mind. Yeah. So let's see if it looks, hopefully it'll come on the screen in just a minute. Mm -hmm. It's just got a bit slow. But don't be fooled by that. <laughs> you can use these with any inks, mm -hmm. any chalks, any yeah. pastes, whatever you want, whatever you like to. So yeah, it says mm -hmm. pigment background stencils. That's because when we launch them, we launch them with a bundle of pigment. I inks. see. Okay. But you don't have to use pigment yeah. inks. No. You can use your dry, uh, quick dry inks. Mm. You can use your water-based inks. Yeah. You could use chalks. You could use um, a paste through them. Mm -hmm. You could even use them to emboss with. So if you yes. run, if you put your um, rubber embossing mat down, then your cardstock, then your stencil, run it through your mm -hmm. die cutting machine, it's going to stencil for you. Brilliant, but if it? you do use oh, it with your pigment inks, can you see this? So this 
this is on black card. Yeah. And then we've used our pigment ink and then we sprinkled over our embossing powder and heat mm. set it. So that's the effect that you're going to get. But you can get that's fantastic effects, yeah. like I say, with all your different inks. Mm. And look at that. Three different cards. Yes. With the same folder, but doing different sort of technique mm -hmm. in ones there. You know, I think that brown, that copper one at the end, yeah. it's got the um, in, in glitter powder. Yes, oh, that's yeah, got some yeah, of that yeah. cardstock that we were looking it at. It has, isn't it? It's yeah. Got, yeah, so that, that's still available on the web. So if you do want to get that, that rose cardstock, yeah. that is still there but on the website. Look at earlier. this. So this has just been used with our inks and then gone in with a white pen to add that bubble How effect. Clever. Doesn't that look lovely? So simple, isn't it? Yes. But it just really, yeah. you know, brings about but something different. You can over stencil. So if you, you that's mm -hmm. been done once and then over stencil to make it sort of busier, you know, bring it yep, yep. more detail. So yeah, absolutely gorgeous. Just love them all. And then there's the rose one that we were talking about. I mean, the, the yeah. roses are just, oh, they're amazing, aren't they? They really are. So sort of timeless and classic yeah. that kind of stencil yeah. as well. But, you know, it could be, if this is the one that's sort of like the, the mm. Rick Rack more design, how about if you bring that in and, it, you know, more mm. male themed cards, yes. you, yeah, know, yeah, you yeah, can yeah. mix and match them, you know, however you want. I just think mm. people don't realise how many things you can do yeah. with a stencil. Yeah, it's brilliant. Oh, yeah. I love them. Um, and all of them, of course. So you can get all of those stencils today for £16.99. So that's for all six of those. So from hearts to butterflies, like we said, to bubbles, to, to the uh, beautiful uh, roses. Filigree. Filigree. Yeah. I mean, yeah. it's, it's just lovely, isn't it? And then, oh, I mean, that's just so yes. distinct as well isn't it i'm so thinking that you yeah. could do that um with gilding mm. um, um wax would look gorgeous that would be it, yeah yes. really yeah, really yeah, yeah. yeah. Give you really a lovely nice. effect. Little look at that, isn't that lovely? Um, so great, great opportunity to get all of those. So all six for that price. Um, add them to your baskets because that is a superb, superb deal. And of course, it is that one-off post in packaging. If you want in this, you're thinking I want classy and sassy. Um, so do of course take advantage of those. Um, and then we've also got another amazing opportunity here that we'll just share with you as well. We wanting to get everything onto the web, and then um, we'll have a little look at some mm -hmm. demos. So oh, there is, there's literally, there's, like, there's so many things. I know, shall I take the, <laughs> yeah, the board to, to yeah, show of you? Course. So these are your embossing folders. And mm -hmm. as I mentioned earlier, they're not just any embossing folder. They yeah. are your 3D embossing folder. And yeah. we've got three different um, sizes. Mm -hmm. I'm just trying to see if I can find the three, one of each of the three yeah. sizes. So you've got your four by six. Mm -hmm. So you can see on here. Now, as I said, these are 3D embossing folders. So when you mm. run your hand over there, you can really feel the emboss. Yeah. But 3D embossing folders, what it means is, is you've got, so this is really raised. Mm -hmm. This is not quite as raised. And then this is in the middle. Mm. So, you, so a regular embossing folder is like yeah. a uniform emboss. Okay. A 2D embossing folder. Every piece is raised the same mm -hmm. amount. So okay. when, you, when you run over, you, there's no variations. Yeah. A 3D embossing folder like these you've got those different mm -hmm. undulations yeah, so it comes up it? so you've yeah. got your four by six mm -hmm. your five by seven mm -hmm. oops and then you oops thank you, you very much <laughs> and then your slim line as well now okay. these are all like framed ones so mm. can you see that e in the center of each one you've got a space for a sentiment yeah. or an embellishment mm -hmm. so those are three yeah i'll show you i just keep going through them mm -hmm. i don't know if they're in any particular order so this is your elegant frame trio yeah. Yeah. i love this one oh, look that's nice, isn't it? look at that so exquisite mm -hmm. blooms mm -hmm. now this is almost like your ex oh luscious lilies but i think you could come oh, like nice. hibiscusy looking if you colored Definitely. it in different ways yes, yeah. i'm going to show you some different mm -hmm. techniques we can letter press yeah. with them oh i love that one yes so these elegant swirls mm. oh i forgot we've got some six by sixes Oh, fancy yes, florals that. i love that because look at that uh -huh. element in there yeah some more you're getting all of these you don't have to choose no elegant <laughs> flourish you've got a paisley one which is your swirling lace we're not there mm -hmm. yet classic lace wow. and another six by mm. six lovely lace wow I mean, that's all amazing. of those yeah yes. all 12 12, 12 of those so yes. normally 71 pounds 88 today 52.99 so you're saving just under 19 pounds on on those which is just absolutely phenomenal um and i feel like if you'd got that many embossing folders you're not going to need anything else are no. you? you've just got something for every occasion you certainly have it's just amazing we're going to show you lots yeah. of different ways yeah but i just all passed these over yes. to you Easy. then we can just sort of show you look at this so you can ink them mm. and like we said add some gilding wax yeah you can color them in now coloring 
people don't realize that once you've stenciled mm -hmm. you can actually go in with your pens with your pencils and pick up the detail so and good. really color yeah. or you can do something that we call letter press so what we've done is we've inked the embossing folder mm -hmm. before we emboss nice. so what it does is it embosses and colors at the yeah. same time mm -hmm. which is a really really clever really technique clever. i do like that one because it's, always, it's position it's it's mm -hmm. almost a creator card. We do a lot of creator yep, cards at yep. Crafters Companion. And it's almost a creator card because it's giving you the three elements, mm. telling you where to put your sentiments, yes, where to put your yeah, embellishments, yeah, yeah. and it's just yeah, sorted. Sort of it just takes done, all the done thought for out. you, isn't it, really? That craft card. Oh, Embossed that craft card. Oh, isn't that wow. beautiful? Yeah. You feel like you could even use these as um, you know bookmarks or something oh, yes. like that as well. You know, they'd just be absolutely lovely, wouldn't they, for... For that as well as cards just all of them just stunning so this is the big bundle so the big bundle is to get all 12 of the embossing folders yep. at 71 88 normally today 52 99 but there is also the opportunities to get them in mini bundles so if you want three mini bundles then you can so we've got the florals that you can get individually so if you wanted to um so we can have a look at those so you can see these ones here i mean again that's still four embossing folders I know. with the saving of nearly a fiver i know it's really really good mm. value and just remember each one has got that element in the middle where you can put your embellishment your sentiment or whatever yep. you want and they're all three dimension 3d Brilliant, three dimensional mm -hmm. yeah so all four of those ones that you've got then we've got the lace uh in terms of the the other opportunity that you can get as well um so once again so it's up to you you can get all 12 biggest saving mm -hmm. or you can go right i want four i know specifically what i want to use these for yeah. and and that's a brilliant way to do it so you've got those four that you can see here in terms of the lace i mean that was the one that really stood out like yes. to us as well that we were saying about i love 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 i these. think people are realizing mm. more and more what they can do with the yeah. embossing folders yeah it's just uh, and like you say you pop it through your gemini it's so easy yeah. to do and yeah. it's just there and it, it is and it's done isn't it yeah so different and then the final opportunity as well which is the elegance so you're going to get four other opportunities for the elegance as well um and that is once again i mean we're looking at under 20 pounds which i know it's just brilliant i mean Madness, that's less than five it? pounds each i know it's really really good value yeah um the rocker blocks as well um yep. that a lot of you have been messaging in saying can we get the rocker blocks can we get the rocker blocks we have got a very very limited amount of them outside right. of the bundle okay. so we'll bring these to you but it is very very limited so this is for you to get um, a two pack of the large so if you want to get those you can uh under a tenner amazing oh wow under 10 pounds i know you know so i think that's why when they first those will actually clothes, go with this block this yep. uh, bundle as well because they're different sizes fantastic so if you do buy this don't worry Adds. about putting those in as well uh -huh. for under 10 pounds yes yep. okie dokes so yeah add them on as well for under 10 pounds and then we've got the pack of four as well so uh if you did want to want to get this also you've you've got the other um opportunity here at nine pounds 99 also so you can jump on but they're very very limited and of course we'll get to see how to use them during the demos as well um okay what shall we do right first? should we crack on so yeah. we do some um we're going to start with um we're going to use our butterflies in, our beautiful butterflies in our stencils mm -hmm. and then we're going to use our gorgeous um, butterfly stamps yep. and I think we should also use a little bit of our positive thought yeah, as definitely. well so just to show you how you can move across mm -hmm. and then on the next one we can do a little bit with our um, with our embossing folder okay. so we really mix it right so let's start with my embossing folder mm -hmm. first so i've got my embossing folder now it's up to you so i've got a piece of card seven by seven um stamping card yep. so it's just out of the bundle and you can mm -hmm. pop that on there now if you want to you can tape it down i like to do a little bit of a spray so i've got my um spray and um stick and spray mm -hmm. which you'll see from crafters companion it's just a repositionable adhesive yeah. it's not going to mark or do anything like that mm -hmm. now where did i put oh where did i put the inks that i wanted i'll find them all in a minute right so i, I picked them sorry i moved yeah, them all got... right so i can just lay that on top oops try and square it up corinne there <laughs> put that there right so i wanted my so i've got my pigment ink where have they gone there we go it was those ones i think it was mm -hmm. Oh, right, make sure I've got the right one. So I need in my pink tulip, mm -hmm. my fuchsia, and my damson wine. So I've got those. So these are my opaque pigment inks. And I've just got, oh, I haven't got any on the back of there, so I'll quickly grab them. Some mm -hmm. daubers. Now, I think we've got daubers on the show. So the round daubers, I think it's the round ones that we've got on. Mm -hmm. So what I tend to do is I would get my daubers for there, mm -hmm. and then in my craft bag, I've got some little Velcro dots. So what I tend to do is I get one of these mm -hmm. and I put it 
on the back of each of my tubs. Yep. Just like this. Just put these on here. So when I finished, I will put the relevant dauber back on to mm -hmm. um, the ink pad. Then I've not got any cross contamination yes. and I know uh -huh. where everything is. Just take in, just keep those there. And yep. then, yeah, so you, the daubers, you get, you, you get through quite a few of these. They last forever, but it just means that I can yeah. just have the right ones. Mm -hmm. So all I'm going to do is I'm just going to um, ink, through, um, ink through these sorry, mm -hmm. nice new purple ones. Pick that up while I was there. So I've got my daubers. So you can, you pick up your daubers. When you first get them, you'll get your daubers with um, with the refills or you can just get the refills as well. Now, that I find the easiest way, put a little bit of ink onto my glass mat or if you haven't got a glass mat, get a little mm -hmm. piece of acetate, work with a piece of acetate. Okay. Um, I find that quite useful. Um, again, it helps. And then all we need to do is we're going to pick up some of our ink and mm -hmm. we're just going to just randomly pick it up so we're going to pick it up and then it's yep. up to you how you color so we can come down the mm -hmm. center of our butterflies now what I always think is when you are stenciling you often think to yourself I've not done enough when you put it through your stencil it mm. never looks very much but when you lift it up it's amazing how much has actually transferred yep. so don't be mistaken because we've got the glue on the back, I can always lift it up. Can you see? I can see. Yes, yeah. Hopefully you can just about see that mm -hmm. there. And I know it's going to go back in the right place. So have a little look. But actually, you will have transferred a lot more ink than mm -hmm. you perhaps realise. And this is how easy it is to do. But what we could have also done as well is we could have, um, like I say, embossed with these stencils mm -hmm. and then inked once we'd embossed. If you wanted to, just put it onto your rubber mat and through it goes. So not I'm not trying to be too uniform, just a little bit of my pink down the centre. Mm -hmm. Just like that. There we go. There we are. Mix and match. But it's lovely to really make your own, make them personal, make them, mm. you know, so you can pick the colours that suit the person. And then we're going to come in with a little bit of our, um, so this one is our fuchsia, and then we're going to come down the edges just put it through there just like that pick it up just come all the way down and you'd be surprised by how much has transferred more than you perhaps mm -hmm. realize at first just work it through there we go I think it's quite relaxing as well oh so yeah I would hopefully you take a little bit longer doing these than mm. I'm doing but look at, can you see yeah yeah. Can you see that really starting mm -hmm. to come together? Let's put a little bit more ink down. Yeah. There we go. I like, one of the techniques I like doing is sort of um, an ombre effect as well. Okay. So you could, you could sort of just um, do like your light mm -hmm. pink, all of them, and then come down to your dark yeah, purple really nice. at the bottom. Yeah. You know, different, different effects. Mm -hmm. Let's do that there. Actually, I think I might do the purple slightly different. So, mm -hmm. I think the other thing we've got on the... We might have, have we got the finger daubers available today? Uh, I thought we look. might have done. It might have changed, but at one point they were going to be available. These mm. things change when things sell out. Yeah. Well, we haven't... All right, we've got the kit with these in. So, so that would give, give you the, yeah, yeah, yeah. Give you the yeah. handle and the daubers. Yeah, yeah. But just to show, just I'll carry on with this one, but I'll mm -hmm. just show you how the finger daubers work. Yeah. They're just to allow you to a little bit more control. There's my pink. I'm just going to mm -hmm. come down with my pink down the centres for a little bit more. And then the finger daubers, all they mm -hmm. are is they're like individual little daubers. So hopefully you can pick, some, pick them up when they mm. come back in. So you literally, you just pop them onto the end, pick Brilliant, it up, and then we can then... Yeah. Really, so you can get into like the little nooks and crannies with these. Mm -hmm. Just come round the edge. So yeah. let's come round the edges of here. Mm -hmm. There we go. Just all the way down and pick it up. Fab. But I just, you, know, you yeah. can get lost in, um, in inking and things Definitely. like this because it's, it's just so much fun. Mm -hmm. And don't worry, your inks aren't going to do your stencils any harm. All we do is when we've finished, We'll just wipe over with a cloth or a wipe, mm -hmm. you know, whichever you, however you prefer to clean off yours, then you'll be able to, yep. to do this. But, you know, pick some colours that you really like mm -hmm. or work for the person that you're sending the card to. But don't, 
I'm not trying to be too perfect, too uniformed, mm -hmm. if that makes sense. Yeah. Just trying to mix and match it around a little yeah. bit. There we go. And then, there we are. Pop that like that. There we go. We've got um, a bundle as well of the colours, so if you are wanting to get those ink pads that you're seeing being used, then we've just popped them onto the um, onto the telly for you, the graphics as well, so that's QS2039, um, and that's to give you the opportunity to get nine of these ink pads as well, so another saving of £5 on them. Yes, all helps, doesn't it? it yeah, yeah, yeah. Builds up your stash and exactly. does... There we go. So I think that'll do it. I'm trying... To, it's a background mm, at the end lovely, of the day, yeah. so it's not going to be uh -huh. too, too, you know too strong yeah just make sure i've not missed any out mm -hmm. just want to get a little bit into the background just like that there yeah. we go and then we can reveal what we've done so then i can just peel that back and how perfect mm. let me turn that around so you can see That's how gorgeous yeah. is that right now we can make this even better because mm -hmm. what we're going to do is let me just get the right color so we're going to get our quick dry in our ocean blue and our lemon tonic and i'm going to pop these onto my mat mm -hmm. there we go put those like that and i'm going to just i've got a little bit of water mm -hmm. just put it in my you don't have to put it in a spritz bottle but i've just put it in there yes. just so that i didn't i know what i'm like <laughs> and things like that do tend to um where's my brush gone? i'd knock it over yeah, <laughs> yes exactly and all i'm going to do is pick it up mm -hmm. and then splatter there we go just using my finger mm -hmm to splatter again look at that yeah look at how that's now uh -huh. picking up those extra elements come on mm. there we go lovely pick it up if i mm -hmm. might need a little bit more water on there ah there we go it's coming through yeah. now and clean that brush off mm -hmm. and then i can pick up the blue oh look at that i can see that now you can really really go to town and add in oh, move that up a little bit so you can see can mm -hmm. you see how that's picking yep. that up there we go and that's just one way mm -hmm. you can use your stencils yeah hopefully you can see those colors because we're trying not to do it overly strong but look at that doesn't that look pretty right mm -hmm. i'm just going to clear up this because otherwise we will have ink on everything <laughs> there we go right oops that's mm -hmm. rolling off so once we've done that so that's going to be my background yep so we need to bring something to the foreground next mm -hmm. right let's make sure that's dry there we go right let's move those out of the way because we've finished with those for a minute and then we're going to put that to one side we need to do our stamping so this one i'm actually going to use my stamping platform but i yep. will i will use my rocker block in a minute mm -hmm. that's just because this is just quite large so we're going to use our stamp and we're going to bring that in up all the way. So all I've done is just use one of my foundation circles. Mm -hmm. We've all got foundation circles and it would just cut it out so that my mm, perfect per, it fits on there. So let's bring in the stamping platform. Yeah. So I, every, a lot of people have stamping platforms. Mm -hmm. So stamping platform is just something that's going to allow you to, to do your stamping and it just I just find it gives me so much more control. I mm. use a stamping platform all the time. So it just means that you can, you can re-ink and re-stamp if you need to. Yes. So all I've done is I've, I've put the magnets to hold my cardstock down. I put my stamp where I want it to, and then I'm just going to pick it up like mm -hmm. that. And you can see it like that. Now, one, a top tip I, I've heard quite recently, yeah. where's it gone, is if this is the first time you have used a stamp i brought mm -hmm. it in it was in here just a minute ago as it rolled away is get yourself you know a lint roller oh yes okay mine's gone it was in here a few minutes ago anyway i'll find it in a minute mm -hmm. and roll over stamp for the first time with the lint roller okay. and it just re removes any um of your sort oh. of covering any sort of That's chemicals clever. from yes. the processing yeah. it was here just no a idea. few minutes ago and now i can't see it it's probably rolled under there but someone's took it to roll it on their legs and <laughs> like you know clean so, up there <laughs> so what we need to do is we ink up our stamp mm -hmm. and then just tap don't drag yeah. just tap your um ink over mm -hmm. and you can see where it's gone but come in at different angles because sometimes if you if you do everything in that direction mm -hmm. you'll miss some bits so you know turn your ink pad round and get in from all the different angles and you can see that you've covered but mm. you're using a stamping platform so don't worry too much because we can always go 
back in if you've missed a bit. Now, again, these, like we said, are your polymer stamps, so they're your top quality stamps. Mm -hmm. so all I do is put it back into there, and then I press it down, and then I just press. And I don't mean I can one-handed i know it's not going to move it can lift up i can go back down yeah. and i know it's going to be um in the right yeah. place yeah really perfect way to start i yeah. very rarely stamp without a stamp up if it's a smaller yeah. stamp i might use my rocker blocks but look yeah, at that perfect, absolutely yeah. perfect mm -hmm. every time give my stamp a quick wipe just a dry cloth and that's all you need yeah. to do there look mm -hmm. at how strong these stamps are Brilliant, absolutely them? Brilliant. Now I need that twice. I've got it once on here with, let's lift that one up. So I've got it once on mm -hmm. here and then I've got it once on just some, um, so that's my stamping card and yep. that's my Nina card. So the difference is your Nina card is perfect for your alcohol pens. Mm -hmm. And this one, I'm not going to colour. All I'm going to do is I'm going to come in with a fine liner pen yep. and these are just our art liners and they work with all your different mediums. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to just do a little pattern oh, nice, all yeah. the way around like a faux not a faux stitch but just a faux border type yeah. thing just a little pattern mm -hmm. here try not to be if you if you try to do it perfectly mm -hmm. then you've got to, you're going to see all the flaws so just give it a little bit of a wiggle and just mm -hmm. <coughs> sorry, come in all the way around here now this these ones are not going to be colored in because they're going to be mm -hmm. our base layer so we can pop that on there. Oh, yeah, just yeah. put there. There we go. Okay. And we're not going to do any more to that. We're going to do a very similar two here. We're just going to put a border just around here. So we've, we've got the synergy here now. Can you see? So we're tying the two layers together. Yeah. Not only have we got the butterflies, but we've got the similar mm. border as well. Mm -hmm. There we go. Just all the way around. There we are. So just to show you how embossing um, stencils rather yeah. and your stamps work so well together. And you know, we've given you the the right card, the stamping card, and the ink pads. You know, you've got all of you've got everything on the show today mm -hmm. that you might need. So you know, you don't have to think about what you're using because yeah, it's exactly. all it's all there, which is what I love. Just all the way around. We have um, Sandra who does a scent angle. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And these are the very simple sort of pens to what she yes, would be yeah. using. So, uh -huh. yeah, borrow your, borrow your yeah, scent angle fun. pens. Uh, so yeah. once we've got that, so like I say, I'm not going to colour that one in, but I'm going to come here and I'm not, I haven't got time to colour them all in, otherwise yeah. I'll be here for a while. <laughs> all you want to do is grab a couple of pens. So these are my alcohol pens. These mm -hmm. are my tri-blends. Now, we've got tri-blends on the show yes. yeah. because I saw Jimmy with them. Well, we've got them on yep. one of the shows today. Yeah, we have so they're definitely them, yeah. around. Let's yeah. go with a lovely mm -hmm. sort of green and blue. So what you've got with these is your tri-blends yep. is you've got three colours in one um, pen. It's so good how so, it yeah. gives you that. So you've got your. So this is my citrus blend because mm -hmm. it says on there, and I've got my CT one citrus mm -hmm. one citrus two and citrus three. Oh look at that! We, there they are. We ask yep. and he appears. Mm -hmm. And then I've also got my aqua blue blend, which has got my AB one, two and three. They always go up in steps. They mm -hmm. don't always. They're not always sequential numbers. Okay. They might be one three and four mm -hmm. but they're always going up in shades yeah yes yeah, so you can blend, uh, but they blend beautifully. it gives you then really like three pens in one oh it? yes yes so th colors. that says 24 pens yeah. that you've got in your hand 72 colors yes yeah 72 colors mm -hmm. wow that price yeah. is good Really good, isn't it? Yeah, <laughs> I was expecting it to be just under seventy pounds. <laughs> yeah, because that's what they normally yeah. are. Normally are so normally sixty seven ninety nine, but today a big saving fifty four thirty nine for you to be able to get that. You should say seventy two colours within that, which is just yeah, brilliant. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. So all I'm going to do now. Remember, we've stamped this with our alcohol proof ink. So I'm going to come in here first and cut and lay down a little bit of my lightest colour. Mm -hmm. Then I can come in if I wanted to, and I can add a little bit more depth and come yeah. through, and they will. Blend Blend perfectly, and you can even go with your darkest colour mm -hmm. just through there. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to come in with my blue, and I'm going to again lay down my lightest colour. So I'm, there's nothing too complicated mm -hmm. here at all. Just laying that down. I'm going to do one side at a time, and then I'm going to work 
from the, the outside in, I think, on this one, mm -hmm. taking the next colour, so you can just take it not quite to the um, middle, and then my darkest colour, I'm literally just going to do round the edge. Can you see like that? Yeah, I then that. I will then take my lighter colour and I will just blend those together. And it mm -hmm. should be almost seamless when we finish. Then come back in with my yellow, I'm going to yep. go with my lighter colour, and then I'm just going to blend over those so that we get mm -hmm. that perfect blend. And that's how I would work all the way around. So I always lay down, my lightest colour yep. wets the card. So what you're doing is you're wetting the card with the lightest colour so that the other colours blend. Okay. Mm -hmm. So you always start with your lighter colour first. Yeah. And then you lay down your next colour mm. and then your darker colour just at the edge. It looks like paint as well, doesn't it? Yes. It, yeah. It's just brilliant, the effect they give. And then... And I should actually have a piece of card underneath, which I've not done. I keep forgetting to do that because that will then absorb it. So I should mm -hmm. put another piece up to it. But just work around with these mm -hmm. and then cut them out. OK, so it just takes a few minutes and they're really easy to mm -hmm. fussy cut out. Don't worry about cutting out the antennae or anything like yeah. that. And I've got these, kept them in the bag so that they didn't oh, fly lovely. away uh -huh. because I know what I'm like. And then this is what you get. So like I say, don't, that was the one we've just done. We don't cut. We don't cut the antennae out. That's. Mm -hmm. But we just literally cut them out with our scissors, and that's going to go onto our card. I just want to quickly stamp one yep. of the sentiments with the rocker block. Okay. Just super. to show you yep. how easy they are. Mm -hmm. I've got one done there, but just to show you. So I've got my sentiment. Yeah. I've got my rocker block. Mm -hmm. Pop that onto there. Now you can do this with any black ink. I hope that's going to. Have mm -hmm. I got that one picking up. I hope it is. And it's not too. Will it go better that way? Let me see if that way goes. I think that way is better. Yep. Right, so where's my black ink pad? And then we can pop that on there, ink it. Now these, you're not going to be able to really go in a second time, but you yes, can yeah. You can go backwards and forwards, but just make sure they're inked up enough, enough. because yeah. you can't... Uh -huh. Not like the stamping no. where you can go back. Yeah. So all we do is we come down to one side, so we've got it down, and then we just roll it across. Okay. And that will then, I can see it mm. flattening. Yeah. But you can see we can go across a couple of times mm -hmm. because it's just holding where it needs to be. We can, so we've gone roll and lift. Oh, and I didn't, let me do that again. I didn't press hard enough at one point. That's my fault. Try again. Well, I think so, that, that's the thing with all of these things. Even if it doesn't fully come out the first time, you can just do it again. Yeah. It takes such a small amount of time it does. that it just doesn't matter. There we go. There we go. I can see that. So I can come backwards and forwards. Mm -hmm. The rocker block is holding it in place. Yeah. Let's just see. Yeah, I haven't cu quite caught it. But live, I should have put my mat underneath. Okay. But that mm -hmm. will then yeah. print out just Lovely. like yeah, that. There so, we go. Yeah. We can see. That's printed out. So let's just put mm -hmm. all of these elements together. Yep. I might not get them all on, but I've got one that I can show you that's mm -hmm. finished. So I've got my card. Yep. Let's do it as a side opening card. Now, all I've done, save card, I've just cut a, a matte circle out yep. there. We like to be efficient with our card because, mm -hmm. you know, it saves us on card if we can. Yeah, which we always want. You don't want to waste any, no, do you? exactly. We can put that on there. Mm -hmm. Nice border around the outside. And then we're going to come in with our gorgeous one that we've um, stenciled. Mm -hmm. Onto there. Let's yeah. make sure the butterflies are the right way up. Because mm -hmm. that would be something that would really annoy me <laughs> if I got that yes. the wrong way around. Pop that one onto there. Yeah. And then I'm not doing any um, height or any dimension mm -hmm. at the moment. That's it. Just... And look at this, tape runners. You can go round in circles. Uh -huh. Perfect, isn't it? Put that in the centre. If you wanted to add a little bit of height, that's the sort of point it would look nice yeah, yeah. to do. Let's go round, all the way round. And then we can pop that one onto mm -hmm. there. Yeah. Oh, and okay. then all we need to do is we get our gorgeous little butterflies. Mm -hmm. And all I'm going to do is I'm just going to curve them and then lift them up. So I need two different glues. So I'm going to mm -hmm. go in with my wet glue, yep. just there. And then I'm going to get my three-dimensional glue, which is here. So this is just like your Collal glue. I think we've probably had it in kits at some point. You probably yep. have seen it. It might be on the website. And I'm just going to put a little, oops, 
I've dropped that. A little bead of glue under there. Mm -hmm. And then I've just got to work out which one was that. I should have worked that one out before. There he is, is that one. <laughs> and then I can just pop that uh, over there. And yeah. what we've done is that little bead of glue is mm -hmm. just going to hold it down. So that one is, yes, that's what I should have mm -hmm. done to begin with. Make sure, and so we can come all the way around there. Wet glue. It's all about having the right tools, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. And, you know, does it matter that you've used two different glues? I don't think so, mm. you know. But you're going to be able to make... Butterflies are yeah. so, so special on cards. You're going to, you know, lot of... There we go, look at that. Oh, I love Let's it. just put... A but mixing those mm. colours in... Mm -hmm. Absolutely beautiful. Yeah. I always think as well, butterfly is very much about kind of new starts, you know, hope, positivity. I was about so to say, it's a very positive love them, don't they? Um, emblem, isn't mm -hmm. it, a butterfly? Yeah. And this year as well, I mean, a lot of our, our big sort of designers and big, say, jewellery brands and everything like this, it's all been about the butterfly and yeah. the emblem of the butterfly. Yeah, so exactly. it's very sort of bang on trend at the moment. Exactly. So you can carry on going like that. Let me just show you. I'm going to do this quickly. Mm -hmm. I can, can use that. Yep. So I can put that onto there. You could use a foam pad, or I mm -hmm. just put for speed, going to put some glue gel on just yep. there and put that in the centre. But I think actually, I'm just looking at this mm -hmm. and thinking, if I sort of did this, I could I could um, come in with my largest ones. Where have I put one on the wrong? Yes, I have. He goes up here. Look, <laughs> look at that. That goes there. Let's put that one on because it's a bit sticky. If you uh -huh. wanted to, you don't have to do all of them. It no. would look quite nice with just doing mm -hmm. a few of them. Definitely. And then we can put that one. I'll show you. Put that one onto there. Mm -hmm. And here you go. There we go. That's the right one yeah. on there. Really but nice. keep going round like mm -hmm. that. And let me bring in the one that I finished. And look at that. Wow. So nice. I'm just going to lift it so you can see how they're just slightly raised. Mm -hmm. But how... Beautiful is that. Looks absolutely gorgeous. gorgeous. So that's just a really mm. sten simple stencil wow. stamp mm -hmm. and then our sentiment stamp. It's brilliant, isn't it? Yeah. It's just so shows good. you how you look at a bundle and yeah. you think, oh, mm -hmm. but then when you start to work it all together, exactly. they work so, so well, yep. don't they? Um, and, you know, when you think the whole bundle is is under under £30, you know, if I just show you that um, at a distance just there, um, you, you know, you can just see it's an absolutely amazing, amazing look, isn't it? It's a gorgeous piece as well. And and for that whole bundle, you are getting that stamp that we saw, obviously, with the, with the butterflies. It's got so much kind of within that as well, as you can see. Uh, if nothing ever changed, there would be no butterflies. You've then got the sentiment stamping kit you've got the rocker blocks as well that we sure being used and the card kit as well as the ink pad so all of that coming to you at 27.99 and i think like you said corinne it's sort of like the perfect way to start your stamping mm, journey exactly or to obviously if you're already an experienced stamper it's great to have all of this in your stash but if you've never done it before i don't really think you'd get much better than that no no i've Brilliant. just seen this time mm. i didn't realize how we've the time we've time just flies, doesn't it? We're enjoying ourselves so much. We're like, I think oh, I'd yes, better show you a few techniques. Yes, the embossing folder. Yeah, sure. Do you want to touch? Oh, you've got some. I've got my embossing got folders. Yeah, uh, only if you're ready. When you're yeah, ready, yeah. I can. No problem. Right. At all. Okay. You're let's ready. have a look. I'm just mindful of the time, and I don't want people to not to see yes. yeah, yeah, yeah. the embossing folders. So let me grab. If, if there's anything we don't fit in, we can always bring it into the, the final hour yeah, anyway. We can. We can. We can. Right. So let's show you with mm. these embossing folders because I talked about techniques, and yeah. sometimes when we talk about techniques, it can be a little bit overwhelming. Mm -hmm. um, so you've got 12 embossing folders, as you saw. Yes. You can either buy the all. All of the bundle, mm -hmm. all of the embossing folders together, yeah. or you can buy them in smaller bundles. Yeah. So how would you want to use this? So let me just show you a couple of different ways to mm -hmm. use them. I've got a couple of pieces of card here. So for my first one, which is my smaller, my four by six, is that right? They are four by six, yes. Yeah. Yes. You know, when you look at something and you think, I know. <laughs> can I size that up right? Uh -huh. And then, so I've got my card to just over four by six, just to begin with. So that's going to fit perfectly into my embossing folder. So mm. when you look at here, you've got a sa one side that's dipped and one side that's raised. So I'm going to put my cardstock in there. So what I want mm -hmm. to do here is I'm going to get this and I'm going to get my ink and I'm going to make sure I get the right one with my pale fig. Mm -hmm. So now I'm using my, um, that's not pale fig. Where's my pale fig? There it is. Yeah. 
There we go. I've got so many. So let's see if we can find my quick yeah. dry. All of the colours are available for you as well. So once again, if you do want to take, um, you know, any of the, the bundles of the paints as well, we can bring those into you so you can kind of get those ready. to go with these. Right, yep. I've got my quick dry pale fix. So mm -hmm. what I want to do is I want to letter press. Now, if I put it onto this side, this is the, the side that's dipped, it's going to um, em emboss the bit that's raised. Okay. I want to emboss the bit that's dipped. Yep. So I need to do it onto this where it's raised. So what you've got to do is you've got to dab onto here. Don't drag it over, just dab. Now these are really inky mm -hmm. um, ink pads or wet ink pads, if you know what I mean. Yep. So I can just, I'm just going to actually grab my cloth that I had just one minute ago. I think that was a really wet ink pad. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to just take a little bit out because that was a little bit wet on there. Mm -hmm. There we are. Then it's just tap along the top, just making sure it only hits the top. Don't drag. If you drag, you're going to get a different effect. But if you can just tap, mm -hmm. then you're going to get a lovely, lovely effect. So put that on there. Now, when you do this, you need to be careful. So you don't want your card to move. So the way mm -hmm. I tend to do it is I put my card onto, this is my personal choice, yeah, yeah. card onto the wet side mm -hmm. and then layer that down. Okay, so don't yes. let that move. Yeah. Now. What you remember, that, mm -hmm. if you can see, is much thicker than a die. Yeah. Much, much thicker mm -hmm. than a die. So we need to adjust our plates. Okay. If this was a 2D embossing folder, I'd have my um, two cutting plates mm -hmm. and my plastic shim. Okay. This is a 3D embossing folder. So I'm not going to use my plastic shim. I'm going to use my magnetic shim. Yeah. Because my magnetic shim is slightly thinner mm -hmm. than my plastic shim. Yeah. And offer that up. So there we go. So all of the instructions and when you get your Gemini, yeah. oh, it will be in there. That has just taken that one out. Let's see if that's going through. Mm -hmm. Oops, where's that gone? No, it's just a minute. <laughs> <laughs> now congratulations to everybody who's already checked out on this machine you can see some of your names at the bottom we've got people buying twos threes um we started obviously with with the full quantity of 500 of these there is less than 40 now available so we are very much kind of last chances last opportunities for you to be able to get these and remember that that any any viewers that come in the future where we can give you this it is limited to just a thousand i believe but the the other the, the 500 won't have this little goodie bag with it so we're saying 179 you know price for Gemini but you are getting a £79 goodie bag coming with this which makes the Gemini about £100 so it is a launch price that only having launched with Sara a couple of days ago uh, just on Wednesday just on Wednesday so it was that that launch of the new colour and it's just brilliant actually that because we said oh is there any way we can bring it today yeah. still with the goodie bag and we wasn't sure and obviously she was like yes you know we've still got this amount. I'll tell you so. what I was doing yeah. I'll be open and honest I'd use the wrong plate combination that was me yes. rushing so mm -hmm. 3D embossing folder I will stand okay. Clear plate, okay. yep. magnetic, and oh. plastic shift. Yes. Right. Just okay. that was me. Forget it. Mm -hmm. So then we can letter press, and you can see on this, it has inked on the bottom, oh, look, yeah. and look, the top is mm -hmm. totally white. How beautiful is oh, that? Clever. So let's just do the other one. Now we've mm -hmm. got the plate combination. I've got my second folder. This yep. is my swirling lace. Now we've got the plate combination. Right. Sorry about that. That was me rushing through. Yeah. And put that right. So yeah, mm -hmm. plastic um, cutting plate. Magnetic shim, mm -hmm. um, clear um, plastic shim, cutting plate, magnetic shim, clear uh, plastic shim. Yeah. It's still the names of them. Sometimes I, I stumble over the names because you, there yeah. are so many names for the plates. I think as well probably because you use it so often, you do it so automatically. Yes. You know, it's not about... right. So we've got that one there that's yeah um, embossed oh, there. Yeah. Now look at this one. This one has got no ink mm. on it at all. And all we need to do now is we've got our ink mm -hmm. pad and then we can grab our inks and then we blend over the top. Uh -huh. So now, can you see on this one, yes. we've got the deboss mm -hmm. and on this one, we've got the emboss. Yeah, yeah. Can you see, we can do on here uh -huh. and we ink the emboss. They're amazing. Now, the I can come right into the middle because I'm not actually going to see the middle of this card. So okay. don't worry about it being, you mm -hmm. know, messy and inky in the middle. So once you've inked, look at that, just, mm. can you see it almost might makes the, the bits of the emboss come to life as you go over them. Yep. Sometimes I love doing embossing, emboss on black and mm -hmm. you can't see it. Then go over it with a gilding wax. It's like you've got a magic 
in magic uh -huh. finger and as you drag it across yeah. it's like all the embossed just oh. pops out it's really amazing you should get so excited but you do yeah. you get yeah, yeah, really you really <laughs> excited about doing that so mm -hmm. just to show you we've got the emboss and the deboss yeah but if you then let me just bring them in to show you mm -hmm. when you're finished trim them down ink it round the edges mm -hmm. with our ink and the same with that one and then when you pop them together look at how lovely that mm -hmm. will look yeah just to show you just on there there we go that one's going mm -hmm. to go on there that's going to go on there we're going to add in a sentiment i'm just mindful of the time is running mm -hmm. slow and again we can use those gorgeous positive thoughts yeah. a little bow but how pretty is that you don't need mm -hmm. lots more other than your embossing no, folders you don't oh, i just think i think embossing as well if you've not seen it or done it yourself before when you see it firsthand it's just so clever isn't it, it kind is. of how it pops out yeah. and, and the effect it gives yeah. It's brilliant. Um, and again, you know, that's how easy you can put these together. Now, those embossing folders, which we have, of course, the three different sizes of. So you've got right from the six by four, the five by five, up to the five by seven. You can get them all, so all 12 of those, if you want to, for the price on your screen. Alternatively, like we say with everything, jump onto the web. You can get mini bundles. You can get them individually as well. So it's, it's really just about uh, what, what you would like to get. Um, OK, do you know what? We're just going to really quickly announce. You can keep coming through for all of this. but is who has won the Drop the Word competition today? Now, it means that when I've been saying those words, you've had to email in, let us know which ones you've heard. And you will get, now we've, we've chose three of you, and we're going to give you all £10 credited to your account, OK? Are you ready for this? Here comes the winners. Here's the names. Julie Thomas, well done to Amanda Clark and Claire Ambrose. So all three of you are going to get £10 credited to your account. So, of course, if you want to buy something for that £10, which is going to be credited, then, then you could absolutely do that. Well done. And thank you for getting involved. We'll have more games, obviously, tomorrow and right up until Monday as well with more giveaways. So I must have been absorbed because I haven't noticed you dropped the words in. <laughs> I haven't. Just normal conversation, Just isn't normal it? Conversation. It's like, you know, <laughs> talking about chocolate, talking about chicks, talking about rabbits, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I've not noticed at all. I must have been absorbed in my card making. You, you could have been the winner. Uh, if I you'd could have been. <laughs> <laughs> well, well done to all of you that, that have obviously managed to get this. And I think it's great because you get a little freebie and now you might be thinking, well, actually, I've not had an embossing no. um, folder before. Maybe that's what I'll go exactly, for. Exactly, yeah. Perfect opportunity. Yeah. <laughs> behind the counter. We've got <laughs> so much behind the counter. Got literally on, so, no, so this much. This is your yeah. perfect mm -hmm. sort of way. Just to show you, it? it's not all about dyes. We love no. our dyes, mm -hmm. but sometimes you want to use other yeah. techniques with your embossing folders, with your stencils, exactly. with your stamps. There are so many mm. different ways. So much. And Absolutely. these stencils, again, I mean, they're, they're classy and sassy. If you want to get them, uh, I absolutely adore them. Lots of you coming through still to get the brand new Gemini and the candy floss colour as well. So well done to Graham, to Crafters, Gillian, Kath, Barbara, Marie. Um, you've still got an opportunity on that. Uh, we've got your classy and sassy up there now. Again, under £30. But we'll be back in an hour. Yes. Where we'll bring you back um, slim many line. bits. Yes. Slimline. Uh, slim slimline dyes. Yes, mm -hmm. perfect. Be amazing. So please do join us in an hour. Keep checking out your baskets and we'll be back uh, in a few moments with more, many, many more opportunities for you to get those incredible MDF um, opportunities, including the Bunton, looking at the new boxes, so don't go anywhere. Here at Hobbymaker, we love seeing what you've been making and it's our job to keep you inspired. So how does a £100 credit to your Hobbymaker account sound? Every month, we're going to be giving away a £100 credit to one lucky Hobbymaker's account. And all you have to do to enter is simply send a photo of your crafty makes to studio at hobbymaker.co.uk. We will be picking one winner each month at random and we'll announce the lucky winner on air in the 5pm show on the last Saturday of every month. So what are you waiting for? Get crafting, get motivated and get inspired with Hobbymaker. Our call centre is based in the UK and available 24-7. Just call 0800 001 4433 or email help at hobbymaker.co.uk.
I am Sandra Rushton and I am the owner of Sandtangle, which is a small business in Lincolnshire where it's only been going uh, three years or so, but uh, we are really, really passionate about what we do. So it's a very mindful form of art. That's its basic core. So if you can hold a pen and draw a line, you can tangle. And it's about that mindfulness, that relaxation, and about you having a moment just for you. But as a result of you having that moment of putting pen to paper, you can create wonderful works of art. We do a lot of live videos, so we're very, very invested in education. We like to have people come to classes, but then of course the products that I design, we make ourselves. So we're involved in every step of the way, from the very, very, say the very first drawing, to how it goes onto the computers, to how it's machined, to even books that we still hand make. Oh, I'm looking forward to seeing where we go. It's the start of something new, and I honestly, I feel that. I feel that it's something exciting, and I'm, I'm so glad I'm in at the beginning, because I don't know where it's going, but it's only going somewhere good. This is the place for me. Join us this Easter bank holiday weekend here on Hobbymaker for our Easter extravaganza. On Friday, brand new slimline nesting dies from Crafter's Companion and Stamping Essentials. Burton Gertz with brand new Jubilee themed MDF. On Saturday, we've brand new woodware bubble balloon stamps from Creative Expressions plus Cosmic Shimmers. Be creative with Stamper's Friends Show Special and Screen Pal. And on Sunday, hunky-dory Easter deals with Dreamies and their launch show. And on Monday, Creative Expressions, Native Lighting and Crafter's Companion. Also, shop between Friday the 15th to Monday the 18th and one lucky person will win their Easter basket for free. Now, if you shop with us last weekend, don't forget to use your 10% off discount code. So a great lineup. Make sure you stay tuned this Easter weekend here on Hobbymaker. Hobbymaker are proud to work alongside some of the biggest brands in the industry. Keep watching for these brands and many more here on Hobbymaker. When you purchase anything on Hobbymaker, you have a 30-day money-back guarantee, meaning that you can shop with confidence. Happy shopping with Hobbymaker. It is time to reveal our five Search for Star sewing finalists. Earlier on in the year, we asked you, our viewers, to apply to be our next Sewing Street Sewing Star and we were overwhelmed with the amount of applicants. We have watched hours of audition videos and we have somehow managed to narrow it down to our chosen five finalists. Our five very talented finalists will be on your screen next week from Monday the 4th of April to Friday the 8th of April and we've dedicated an hour each day to each contestant to do their demonstrations. We're handing over the choice of the winner to you. So on the Friday, after everybody's done their live demonstrations, the voting will be open. Join us all next week to help us choose our Sewing Street Sewing Star. Hello, I'm a... Okay, I totally missed that. I'm having a lovely <laughs> chat over here. Uh, me and Pauline are just like, yeah, I'm just, just having a conversation. I'm like, oh, I'm back on screen. I haven't noticed that. Hello. Um, <laughs> just nattering away about, you know, lovely place in the world that Pauline lives. And <laughs> I'm like, I want to come there a bit more to go in the pool. Um, <laughs> sounds like you've got a pool in your house now. You're very welcome. <laughs> Thank you. Um, right, now we have got another amazing, amazing hour lined up. Remember everything that we already showed you in the first hour. Uh, with Burts and Gertz, you can jump straight onto the web still and get. So if you want in the bunting, you want in any of the signs or anything in front of me, you can get that. But I'm excited about this because we are about to, to have a look at those boxes that I was talking to you about and how you can actually construct these as well, um, which is, is going to be um, absolutely fantastic. So so the, the boxes, are, are, they, are they easy to construct? Because they look really, really fancy. Do you know what? Because mm. Jason makes them easy. Yeah. To, to <laughs> That's what it is. Because he's got me on the other end trying to put them together. So <laughs> right. it has to be, yeah. you know, foolproof. Uh -huh. um, but they are so, so lovely. Yeah. They really are. And in conjunction with the paper pad that we've got, um, yeah. it's so lovely. But what we've, we've mm -hmm. they're an ideal size as well mm -hmm. for keeping your new ink gold that we have. Definitely. So if I just pull this one back yep. here mm -hmm. and open the drawer there, and you can see, you can get them, mm -hmm. uh, and three, if I pull the drawer out, you can see 
how large they are. And I think you can get three in there, Jason, yeah. is that right? Yeah, yeah, you've got three easily in there. Yeah? And then oh, with your wow. brushes Plus, you can well. put your brushes down yeah. the side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, So, yeah, they work, work really, really well. Yeah. Um, beautiful construction, mm -hmm. lovely size. But, you know, you can, you can yeah. use them for whatever you want, really. But lovely little kind of like jewellery holders as well, little trinket holders that yeah. you've got there. Yeah. Um, just so much you could use them for. And because Absolutely. you can personalise them, of course, with, like you said, the paper pads or paints or anything. You can yeah. make them work in any room. Well, the paper pad that we've got, um, Jason has picked this mm. one out. Yeah. Particularly because it's good correspondence, travel, that kind Definitely. of thing. Yes. So it goes with the theme of, of yeah. what we've got. Uh -huh. But yes, you can... Yeah. You can do. But I had to do it with a paper pad. Mm -hmm. I had to do, I love making paper roses. Yes. So you can see here, I put some on my box. Yeah. But I've also got them here. So um, and these are the papers out of the pad. Oh, um, wow. And made, I, I'd like to put them on sticks. Oh, They're actually yeah. long stemmed oh, uh, cotton buds. Oh, okay. Um, yeah. But they work beautifully. But uh -huh. these are my Jubilee roses. They're amazing. To go with the theme. But yeah, so I yeah. cut some and put them on um, yeah, beautiful. on there on there as well to go mm -hmm. over the edge of the box. That's fantastic. Um, now, of course, you are getting this. So it's a triple um, desk top drawer. So you've got the three um, the three uh, pullouts that you've got with this. You can see that usually nineteen ninety nine, taking it down to the very very lowest price for you to be able to get this today. And you're going to construct one, Jason. Yep, I am. They're yep. brand new, brand yep. new today to the show. So we're going to see exactly how to actually put them together. Yep, um, we are. Uh, and it's my first demo on the chapel. Oh, is it? <laughs> Here you go. <laughs> so my advice when you do get them home is to separate the, the bits out. Okay. So you'll see that you've got the um, the um, slots mm -hmm. in these ones where the um, yeah yeah the separate kind of uh, drawers are going to go. Mm -hmm. um, you've got your drawer fronts with the hearts on, and then you've got the drawer backs, and then you'll see with the drawers that they fit. So you've got four notches on the one mm -hmm. end of the the drawers, which fits in the drawer back, and you've got two notches on the front which fits the drawer front okay. so you can't put them together the wrong way yeah, around yeah yeah um, you can try <laughs> you, you can try <laughs> and <laughs> i do get occasionally the phone call go how does this work <laughs> <laughs> so my advice is to just start really mm -hmm. with one of the side panels yeah and what you want to do with your glue is to put the glue in the in-between spaces okay because that's where the slots are going to go mm -hmm. from, your, from your, your connecting pieces. Yep. And you just, again, as we've said always with the glue, you don't need an awful lot. So you want to put the glue into the, the slots and slightly just up mm -hmm. to the sides. And do that all the way round. Yep. Because then it saves time then as we're, going, as we're putting it together. You need less hands to hold things if you've already put glue mm -hmm. on the one mm -hmm. side. That's one that you of the need. best tips I, I think <laughs> to give anybody, yes. because it, you know, it is. I, I mean, the, 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 there are people with tips to say, "Well, get a bit of masking tape and mm -hmm. hold it together." But doing the gluing first, yeah, it, it's phenomenally it's good. So, the, so these are our shelves, if you if you like, which are mm -hmm. going to hold the drawers. So again, we put the glue all the way around. We've still got some of the glue available as well. I know that the glue is quite limited uh, from the, the previous show, but if you do want to get the glue so that you've kind of got that as well, of course, it is that one-off post and packaging fee between midnight and midnight, so you can get that as well, and then you're ready to go, really, aren't you? You can still win your basket as well. Somebody's still going to win their full basket for free with it being Easter weekend. So the shelves are all the same. So you've yeah. got a bottom layer and then the two dividing layers in the top. <laughs> They're all the same. So we'll start off. I'll just put that one into there. Perfect. And then we'll go with our next one. Mm -hmm. Um, always make sure that if you've got a straight edge, you're matching your straight edges up so that you're not yes. having them the wrong way around. <laughs> uh, these are tips that we learn as we go along. Yeah. And, and the really good thing is actually is that people can watch this demo back. So obviously when they get the box yes. home, they yeah. can come back to hobbymaker.co.uk. Just find the time um, and you can just watch this back. So you can literally then do the step by step of oh, uh, it yeah, together, I think which that's a great idea. helps me. <laughs> yeah. if, if anybody's ever confused with any of the MDF they've bought mm -hmm. from us, we do have a group on Facebook, which is Burton Goat Shipmates. Yeah. Um, because the craft side of the business is the Burton Goats Merchant Stores. It's okay, in yeah. honour of my brother and my nephew are both ex-Navy. Oh, okay. <clears throat> Excellent. 
today. Um, and we do put demonstrations and Brilliant. Uh, inspiration on there, and people will also see what we're bringing to the channel first on there as well. Yeah, yeah. And, and, and any, you know, if, if you have by Burton Gertz products and they've got any questions mm. or, you know, even to ask us any crafty yeah. um, information they want, yeah. if we can help, we will. Get in touch. Yeah, that's lovely. Thank you so much. I think that's what people always like, that interactivity that you can have oh, during yeah. the shows and then afterwards yeah, as well. Absolutely. It's, uh, it's spot on. It's like there's no point in selling a product and then not helping anybody yeah. that's struggling uh -huh. with it. Yeah. It's like, well, they're not going to come back and buy anything else, yes. are they? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So um, mm -hmm. we're, we're pretty much available. Yeah. <laughs> the majority, well, one, of, one, of, one or other of one us. Of, are. One of us has normally got an eye on the group. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, exactly. That's what's nice, and there's more than one of you. <laughs> so, <laughs> you can you can split it. Uh, and what what's lovely as well about what we were saying before mm. MDF, there are so many ways to decorate mm. that you can personalise this as your. If you yes. want to go glittery and glam, yeah, yeah, there's yeah. nothing to stop mm -hmm. you. If you want to go more grungy. Mm. Mm -hmm. You know, no, think no, about no. the texture paste, the yeah. stencils yeah. that we've bought in the past, uh -huh. the, um, the, you know, the embellishments. You yeah. can, you know, if you want to make that look like a brick wall, yeah. use the brick wall yeah. stencil and paste and then paint yeah. it. You can turn it into whatever you want. And that's what I love about MDF is the versatility Definitely. of it. And yeah. the great designs that Jason brings. Mm. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I've got I, I, I just I just say <laughs> what I like. Yes, and then, and then expect, you it, it, yeah, expect it yeah. to come to fruition. <laughs> so I've got the three bottom layers. The top we can add on in a second. So we're just lining that up then. So they will slot in place mm -hmm. quite easily. There we go. So then, Perfect. obviously you need to let this all dry. Mm -hmm. but You see, once you know what you're doing. Yeah, it slots in really. It, it, yeah. yeah. Really, yeah. And then because we've glued all that already, yeah. you've just got to glue the end panel. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So you're definitely best to do it as you go. Yeah. Mm -hmm. As I say, it just, you, it, the glue will stay wet whilst you do it, so mm -hmm. it's... In fact, I find, uh, Jason might be the same, that when, you, when it's sort of been left for a few seconds, it sort of starts to go tackier, yeah. mm -hmm. so it glues mm -hmm. quicker yes. than yeah, if yeah. you did it immediately. Yeah, yep. Yeah, that definitely makes sense. So, just... Just, it as well. yeah. just a matter yeah. of just squaring, you know, is, squaring everything yeah, up yeah. and... Feels like you go. You know, it's quite a nice, quick little project that you can do, and then you automatically see it all yeah, coming together. Yeah, that's why it's good to show someone that don't be intimidated yeah. by it. No, exactly. You know, it, it really is. And then, of course, you come to the the drawers then, which yeah. uh -huh. um, oh, it's so easy. <laughs> so again, it's just a case of kind of taking the parts that you know you're going to need. So we're going to mm -hmm. need two sides, a front and a back. Yes, yeah, yeah. And yeah. then just again start with the draw base mm -hmm. and glue that all the way around i really like the hearts as well you know on the front yeah. of it i just think it's that kind of adds a, a lovely kind of extra pretty element as well i feel like a lot of these um draw sets like what we're seeing here you see as well in like you know the likes of oliver bonus and the likes of kind of a lot of those stores that i love yeah. i absolutely adore them but you pay considered prices oh, for them. Yeah. I mean, they're, they're, they're not Absolutely. cheap at all. Yeah. And you yeah. don't mind because you go in, you think, well, these are lovely. You know, you know how much you're going to use them as well. But this, you're actually getting to do it yourself. Make it yeah. into the exact yeah. style you want. Because also, when you look at it, the, the, the actual box, when you, when you look at them in a mm. store, it may be the, the box type you want, but not the style you want. Exactly, yes. So by doing your own... Yeah. Um, you can then, mm. you know, customise it yeah. as you wish, which yeah. is really And good. also a great gift idea. Um, you know, we're saying how much people love the personalised cards and giving that, but imagine giving this as a personalised piece to, you know, your mum or your nan or your friend, yeah. and it's just a such a lovely little Absolutely. Present. I mean, yeah, just so nice. What I feel about it as well is it, that yeah. it's big enough to be practical, but yes. it's still small enough to be cute. Yeah, it's very true, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and you could take it on the go with you, or you yeah. can, you know, sort of just have it in one space if you want it on your dressing table yeah. or something. Yeah. And also, they fit nicely. Uh, you know, the, the storage units with box mm. shapes, mm -hmm. you know, they will go nicely in yeah. there as well. Definitely. Um, and 
room to put something else on the top. Yeah, I exactly. mean, Jason has bought us storage in the in the past. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So we do, there mm -hmm. are other items of yes, storage that, that actually, we can yeah, team up with these. Yeah. So start to construct that now. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to put the back on first. Yeah. Then put the sides. So again, they slot into place. You said, putting it the wrong way around. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. But that shows you, as I said, you mm. can't put them wrong with the it. wrong way around. <laughs> so. Now, if I can do it, anybody mm -hmm. can do it. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I love about this channel. Like, well, I feel well, like every day yeah, I learn something well, new. When Jason said, right, we, we've got this, yeah. um, and he sent it to me, but he doesn't tell me... <laughs> it leaves me to find out myself. Well, if I can figure it out and you can figure it out, then I... Can it's OK. We're, we're all safe. right. I'm, we're I'm safe. I'm confident yeah. that other people can figure it out then <laughs> as well. So there you go. There's one of our drawers. Beautiful, that, yeah. Obviously, I need to let that go off first, mm -hmm. but that will just slide straight in and out. Yeah, yeah. That's perfect, isn't it? That's and, and, his, and Jason's mm -hmm. made them so that they do fit. There's no tight fitting. Yes. They do There's an slide in the motion. easily. Yeah. yeah. Fantastic. So you've still got a little bit of clearance on the top of the mm -hmm. drawer as well, but the, the front of it does fit the, the opening completely. Yeah, so yeah. it hides away anything that you've got in there, mm -hmm. but you've still got plenty of room. Yeah, when it comes to decorating mm -hmm. them, you will find... I'll, I'll touch this one because mm -hmm. I'm going to stand on my leg. <laughs> I'm going to go right, up in the world. You. There you go. You can see me now. Hooray! <laughs> I'm here. What I love about when you come to decorate mm -hmm. is there is everything is flat surface yes so as you can see here mm -hmm. it's edge to edge so when you mm. cut your papers they fit edge mm -hmm. to edge so yeah. when you measure there's no lip you've got to fit round yes and when it comes to the drawers what you can do is take one of the heart shapes mm -hmm. lay it on the paper where you know you're going to cut yeah. draw with a pencil on the inside mm -hmm. and then cut it out but also with mine I just yeah poked through with my knife uh -huh. and then went in with scissors and cut round. Yeah. If you find that you've got some jaggy bits, a little nail file will mm -hmm. get in that, that heart shape yeah. Yeah. and just smooth those on Brilliant. for you. Brilliant. What I did with this one mm -hmm. as well, if I bring this here, okay, you can see it's got the blue colour. Mm -hmm. I got my, I got my um, yeah. alcohol marker okay. and I just took the pen and I inked oh, around the edge. Yeah. Um, and then the papers are all from the paper pad. Mm -hmm. You can see I had to add some of the roses. <laughs> yeah. um, and then I cut out this one's here, and I, I just cut out that from mm -hmm. the corner of yeah. the paper. Um, and it's got this lovely, you can see there as well, mm -hmm. right hand, that one. It's a love letter. Yes. Um, yeah. From someone in the forces oh, in so nice. America. Mm. Um, and it's so lovely. But if I show you, while well, Jason's so merrily <laughs> carrying on yeah. there. Um, there is an actual page, mm -hmm. if I just find it, yeah. where that letter is... You'll find it in a minute. There's so many lovely pages yeah, in is. here. Yes, because this, this paper pad is there. That's Tim Holtz. Um, yeah, uh, uh, any follower of Tim Holtz mm. will know. Oh, here it is. Yeah, right? And you're, know. Getting, you're getting two of yeah. each of the papers. Brilliant. Right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So if I hold that up, mm -hmm. that is the love letter uh, on a full page. Okay. Yeah. Hello, sweetheart. Hello, Good sweetheart. Good afternoon. Ah. Oh, how lovely. It's a beautiful yeah. Sunday afternoon. Mm. There you go. Mm -hmm. So we've got, yeah, it's yeah. just such a beautiful pad. Um, we'll let, uh, I mean, it's would you, do you want me to show you on this? If I push yeah. these yeah. to one side oh, a moment. Definitely. Yeah. You, okay. you were just saying about Tim. He, he was yeah. one of the first kind of male crafters that kind of okay. broke through a, a kind of prominence. Yes, yeah, And he yeah, was yeah. kind of one of my you know, hero, crafting heroes, uh, really. Okay. And I've been um, fortunate enough to met him and done okay. workshops on. Yeah, and that's, that's why you occasions. managed to get, get that paper pad. Yeah. That's so lovely. That's lovely. Mm -hmm. Right, OK, so... Um, Shall I stand it up? Yeah, definitely show okay. it. Oh, look, I've yeah. just taken the cover straight off. <laughs> what is lovely about the, this, if I turn it round, you can see all the, yes. the pages that you're going to get. I like are. how you get them smaller squares, like we were talking about in the earlier round oh, as well. Oh, yeah, it's it's lovely. Clever, isn't it? And there's lots of what I call cutty-up bits. Mm -hmm. Agree. Um, so, as I say, you're going to get two of each. Yeah. That one I absolutely mm. love. This pad's bigger than me, look. <laughs> <laughs> and then you get... See, the, that's the blue that I made the roses out of. There at the bottom is the floral. 
yeah. that yeah. I cut around in the corner. And those are all like, like letters yeah. from um, people that... And, and every wall. single one is double-sided as well, isn't it? Yeah. It's, it's yeah. not like you've got white on the other side. That's, oh, that's the great one that I cut the, um, mm. the bunting with. And again, we've got the letter. You can see the one on the yeah. back here. That's yeah. a lovely little spotty one there. Yeah. I'm not really good at this. 12 by 12 is just overwhelming. I'm going to get here. Um, lovely, like, um, mosaic pattern mm -hmm. on there. Yeah. It's really lovely. Yeah. Beautiful. And there, look, see, we've, I did my bunting mm -hmm. yes, with yeah, that. Yeah. Um, like a blueprint on there. Then we've got tickets, lots and lots of tickets. I just think for that price as well, twenty two ninety nine for for something with that many designs in, also, and you're not going to not use any part of it. You know, you're going oh, to literally yeah. use and, yeah. and maximise every single. Well, one don't forget shape. again, you can get your inks and your sprays, and you can yeah. uh, grunge over this. I love the pen on that one, so lovely. It's got and quite then we nice come to the drip as well, the four you know, squares. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So again, some of the designs, but in a smaller format. Mm. And again, and there are um, little um, paper folders, paper folds you can do, where a couple of cuts and you can turn a 12 inch into a little mini book. Mm. So um, the good. four, the four designs go yeah. well with that. And, so, and as we were saying, when you're putting the papers on, mm -hmm. if, if you're not confident with a craft knife or you don't, yeah, confident with measuring, yeah. then put the whole page on. Mm -hmm. Let it overlap the edges, let it dry, yeah. and then use a sanding block across the edges, uh -huh. and that will then cut it to the exact yeah, shape. Ah, that's brilliant. Yeah. That's brilliant. So it does mean that it doesn't matter how sort of experienced you are, you, yeah. can, you can do but, this and you can actually yeah. create this. And that's what I've done with some of the bunting as well, yeah. so that <clears throat> you don't have to measure it precisely. Mm -hmm. And it then does give you that kind of vintage edge to it. Yeah, it's actually really nice, isn't it? Yeah. Kind of like, you do, you just kind of get that, that lovely edge yeah. into it as well. So. Well, um, you still got the chance, by the way, to get the bunting, so you can still kind of add that on as well. I know it was in the previous hour, but if you're wanting to make some um, of your your bunting um, with that paper pad as well, then you absolutely can still get that as well. There you go. The You've done it. The whole thing's made. Done. Look at that. Sorted, ready, just needs to dry, and that 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 is all, and that's ready to go. And it, it's, you know what, it's amazing, isn't it, to see it in almost that that sort of rough form where you've got it together and it's got no decor on, and then the transformation to those two boxes that yeah. you've decorated, yeah. and seeing that finish where you're not seeing any of the joins or anything like that. Yeah, and we've it, we've both used the same it. paper pad, but mine's mm. predominantly red, yours is yes. predominantly blue. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, so different, yeah. isn't it? Oh, wow. And I just think as a gift, I mean, do your own research. I have seen very, very similar sizes, looks to this at kind of 40, 45 pounds. Um, and you're getting to buy this, make it yourself, get the perfect design for 17 99 um, I can understand why people are multi-buying on it. Um, because I think, you know, whether you want it for your craft bits, whether you're thinking, well, I'd love my hair, you know, accessories in there, you might be, I mean, at night time, Put your glasses in, you know, one bit. Put yeah. your rings into another bit. Kind of keep everything safe beside your bed. If it's you just so the, much um, you can do. The letter embellishments mm -hmm. that we've got, you could personalise it and put names on it. Yes, if of course. Different kids care bobbles and really things. Really good idea. The, you know, yeah. what, whatever you want. Yeah. Or name the, uh, the <laughs> boxes. I think you can never have too much storage. No. And for a crafter, <laughs> yeah. um, and this would fit on a shelf nicely. Mm -hmm. It would yeah. go nicely on your desk. So uh, would, would they stack on top of each other or would that not be possible? <clears throat> could you put two on? Yeah. Yeah, there so we go. If, so if you wanted, you could you, you know, could glue them your together. Space. Yeah, well, you could. Yeah, yeah, it's true. I think we always kind of take you know pleasure as well in turning something flat mm. into mm -hmm. something yeah. you know three D and that is useful. Yeah. Um, maybe not so much with <laughs> flat pack furniture, but, no, with, no, no, no. but with craft, we always enjoy it. Yeah. <laughs> There's a certain like smugness about when you yeah. actually glued yeah. it together. Like, yeah. I've made that. Yeah, I think it's, you feel quite proud. Do you know what oh, I mean? Like, yeah, and you're going to want yeah. to tell everybody. Like, oh, I, I actually, you know, I did that. I put it together right from the start. <laughs> then I've done this. You know, it's it's so amazing, yeah. isn't it, to do that? They are. They're yeah. fabulous. Yeah. Um, something that that is not only visibly mm. nice to look at, mm -hmm. it serves a purpose. Exactly, exactly. And that took you less than 15 minutes to actually put it together from start to finish. Yeah. But it's one of those where you could then spend as much or as little time as you wanted decorating. Well, there was no, well, here's one I prepared earlier. That yeah. was actually done <laughs> on live TV yes, in, yeah, yeah. In, yeah, in real time. Yeah, we brilliant. do have one we prepared earlier, though. <laughs> yeah, you prepared earlier. <laughs> 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 um, I'm even thinking like those stamps that we had in that previous hour. We'd got that amazing 
amazing butterfly stamp. You know, you could stamp onto this yeah. if you wanted, couldn't you? Yeah. Or yeah. Anything like that. It's just lovely. Would, could you, you know, you know, I'm just thinking like the Carnaby Streets. Oh, could, wow. could things like that go on? They could. Yeah. Can have a look. Yep. Yeah. Perfectly. Yeah, that would just fit. Lovely, wouldn't it, if you wanted to? So you could actually sort of, look at that, that would look nice. So you could join those along, you know, you could use some of our embellishments when we had, like you said, the letters, the yeah. numbers that we've got as well. Oh, they look lovely, don't they, together? Yeah, I mean, mm -hmm. yeah, th there's no end to the possibilities. There's not, is there? They're really but having the lovely paper pad um, goes yes. well. And mm -hmm. like we say, the, the Union Jack, you could mm -hmm. stencil the, mm -hmm. the Union Jack on. Yeah. As I said, I embossed it through a, mm -hmm. a die-cut machine. Yeah. Um, and then the this as well just mm -hmm. goes brilliantly with the paper yeah, pad it, it just works mm -hmm. so well yeah and, and you know, if you embellished it with the travel kind of theme you yes. could keep it your passports in here tickets mm -hmm. you love letters oh yeah. yes need some of them <laughs> <laughs> anyone want to send me i, I wish <laughs> a text message just doesn't have the same thing. It's not the it? same, is it? It's no, not, not the same. The same. <laughs> That's what we need to start doing. But now. you know what? If you didn't want the heart on the front, mm. just cover with the paper. Yeah. Oh, yeah, of course. You, you know, could. you could put some tape or something mm -hmm. underneath to, you know, make it sort of yeah. not so. Um, yeah, well. I'd probably um, recommend is mm. put some paper on both sides mm -hmm. and then maybe even just put a hole in and some of the twine through to, to yeah, it. Yeah, of course, yeah. 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 I, I love the heart. I'm like, I want to <laughs> keep that. <laughs> but yeah, you can if you want to make it kind of less feminine. I just think that's a lovely little extra touch. Um, we've only got about half an hour left. That is all for you to kind of jump in and get any of these pieces. Um, we have got something else that we've saved for this hour to be able to show you as well, which is the postcard scene from London. Now, we've had a lot of you messaging in about this because you have been able to spot it, I think, at the front of the desk. Um, so a lot of you have been saying, when's that coming? When's it, you know, when's it coming? Well, we've, we've saved it to be able to bring it straight to you. I can't believe this price, I have to say. Um, I almost feel like if you want to, you know, if you, if you want to kind of have your first <coughs> adventure with MDF, this feels absolutely perfect to me because you're getting to build that London scene, but you are getting it today, reduced price, £7.99. And that, that is fabulous. I mean, you can change the look of this, but you can see the sort of night look, the day look that you've got there, depending on how you decide to um, actually kind of decorate that. But that is just going to make an impact on a wall, whether that's on you know, your side or anything like that. Um, you know, little fairy lights kind of coming across that scene as well. I think that would look oh, so Oh, nice. absolutely. Yeah, it would work really well. Mm. Um, I have to say, this, is, this scene is one of my favourite things that we've done so uh -huh. far. Um, and it's so you can... Uh, again, it depends on uh, what you decorate with mm -hmm. as to the look that you get with them. Yeah. But um, I did this one. Uh, Jason did this one, and I did that one, and I've used mm -hmm. all alcohol markers okay. on yep. that one. Yeah. Apart from the yellow for the sun in the background, mm -hmm. which I used... What did I use? <laughs> I can't remember what I used. Mm. Oh, no, that was alcohol marker as well. Yeah. 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 It's all right. I'm thinking of something else. Mm -hmm. But, yeah, so all the layers. Yeah. So... You kind of went for a daytime look. With I it, did. did you? And uh -huh. I went for more of a you nighttime. Went, yeah, <laughs> yeah, I love that. I love the and difference. Again, I use the alcohol markers, but I went over them with the watered down inkers oh. yeah. to just give it a shimmer and for it to look like rain. Yeah. Because she's holding the brolly, I wanted it to. Yeah, to have, to have yeah. that. It's lovely. But the, um, the little LED lights mm. would be beautiful. They in would, there. wouldn't they? Um, so... As it comes to you, mm -hmm. you have two long frame pieces, two short frame pieces. You have a base, mm -hmm. okay? That is your frame. Yep. So what I suggest is it, there's a tendency to want to just glue this together straight away. Mm -hmm. If you do that and then you glue these together and put it in, if you've overshot, mm -hmm. you won't get that in. Okay. Yeah. That's one of the most important tips yeah. I can say. <laughs> uh -huh. um, you could perhaps do t two, three sides mm -hmm. and then fit this in okay. and then put the final one on. Yeah. But if you, uh, you, you, it's only because I know, mm -hmm. you know what I mean by that. Yeah. And it's like <laughs> I had to pull it back out because yeah. if, it's, if it's in and it's glued and you can't, you've overshot, mm -hmm. you'll find you'll struggle to get that yeah. in. Yeah, of course. But if you do want to glue it together first, yeah. before we decorate it, then put the pieces in the middle. 
So glue, you've got the actual... Glue the edges yeah. on, and then once mm. it's dry, take the middle out. Yeah, 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 yeah that and makes then, sense. And well. then you'll know yeah. it fits. Yeah, yeah. OK, so let's have a look <coughs> at the layers. So what you get in in the foreground mm -hmm. is the tree mm -hmm. at the top corner. You're then getting the telephone box, which has to be red. Yes, yeah, always. <laughs> And then your romantic couple with the umbrella. Mm -hmm. You're then getting this one where you've got bushes. And these as well here, it's got the bushes there. Mm -hmm. um, and then we have, dare I say, the London Eye mm -hmm. and Big Ben. Now, I've just seen, we've got, now this, this might happen. I'm just going to turn around one moment mm -hmm. and just grab a little... There we go. There's a little tiny bit. You, it's MDF. You may get a little yeah, tiny bit. Yeah. Just a pointy tool. Pop it out. Get that yeah. out. So you've got Big Ben there. Mm -hmm. And then this plain one with your circle. And this is where your sun comes mm -hmm. in. But this one, you will find, you will do your colour on the back, oh, on the okay. inside of the back yeah. of the frame. Mm -hmm. OK? That's how I did mine. So how many layers is that? Five, six layers for seven ninety nine. That's amazing. Yeah. <laughs> wow. So if I, if we were going in with markers and we want a nice yellow, if we're going for the sun, or you could do purple if it's night time, mm. you know. Mm -hmm. You could even draw around that and then do an ombre effect, yellows and orange. Mm -hmm. That would be quite nice to do. So as long as you've got... Um, Let's do a bit of yellow and orange, shall we? I uh, once booked tickets as a surprise for the London Eye okay. for my husband. Uh -huh. We were both working in London separately. Right. And it, I do all these things, and then it's only when you get there and I look up it, I realise I don't like what heights. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I've been on the London Eye as well. I loved it. <laughs> my mum really doesn't like heights either. And in Stratford-upon-Avon, there's obviously not as big as the London Eye, but yeah. there's a big wheel. And my little boy, who's three, is just the brave. You know, he has no fear of anything. So he's there like, oh, we need to go on. And my mum's like, oh, OK. And I was like, <laughs> how come you actually went on with him? Whereas with me, it would be like, no, I'm too scared. You know, but she's like, oh, he really wants it. And you think, but it is, it's when you get up there yeah. and you suddenly think, this is so high. Like, oh, I just oh, loved nice it. Treat, I though. really did. Yeah, I once booked us a helicopter flight as well as a treat. And, and you again, don't like heights. No, I don't like heights. <laughs> we think but, the treats. <laughs> yeah, but, yeah, well, yeah. Now, yeah. you see, I've gone way too high there, but I think I'm going to put some more yellow. That's the thing. Mm -hmm. I would draw around it because mm -hmm. otherwise you end up um, not actually being in the area that you... <laughs> Yeah. you want it to be but that just a little bit of a scribble yeah, and that little bit more look mm -hmm. okay if it's amazing it. how you think you've got the right place <laughs> yeah but there we go so we've got a little bit of a sunset mm -hmm. and if i just go over the orange if you really do make a mistake with it mm -hmm. you can either gesso over it and start again oh yeah yeah or with this instance because it's the same both sides mm -hmm. you can just oh, turn it over yes yeah yeah yeah, yeah of course okay so, um, so we've got that one there, so we know that's mm -hmm. done. And then this one here, um, what I did, I took, um, if you buy our uh, alcohol markers, mm -hmm. you've got the grey. Yeah. And the, with the grey, I did, because on the MDF, you see, mm -hmm. it doesn't quite look grey. No, it doesn't. But on, on, on paper, it would. Uh-huh. So we'd, we just do... That there, and then I did the the pods, the pods <laughs> on there. Nice. Uh, the, the only thing that frightened me about the London Eye mm -hmm. was the pods actually not stopping for you to get on. <laughs> to get and on, yes, because you have to yeah. just walk, don't it. you, and get on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, okay, <laughs> and then it's it's like just. It's like the, the, the ones where you go skiing. And yes, they don't you've got to stop jump and on you've got to get <laughs> off. Yeah, like the door opens, but if you miss Quick. it, you like hesitate <laughs> and that's it. Okay, and then we've got, um, no, I'm going to go with a lighter green here. Mm -hmm. And then again, you, you, you don't need to be too precise because you're not going to see it. Mm -hmm. So you come in with the green, but all the time, keep going back with your, your next layer to see whether you have gone over the right place. Yeah. 
Okay. With all of the MDF mm -hmm. uh, projects, if you're using the alcohol markers and you're not yep. sure what the colour is going to come out like, either try it on the bit of the waist of one of the embellishment boards yes. or try it on the back of something. So that you, can... you can almost do a colour match. You yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, so yeah, you can I... see now oh, yeah, I need yeah. to come down a little bit more. Mm -hmm. um, I know I haven't done the R yet, mm. but we'll do that in a moment. Okay. It could, what, what if you were planning a romantic trip? Yeah. And you could give this to your boyfriend so or nice. partner or whatever. Uh -huh. So you yeah. can see there now that's done. So we're building up. Mm. Okay. I'm going to come back to the eye in a moment. Let's just do that little bit there, mm -hmm. green as well. Um, so now on this one, I'm going to go with a different green. Let me find. Got a dark alcohol thing. pens, yeah. I have got a, oh, there it is hiding at the end. Mm -hmm. So, on this one, um, and I also want a brown because we've got some stems. Mm -hmm. So, this one I can go in with the finer end and just do the the stems there, the stems, the trunks. Yeah, yeah. Just, just a tip with the brown as well. Yes. If you, when you get the things that pop out, you get the little pips on them, okay? So, um, it's where the laser hasn't cut so that's what holds it in the yeah, yeah. so if you just go over it with a brown alcohol mark it doesn't show brilliant it just you yeah. know, hides the, just hides that hides yeah, it, yeah, basically. yeah okay lovely. but how quick does this make I know. make this again if you wanted you could use the I mean I'm just doing one color quickly if you're more into your coloring you could do um, your shading with the green really calming as well and you know so with this you're getting 12 of those markers so obviously you've got that whole array as well in terms of you know what you want to use and the difference of the the, the nibs as well is brilliant isn't it depending on what you're it, it is because you've got the ch chisel end mm. so when you've got the big areas yeah you you know you just got it there and then you've got the fine yeah. um it is a bullet end but it's a fine bullet yeah yeah so for all your detail work mm -hmm. that's there Right, so let's just have a look where we are with that one. Looking good. Mm -hmm. And then, of course, we come with this one. Now, what you can do, of course, which we haven't spoken about, is if you wanted, you see, it goes mm -hmm. that way. But if yeah. you wanted, you can turn it that way. Mm -hmm. So that's it, and you've got more definition mm -hmm. there. So, you know, there are... <laughs> We'll, we'll give you options. Yeah. Sometimes options are not too much, <laughs> can't cope. The option. <laughs> yeah. Right, OK. So they're arguing now over in the gallery which way they want it. <laughs> the other way, right. Like, do it back different. Who am I not to give in to the gallery? <laughs> give the OK, so yeah. I'm going in with black because mm -hmm. I like the idea of the silhouette. Mm -hmm. So I think it looks... Very nice. It looks very French, doesn't yeah. it? Yeah. It's also a cheat that you don't have to draw faces. <laughs> yeah, well, yes. <laughs> oh, gosh, yeah. 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 <laughs> but, of course, if you wanted to, she could be wearing a pretty pink mm. dress. Yeah. You know, it's, mm -hmm. it could be Paris in the springtime. Yeah. You, you, you just, not with that in the background. But, they they but could look, be about to catch the, uh, <laughs> the train but, to but Paris. But look, you can <laughs> change it. leave yeah. that layer out yeah, yeah, if, yeah. You, if you so want. Mm. Yeah. Looks a bit more Serengeti now, doesn't it, rather than <laughs> London. Uh -huh. But I love that, that, the fact you've got those options. Yeah. So what, what colour umbrella are we having on this one? A pink umbrella. Pink. There we go. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know, it's like, I have no idea how this is going to end. This, this is designed by committee, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, dear. Right. That's pink. Nice. Yeah. Is that the right pink? Would mm. you like a different pink? <laughs> That's nice. <laughs> uh, so, oh, yeah. Do you know what? Uh, they're asking for <laughs> stylized now. It's like, hang on, guys. <laughs> We're only here for the next <laughs> half an hour. Right, so we've got... If you could hear what's going on. <laughs> <laughs> not really. So then it's got to be p pillar box red. Yes. Um, phone box, not pillar box, phone box red. Mm -hmm. OK. But also... <laughs> 
Sorry, I'm losing it now. Right, ben just wants... Uh, <laughs> they ben, want ben, the Mona Lisa on yeah. there now. Ben's like, yeah. Pauline, can you just draw the Mona Lisa on this oh, back? Oh, dear it's me. It's not right this second now. <laughs> it's not yeah. quite a police box, it is. Shall I do box. Starry, Starry <laughs> Night in the <laughs> background? Mind. That'd be lovely. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's not quite oh. a police box, but you could make it blue if you want to. Oh, we could, yeah. Yes. We could. Yeah, you could. Yeah, the next option is we could add graffiti. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Right, OK. But you can see I'm not using the small mm. bullet nib because I can, I can do it far quicker yeah. with this one. OK, and you can see you can take mm -hmm. as long as you need. I am yeah. just doing this to show you. But uh, again, get your embossing powders mm. out. You can make mm -hmm. these all shiny and yeah, beautiful. Yeah. Right, so we're going, we're, we're getting there. Hang on. We'll put this back in. Oh, no, wrong layer. The, the pens will Hang bring on. back in because they're, they're very popular, as you'd expect. Because I think, you know, as I'm watching you using these pens as well, it's, they're going on so easy and they're doing full coverage as well. It's not like, you know, you're sort of getting bits that are missed. Yeah. Um, and I imagine they last a long time as well. See, I could, uh, could have done, turned that that side <laughs> mm -hmm. and have that like that. You know, it's, yeah. it's like, but I don't think we've got time... <laughs> to alter another one because we've got to do the frame yet. So we've got that there. there yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. So then, because we've got, I'm going to do a mixture here mm -hmm. of the dark and the light greens together. Yeah. So down there. Okay. Mm -hmm. So I think we'll have, um, oh, wrong end. Some of the dark. Oh, so this is some of the light, sorry. Yeah. Some of the light here. Mm -hmm. Then we've got to go back to our brown for our stem there. But this is, this is not colouring. Mm. This is just laying colour as fast as you can. Mm. OK. And then we'll go with a little bit of the darker one mm -hmm. on this top one here. OK. Yeah. This is where you forget to talk. <laughs> I know, it's you just, just sort of so, watch, yeah, don't you? Yeah. Yeah. You just enjoy it. And we'll it. go back with the brown <laughs> for the stems on this one. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So again, just add that in there. A little bit of brown down there. A uh -huh. little bit of the tree. And then we've got to come back to the London Eye. Mm -hmm. um, so I'm going to go with the black with that one. Because I just think it looks dramatic. Yeah, it does. You it? use black on anything and it's dramatic. Yeah. Uh -huh. Again, I'm going with the chisel end because I can then... Mm -hmm. So we've got the pods, so I'm avoiding the pods. Yeah. But I'm just going around that line. And you, okay. you do get kind of a matte finish with them. So mm -hmm. if you really like that, which yeah. I, I do, you know, it works really well. Yeah, but as we yeah. said, you could add your embossing powders, you could add the UT mm -hmm. that we've got on the shirt. Glitters. Yes, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, yeah. Gold leaf, mm -hmm. gold foiling. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I think that, that's the thing. I think with something like this, all them layers as well that you've got, you know, it's, it's almost just where does your imagination go and just run with it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Sometimes you... Your, your imagination can be your worst enemy because mm. you can stop yourself. Mm. Yeah. Um, but the thing is, like Jason said, you've got the other side. Yes, yeah. But also, gesso is a wonderful thing. Uh -huh. So you can just, you know, paint over and yeah. start with a blank canvas again. Brilliant, isn't it? Um, We've all gone quiet again. <laughs> Jason, um, <laughs> was there any inspiration behind this design? Um, yeah, I love London and I, I, you, um, mm -hmm. yeah, that's kind of my inspiration with it. It yeah. was part of the Jubilee theme. Yes, yeah, but I yeah. wanted to keep something back for the, the mm -hmm. second show and keep it as yeah. Um, yeah. something special as well because I think this is a really mm. you know, unique mm. piece on its own. Definitely, I think so. Um, and, and I kind of think because of all of those layers as well, you know, it could be like you say that you love London. It could be that you're gifting someone the, 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 the go on the, the London eye. It could be that you want to say I love you to somebody with that image of the couple together. You know, it, it can just be that you just want to have a statement piece kind of put onto your wall and it's there. If you wanted, you could put a little note on this, you could put a little date if it was important to you. Yeah. You know, there's just so much that you can do yeah. to personalise this. And it's £7.99, so reduced from 9 99 which I just think, I, I honestly would have said for just one 
Bromley, I'd have thought that was a good price. But the fact that you're getting all of those, you know, all of those layers is amazing. Um, make sure that you are checking out because a lot of these are currently sitting in baskets. And we often say, you know, the, the issue is people sit to the end of the show and then suddenly they've all sold out. And I don't want that to be you that's disappointed. So make sure you are, of course, checking out brand, brand new today on that one. Again, right, OK. You could add a couple of our little plaque hangers yes. to it. So if you want to hang it up, yeah, yeah. it will freestand on its own as well. Definitely. Now, I haven't got the right shade of blue <laughs> or sky. So what I'm going to do mm -hmm. is this is me like experimenting. Mm -hmm. So I've got, a, um, a, I've got a, a wet baby wipe and I'm going to yeah. use my spray mm -hmm. and I'm going to do... A blue sunny sky. You can also, if you don't want to go straight in, mm -hmm. you can just put it on to spray it onto your mat and pick it up and then just but it doesn't even matter really nice. if you get um, a finish what you need to do again. It's all about the layering, right? So yeah. you see how far oh, I need yeah, to yeah. come further down here. Mm -hmm. But you can see how far it goes. Mm -hmm. I don't want to get on my sun. So let's just get on there. And uh, we just, you can see how mm. dramatic you can make it Amazing. or lighter or go in with an ink pad. I've got this to hand, so mm -hmm. that works for me. So then that on there, okay. Mm -hmm. And then we go there and you can see we're almost mm -hmm. done. Okay, so. so back in with the black mm -hmm. to go around the frame okay. on the front. Yeah. Um, and again, this is so easy mm. because I can then go, you see, edge, edge, edge down, mm. and it's covered any green that I'll have. Now, what I did as a finishing touch on the one I did before, mm. I got, uh, um, this one is called the graphite. Yeah. Yeah. If I just open it, you can see. Mm -hmm. And I just touch so you get a silvery black finish yes. okay. over that. It's just fabulous. Mm -hmm. So the graphite one is, oh, it's so lovely because on I black, nice, you could, if I bring this one in here, mm. you can see there how, if mm. you can see how it gives a silvery lovely. finish yes, on yes. the frame uh -huh. and on there. So yes. it works really well if you want to give it mm. a highlight. Definitely. Okay. So back to just... The frame again this could be the gesso if you didn't want to use um the black pen mm -hmm. uh again for quickness for demoing but the gesso will work really really well you get great coverage with our gesso mm -hmm. as is the royal wing <laughs> <laughs> he knows me well enough by now it is his, it is jason's company really <laughs> We can bring the gesso um, setting that we've got there as well. So the black and white, that's two by um, 120 mils for those at 11.99 as well. So if you want the gesso, then oh, you can get that right now. I agree. Right, I've just been notified <laughs> <laughs> that I haven't finished my green. Oh, okay. Down here, I get that, yeah. <laughs> to finish two, that bit off. <laughs> two, so once we've done this, we can glue these together. And if Jason would like to start the frame for me, mm -hmm. Just so that we, okay. So I've given him the base that has the take that one as well. um, the debris on it. You fill in the gaps again, Jason, please. <laughs> um, the sun, okay. Mm -hmm. So I'm just making sure that one fits. Okay, see all my green's done on there now and on there. But you know, it's like, it's, it's like painting by numbers. Yeah. Just do do what you want with the colours. Yeah. Okay. And like you've showed how quickly you can kind of do all of those layers, but you can just take as much time or, or as you know little time as you want and have as well, which is so lovely about it as a project, I think. Yeah, absolutely. Um, so while Jason's doing that, I'll get my other... I've got another glue, which is here somewhere. There it is that this one's running out a little bit so i have to like squeeze it a little bit that's why we've got another full one there yeah <laughs> so all it is is putting mm -hmm. and again 
little, but round the edges, mm -hmm. you don't need a lot. It really is good glue. Yeah. And on MDF, you, you've got, you know, you want to know that you've got something reliable, and mm -hmm. this is. So there. And what I do is I stand it up and just make sure everything is squared up. Mm -hmm. Because if it's not, that's when it's not going to fit in your frame. So then we've got, I don't know why I did on the back of the trees there, because <laughs> it doesn't fit, but it dries, it's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh -huh. And then, okay. Mm -hmm. And then on with this one. Yeah. Okay. Now, really, if you wanted to finish there. You could. You could. Yeah. You have two different pictures, couldn't you? Yes, definitely. So, a little bit of glue I'm just going to take out there. So, the next you one. Put it into an ordinary box frame, you yeah. can put lights behind it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So. definitely. Yeah. Well, like I did this frame over here with the, mm. um, mm -hmm. the, the paper and the yeah. uh, union flag in it, mm -hmm. you could. I ideally put this in yeah. and then you yeah. could put lights be yeah. behind yeah. it quite easy. Look how lovely that so is. So again, square up and you can see how it, mm. it's stuck together. Mm -hmm. Don't worry about this edge because it'll be in the box, you won't see. Yeah. And then this final one. Mm -hmm. But um, as I say, the colour choices, mm. um, you could do it in all black yep. and have mm. total silhouettes. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And those alcohol markers, I mean, they've just got such a strength of tone and color yeah. to yeah. them. But you see how that, look, it's, yeah. it's, it's together. It's so good. It's fine. Uh -huh. So now I'm going to put glue on the back yeah. here. I'm putting glue on because I don't intend on taking it out. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. And this is where you find... Wow. If you, There you go. Well done, Jason. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, and then you would decorate up the outside mm -hmm. frame as you want it. But oh, there yeah. is. That's so good. And that, £7.99 to construct all of that, put all that together as well. Loads of new crafters, obviously, getting this, adding it to their baskets as well. So a thank you if you are new and if you are somebody who's been with us for the last six weeks, then it's amazing to have you with us as well. Um, what an incredible deal and something to really start off your journey with MDF as well at that sort of price. With, you know, five, six layers for £7.99, it's, I just love it. And I think it's something that you could do with different ages as well. You know, if you wanted to work with your grandchildren or anything like that, it's a lovely sort of of way to get children yep. involved with this medium yeah, yeah. And as we said you know you could flip the the layers so if you got yep. two of them you could do them as facing mm -hmm. each other yeah you could do one as day and one as night yep yep yeah so if you multi-buy then you've got that option like what we saw there with the kind of day and night uh different sort of looks and qualities as well and yeah they look so nice don't they alongside each of the two scenes one one way, one the other way, and that would like mirror and just look absolutely perfect. Okay, we've got 10 minutes left. Goodness, it feels like the time <laughs> just flies. I, I can't help noticing that we've had a, a message in oh. from Elizabeth. Elizabeth. Yeah. You don't think it's you don't think it's the Elizabeth. <laughs> you never know. You never know. I'm sure. Claiming her palm mouth. Yeah, she wants she wants a part of the street and her palm mouth. She does, back. she does. She can have it. We will gift it to her. <laughs> Elizabeth's got in touch saying, Dear Hobby Maker, I love the new show. It's a breath of fresh air for us crafters. I've just finished creating a knitted queen and corgi. I will use it to make a window display for the forthcoming Jubilee. That is wonderful. Which is amazing. Thank you so much for sending that in, Elizabeth, and sharing it. Um, like we say, we love seeing your make, so please do share them with us. Send them through on the email to studio at hobbymaker.co.uk. Um, and of course, if we show them, then you're automatically put into that prize draw. And on the last Saturday of every single month at five o'clock, we will pick one of you out by random and you will win a hundred pounds credited to your account to spend here so it's well worth sending in your make so we can pop you into that competition as well thank you for that it's very much kind of in theme with all of these yeah. bits yeah. as well isn't it yeah. that be it I, I just thought that was when i saw yeah. the name was elizabeth i'm thinking <laughs> wow uh, she's heard about us no look who's watching she's ready for her pal mile Could signs be. at <laughs> street and yeah, we know how she spends her afternoons exactly. <laughs> it's brilliant yes queen <laughs> yeah let's send, let's send her the Yes, Queen one. Get that, can't we? <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh, well, well done, of course, to all of you who are getting involved. Um, if there is uh, any other bits that, that we want to have a quick look at, then we can do. There's the bunting, which you can still see behind me, that's still available as well. So if you would still like to get that, that is still there. So you can absolutely take advantage of this. I still can't believe this is this price for, <laughs> you know, 30, 36 opportunities yep. with the bunting, the plain and the, uh, the um, lovely opportunity as well for the union flag. So you can kind of see those just there in front of us as well. Can I show you that yeah, one? Yeah, absolutely. That's the one where I've used the uh, the crosses. Um, yeah, let me. Uh, there you have go. A, thank you so much. Yes, look at that. So you can see there that we've got. So that's really is using the waste from, mm, from the mm -hmm. Union flags. But we, as we said, with the Commonwealth Games coming up with England, yes, yeah, uh, you, you could do. You could paint them, obviously. Um, Easily mm -hmm. do the Scottish flag on them. Definitely, as well. definitely. Do you know what? It's so as well, if you, so you with do. the with the the bunting like that, if you can use it like mm -hmm. decorate it up, mm -hmm. you pastel colours for Easter. Yep. Paint over it again uh -huh. and do it for Christmas. So you're just repurposing yes. yeah. the same bunting. Re it's like you don't need to buy another set. <laughs> Although we would like you to buy another <laughs> set, yeah. but but it is possible to mm -hmm. paint over and change the theme. Yeah. yeah. It is, it is. It's so true. You can just constantly... Can, do you know another thing that comes to mind mm -hmm. as well? Um, with your sewing, mm -hmm. you can cut round them for bunting with fabric yes. as well. Yes. As well as glue fabric oh, on, yes. but you could use it as a template mm -hmm. to yeah, cut your fabric. Absolutely. So, yeah, you could do it with your fabric. You could do it with, um, you know, exactly like this. You can use the extras. You can keep changing it up for every different season, every different event that you're doing as well. Um, and I, I just wouldn't want to take them down. I'd pop them into yeah. the rooms, you know, or outside or anything like that. And once it's there, I just think it's a, it's a fabulous addition to, to yeah. everywhere. Um, and incredible, incredible price on that as but well. But think so about the alphabet as well. And yes. then put lettering on. Yes, that, yeah, yeah. That's a good idea. Yeah. That's what I do, my little boy. Spell his name. <laughs> in fact, we'll just show you the embellishment bundle. Should we just bring in all the details for that as well? Um, so you've got the chance, of course, to be able to get this. Um, do you know what? It's under £30 for this opportunity as well. So you've got your, your numbers. You've got your, your letters that you can see there. You've got, of course, what we love, that gentleman um, embellishments that we can see. Um, the, the London embellishments, the tiaras, the crowns. It's just everything within all of that. It's yeah. amazing. Absolutely amazing. And on split and on split payments, so £15. And you know, we showed you as well some of the um, cards that have been created. So, you know, you, you could put some of these onto the boxes if you're creating them. You could pop them onto cards, you can pop them onto the bunting. It really does all just work hand in hand. Yeah, it? they could go onto part, you know, the crowns or the CRS mm -hmm. could go onto party bags if you're having yes, you know, very nice. kids' parties and things. Mm -hmm. I still want to make the hairband. <laughs> I know, yeah, yeah, definitely. Next time we're on, you'll see it. <laughs> yeah. like, I've got my, I've got my hair pieces ready. <laughs> I'm, I'm organising a hen party at the moment, and now I'm thinking of all these extra oh, ideas wow. that you're yeah, saying about. Yeah. I'm like, oh yes, yes, I could do that. So, <laughs> it's, um, so yeah, all of that is for under uh, fifteen pounds each. If there's anything at all that you've missed out on, um, just jump onto the website. Anything that we might not have managed to sort of put up onto the screen, we'll take down to the lowest price on the website anyway um, so you can of course jump on there um, and remember check out your baskets because everything that you buy you've got that option of, of winning your whole basket being paid for as well so you can take advantage of that thank you so much for thank joining you. us it's a been pleasure you. when are you back on do you we're know? back on the 28th and we're 28th. doing a show all on card making amazing so 28th um, join us then i'll be back in a moment with more from crafters companion here at hobby maker we love seeing what you've been making and it's our job to keep you inspired. So how does a £100 credit to your Hobby Maker account sound? Every month, we're going to be giving away a £100 credit to one lucky Hobby Maker's account. And all you have to do to enter is simply send a photo of your crafty makes to studio at hobbymaker.co.uk. We will be picking one winner each month at random and we'll announce the lucky winner on air in the 5pm show on the last Saturday of every month. So what are you waiting for? Get crafting, get motivated, and get inspired with Hobby Maker. Our call centre is based in the UK and available 24-7. Just call 0800 001 4433 or email help at hobbymaker.co.uk.
I am Sandra Rushton and I am the owner of Sandtangle, which is a small business in Lincolnshire where it's only been going uh, three years or so, but uh, we are really, really passionate about what we do. So it's a very mindful form of art. That's its basic core. So if you can hold a pen and draw a line, you can tangle. And it's about that mindfulness, that relaxation, and about you having a moment just for you. But as a result of you having that moment of putting pen to paper, you can create wonderful works of art. We do a lot of live videos, so we are very, very invested in education. We like to have people come to classes, but then, of course, the products that I design, we make ourselves. So we're involved in every step of the way, from the very, very, say, the very first drawing, to how it goes onto the computers, to how it's machined, to even books that we still hand make. Oh, I'm looking forward to seeing where we go. It's the start of something new, and I honestly, I feel that. I feel that it's something exciting, and I'm, I'm so glad I'm in at the beginning, because I don't know where it's going, but it's only going somewhere good. This is the place for me. Join us this Easter bank holiday weekend here on Hobbymaker for our Easter extravaganza. On Friday, brand new slimline nesting dies from Crafter's Companion and Stamping Essentials. Burton Gertz with brand new Jubilee themed MDF. On Saturday, we've brand new woodware bubble balloon stamps from Creative Expressions plus Cosmic Shimmers. Be creative with Stamper's Friends Show Special and Screen Pal. And on Sunday, hunky dory Easter deals with Dreamies and their launch show. And on Monday, Creative Expressions, Native Lighting, and Crafter's Companion. Also, shop between Friday the 15th to Monday the 18th, and one lucky person will win their Easter basket for free. Now, if you shop with us last weekend, don't forget to use your 10% off discount code. So, a great lineup. Make sure you stay tuned this Easter weekend here on Hobbymaker. Hobbymaker are proud to work alongside some of the biggest brands in the industry. Keep watching for these brands and many more here on Hobbymaker. When you purchase anything on Hobbymaker, you have a 30-day money-back guarantee, meaning that you can shop with confidence. Happy shopping with Hobbymaker! Hi, I'm Sarah Davies and I'm the founder of Crafters Companion. Also, one of my hobbies that I do in my spare time is a little bit of investing in other businesses, so you might recognise me as one of the dragons on Dragon's Den. I started Crafters Companion back in my university bedroom when I was just turned 21 and we design and develop and bring to market products for the paper craft community. So everyone who's into card making, I'd like to think that we are at the cutting edge of all the latest trends, the fabulous designs are out there and we are researching the market, making the products that customers really want and need and then bringing them to market, not here in the UK but all over the world. So for me, Hobbymaker is so different to any other craft shopping channel I've ever worked with from anywhere in the world. The fact that you can do the falling price auctions, the fact that you can have the fixed price shipping for the day, the fact that all of your call centers are based here in the UK and you can offer an elevated customer experience is really all the things that really I know matter to our customers. So for you to be able to offer all of this and give me a platform as a manufacturer of amazing craft products to bring them to the UK market, I just feel like it's a match made in heaven. It is time to reveal our five Search for Star Sewing finalists. Earlier on in the year, we asked you, our viewers, to apply to be our next Sewing Street Sewing Star and we were overwhelmed with the amount of applicants. We have watched hours of audition videos and we have somehow managed to narrow it down to our chosen five finalists. Our five very talented finalists will be on your screen next week from Monday the 4th of April to Friday the 8th of April and we've dedicated an hour each day to each contestant to do their demonstrations. We're handing over the choice of the winner to you. So on the Friday after everybody's done their live demonstrations, the voting will be open. Join us all next week to help us choose our Sewing Street Sewing Star. OK, 
Okay, final hour. Wow. Uh, kicked off, obviously, this, this amazing, amazing Easter weekend. Um, there's been so many of you that obviously have got that £10 that's been added to your baskets, which is amazing. Um, there's still the chance to win your whole basket. So you could literally have bought, you know, multiple things from Crafters Companion. You could have got from Burt's and Gertz. You could then, you know, uh, get other bits off the website and you'd get your whole basket free if, if you're the one lucky winner that is picked out on Tuesday, which Dave will, of course, announce. Um, but we are kind of going to do recap on some of the bits that we've showed you. I know we've been having requests in for certain bits as well that we'll come to also. Um, we're going to kick off just with another look at our tape pens. Um, a lot of you have been saying, Saying, can you just bring these back on? Can we just have another look? Now, the first time that obviously I brought this on um, at a deal, they completely, completely sold out. We've just managed to get some back into stock here at Hobby Maker, and it's a four for three. So normally you're paying £4.99 per pen. Today you're going to get all four of them for the price of three, so just under £15. Um, and it is the two different types as well. So you've got the extra strong, you've also got the, uh, the dotty pen. And I always think that with these, you know, they're essential for your craft room, but you really do need both. And through those earlier demos, you would have obviously seen as well, you use in both of these. Exactly. So you use your, um, your solid tape pens are really mm -hmm. extra strong. Yeah. So they're going to do all your mats and layers, but we're going to use the encapsulated gold with glitter cardstock mm -hmm. in a few minutes. Yeah. No problem. It will mm -hmm. adhere to glitter cardstock, anything yeah. that you want to acetate, However, yeah. I use them all the time for box making, mm -hmm. perfect. Then you've got your dotty ones and your dotty ones are brilliant where you want to do things that have got detail, yeah. cut out bits, because the dots only stick where there's card or paper. Yes. So it doesn't leave stringy bits mm -hmm. and run across. Absolutely perfect. So yeah, you need them both. It's yeah. not a, shall I get the solid ones no. or the dotty ones? Mm -hmm. They work yeah. together. Yeah. And they're so, what I love about them as well is how easy they are to, to like maneuver. So they'll go in the straights, but you can curve with them, you know, you can get them to go exactly where That's you want them That's why I love them, because when you do... There's not many die cuts that you get that are perfect straight no, exactly. lines. So, you know, you've got uh -huh. hexagons, circles, yeah. shapes, ovals, and yeah. your tape pens will follow mm -hmm. all those shapes. Yeah, it's brilliant. Yeah. And, and I, can't, I can't remember exactly the metreage on this, but it's... Is it over eight metres? Ooh, let it's me, something... Let um, me see if I can... Uh, uh, yeah, I've, uh, I've, I've uh, not uh, got the... Uh, uh, I've got the it's, it's 22 metres. 22 metres, or way more than I'm saying. Metres, yeah, 72 yeah. feet. That's the wow. solid uh -huh. one. Um, I knew that it lasted a really, really long time. Yes. So, yeah. yeah, so 22 metres in each of those. <laughs> and you're getting one for free as well. So 88 metres altogether, and we're only charging you for three. So, obviously, you can buy one separately when they're there. Or, of course, you can get all of these today for, for three. So we're throwing in an extra one. So two of the dotties, two of the extra strong. And you will use these consistently as well. So all four of those um, are coming home to you today for £15. And I just think, you know, with these as well, you can put one in your craft bag. You know, you, you, well, two of them in your craft bags. You can have, you know, some in your room they're just something that you are going to wear you know use again and again and again now over half the stock of availability has now gone so it's very much if you do want these last time i had them on they completely sold out i know dave has had them on they sold out so take advantage um, on those now talking about limited as well the brand new gemini launched two days ago Okay, Sarah was here. Um, she's obviously, uh, oh, it's just amazing. It's the most incredible color. I love it. Obviously, Candy Floss was the name that we went with. One of you came up with that and you, you got one of these given to you for free. Um, I have 13 of you currently with this in your basket. You haven't yet confirmed. I've got people buying threes of these. In fact, we've got less than less than 30 now available. So once those 30 have gone, our full allocation has, has gone. It may be that, that Sarah um, and you, you <coughs> kind of bring some more here, but I don't believe it's going to be with the goodie bag. I believe that no, was just that initial No, as far as I'm aware, offer. that was an initial yeah. offer. Yes, yeah, so this is um, an exclusive colour, a limited edition yes. colour. It's absolutely fantastic. Mm -hmm. I... Everybody knows mm -hmm. I'm fairly new to Crafters Companion. Yeah. I joined in February. So mm -hmm. pre-February, I'd never used a Gemini. Okay. Oh, my goodness me. It's mm -hmm. changed the way I craft. Yeah. You're going to see. We're going to cut to in a minute. We're going to cut dies with intricacy, with mm -hmm. detail, mm -hmm. with filigree elements. We're going to cut through coated cardstock, mm -hmm. glitter cardstock. It'll cut every single time first mm -hmm. time. Yeah. You've got control. You've got depth. It never fails. Mm -hmm. Now, 
anybody that's followed my crafting journey um, will have seen I always used a plastic mm -hmm. shim always use a plastic shim i loved it i swore by it i haven't used a mm. plastic shim in two months really truthfully okay. hand on heart i haven't uh -huh. used one since yeah since i got my gemini out of the box yes oh wow Perfect. and that just says it all yeah. doesn't it is it available on split paypal as well um it's not is it, it's not showing up there but it, it must be it's bound to be isn't it yeah is it five times split pay that we've actually got on this so it's not showing on your screen but i've just noticed here we've actually got a five way split pay on this okay um, um, we don't do five way. We normally do three, two or three as a maximum. I'm I've just spotted at, that. I didn't know you yeah. did a five yes. way. Yeah. No, we don't normally. Um, I think they've put it on as a special deal, which will make it the the cheapest, you know, sort of single day payment that wow. you could obviously get for that, um, with it being split across five. So call the call centre and they can do that for you. So if you're thinking 179.99, I you know I can't pay that today. Don't worry because you can get that split across five months. Just ring 0800 001433. It's totally free. They're literally upstairs. There, they're really friendly, so they'll help you as well. Um, but remember that this is. It's limited. It's a thousand <laughs> altogether. Yeah. We're, Sarah's never going to commission any more of these. And it's just today. It was meant to just be for the launch day you got the goodie bag. We've managed to get it today as well, which means you're going to get almost £80 worth of goodies for free as well, which then takes it down to £100 for an electric embossing and dye A4 machine. electric embossing. A4, Let's just yes. remember, it's A4. Well, oh, it's nine, it, nine inches mm -hmm. by 12 inch cutting yep. plate. You can get a lot on there. Yes. Oh, my goodness. Uh, so well done. So about 25 of those left now I'll say once they're gone they've gone so good good look with that um okay now if you did miss the first hour we do have this amazing bundle that is available for you the nesting dies they're brand brand new today uh, we've got an exclusive one here as well that is only exclusive for us at at, um, at hobby maker i'm going to bring the graphics in for the whole bundle that's not your price okay <laughs> 74.95 would be your price if you bought them individually but today we're taking it to under 60 pounds okay um it's just brilliant, isn't it? I mean, at less than £12 mm -hmm. per die set, <laughs> you know, £4 a die, amazing mm -hmm. value, amazing yep. value. Now, these are slimline. Slimline is a beautiful shape. It sort of works with your, if you think of your DL mm -hmm. card shapes, it's that yep. sort of a shape. It's the, the le long and thin. And they are so, so mm. popular. They mm. just, you know, everybody is loving these. They're just yep. a really nice shape to craft with. You've seen we've done some cards. We've done mm -hmm. easel cards. We're yep. going to do, hopefully we're going to do a shaker box. Oh, yes. No, that would be good. Card and a box. Uh -huh. Let's get them the right way around. Yep. But they just work beautifully. And they give you the panel in the mm. middle that you're going to be able to put sentiments on, Isn't embellishments it? on, however you want to use them. Um, and you can all, because they're nesting dies, mm -hmm. you can actually cut the next size up into the centre if okay. you want to, to create mm -hmm. an aperture. So maybe you're going to cut one in, put some acetate behind and then pay, piece a different coloured yep. one back in. That looks beautiful okay. too. I love that. It's just amazing, aren't they? All of them, such sort of different designs that we can see across all of these. So that's that's the opportunity, of course, to get the 15 piece bundle. So if you want to get the 15 piece bundle, you can do. You can create all of these. We have got the exclusive as well that you worked yes. with a little bit earlier. Um, and you can see, so you can only get this from from here at Hobby Maker. You can't get this from anywhere else. It's brand, brand new today. Um, and you can just see, I mean, it's elegant, isn't it? It it's really is. Intricate. I do love this one. I love that edge to it. That sort okay. of, you know, that curved edge, that scalloped edge. You're going to get such detail. And just remember, it will cut perfectly mm -hmm. every single yeah. time. Yeah. And, th and with those three frames, I mean, brilliant for cards, brilliant for gift tags, mm -hmm. brilliant for labelling. We had that great bag. That yeah, we've got a bag where well. you can put, you know, cut it, you know, cut mm -hmm. it in. So think about things like if you're yeah. making your own box, Bottle bags that would exactly. work beautifully uh -huh. on there. If you have your own products to sell, it look lovely on there mm. as well. Absolutely gorgeous. This is just in black and white. Yeah. If it looks amazing in black mm. and white, imagine how it's going to look in all your yeah, it's colours. So so yes. true, isn't it? Yeah. Um, so it's totally up to you whether you want to get the individual, whether you want to get um, them in the smaller bundles where you can get two of these, or whether you want to get the full mm. bundle with the biggest saving. Um, but they are all brand new today. The Slimline dies here to kind of kick off our Easter weekend. So well, well done, of course, if you do manage. To to get those okay are we going to see yes should we do a demo right yeah. so i'll step over this way right okay. okay so the first thing we do light i've got my plates for my um my cutting machine so we've got these first so really really easy mm -hmm. to use so we have a a4 card bundle there yes so it's six six okay, colors this is a centura pearl yep. so you've got six colored ones so you've got your mink, mink. chocolate mm -hmm. dark chocolate black 
yep. cherry, fuchsia. We've got uh, purple, deep, apple. I think it's a deep purple, and also you get the white. Yeah. Well. So the white, the, the white, you get forty sheets. Wow. Okay. Yeah. So, so all you get of that. Six coloured, mm -hmm. and then forty whites Amazing. to give you okay. the hundred sheets. Yes. And we worked out just shy of twenty-eight pair sheets. Yeah, that's absolutely brilliant. Mm -hmm. So this Great is quality. the black Centura pearl. Centura pearl is an amazing cardstock. It's three hundred and ten mm. GSM. Look at that. Look at how that's mm -hmm. cheap. It's absolutely gorgeous. Now, even though it's three hundred and ten GSM, I can come along with a really, really detailed mm. die, and I can cut that into there, no problem. So I'm just going to put a little piece of tape on so that it doesn't move, and then I can cut it through. So just regular plate combination. If you get mm. this, it's really easy to use so i've got my cutting plate i've got my card and my die that facing yep. down you can face up face down it's entirely mm -hmm. sure i've got my magnetic shim my plastic shim and then my other cutting plate and i can offer these up now what i love about the gemini is we also do a gemini junior which yes. is an a5 plate mm -hmm. now the a5 plates fit perfectly in here because you turn them across okay so you know how quick this is yeah Put an A5 plate in here. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Super fast. Yeah. I've dropped a few out the other side because I've not been quick enough. Because okay. literally, it's, yep. it's that big. Wow. So if you're okay. doing smaller things, yeah, you can put sense. them through and you can still emboss. You can mm -hmm. still 3D emboss because they're the same plate, yep, yep. just smaller ones. Yep. So, mm -hmm. you know, absolutely. And just because this is an exclusive one, the yep. plates are exactly the same. Mm -hmm. So you don't mm -hmm. need to worry about okay. one to pop out of there. And look at that. Lovely. Isn't that absolutely perfect? Mm. Can you see? Hopefully you can see that lovely detail mm -hmm. all the way yeah. down there. Gorgeous, isn't oh. it? Machine on that cardstock. I know, it's, it's impressive, amazing. isn't it? Look, it hasn't cracked or anything. Hasn't marked. No. Beautiful, isn't it? Oh, yes. Okay, so as well as that, we're going to cut two more. So out of the white card, so we had some stamping card on mm -hmm. earlier, yeah. which we now often call um, all-purpose card. Yeah. So I'm going to use some of that. So that's our multi-purpose card. We're going to put that there. And then I've got some of the mink, which is absolutely yeah. beautiful. So I'm just using the other two dies from this collection. Remember, this is your um, Palmero. Mm -hmm. Pal Palomo, and it's your exclusive one mm -hmm. for here. So yeah. nowhere else are you going to see this. So you're not going to see any demos with these mm -hmm. cards anywhere else because yeah. no, you can't, can't get you them. Can get it from can't them. get them. So yeah, yeah, that's why I wanted to do one an hour on here. Yeah, definitely. Because once these launch upon our Crafters TV, you'll see demos with the others, but you'll not see demos yes. with this. So mm -hmm. I thought it was quite important to show you mm -hmm. that. So there we go. Now, the Centura Pearl. In the mink. Beautiful. Look at that. Wow. Beautiful. It's such a it's mm. it's more than a champagne gold, mm. but it's going that way, isn't it? Yeah. So just yeah. think of all those um your 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 wedding invitations, your exactly. anniversary yeah. cards, all of those. Mm. Absolutely beautiful. And this one, this is a bit fun, this one. Let me just give that a little mm -hmm. tap. Get all the bits out. I love this. It's it's, fancy, isn't it? It's really a little bit different. Mm. So it's not quite a straight edge, it just kinks every time it yep. goes over a little loop but it's really really pretty right so now i've cut those out i just wanted to show you because i thought it was important that you saw how they mm, go so definitely. what i'm going to do now is i'm going to get again out of the black centura pearl mm -hmm. and the mink and we're going to just to pop those together and we're going to do those as we did before as a drop shadow i do mm -hmm. think the a drop shadow works really really well with these now if i wanted to go right to the edge of this yep. i'd come with my dotty tape pen mm -hmm. and you can just see the dotty tape pen because the the tape on the solid is clear the dotty it's got a slight blue mm. tinge mm -hmm. but where i went over the dotty there's no stringy pearls in the gaps it's clever. so clever yeah. so all i need to do is drop shadow and i'm going to drop shadow off very slightly mm -hmm. to the left just on there now the um straight tape pen is our super strong but it also has a little bit of a forgiveness to it that if you don't get it quite right, if you can mm -hmm. pick it up within a couple of seconds, it will lift. It's quite clever like that. Yes. Now, I'm going to build this layer up first because what we're going to do is we're going to curve it. Okay. And I find it difficult to stick onto a curve. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to do everything while it's flat. Yeah. So I've taken that, that one that we just cut mm -hmm. and all I've done is stamped a sentiment across there mm -hmm. and I put a couple of pearls on. Lovely. Now, instead of doing a drop shadow on this, I've literally just out of that mm -hmm. good, beautiful 12 by 12 pad, cut a rectangle that fits 
under there. Uh -huh. So it just fits. Now this is show you how good this, this tape is. Let's do that one, regular mm -hmm. full one. So this is my straight tape pen. Yeah. And I'm going to pop it onto here. So this is onto the glitter. Let's put that onto there. Press that down. Now look at that. Absolutely. Mm. If I just get that. Perfect. Perfect. And seconds to and do seconds. that with those tape seconds. Pens. But it's the fact that it, it takes it even though it's glitter card. Yeah. yeah. Absolutely perfect. So take that off. Then we can take the tape off. Just a little bit of foam tape. Mm -hmm. And we're going to put that into the centre of here. Now there was method in my madness for doing that bit first because <laughs> what I've got now is I've got a piece of card mm -hmm. and I've just done yeah an inch score so it is it is nine and three quarter inches with just an inch scored at either yeah. side and I'm going to pop this onto here again I'm doing it with foam tape even though I'm going to curve it that's absolutely fine we can put that onto there and we can put that onto there now those red bits it's just because I've used what we call our super sticky or red liner tape mm -hmm. it's a clear yes. tape but it's red liner uh -huh. so I'm going to put that to one side so there we go you can see that looks lovely. really pretty yeah. in its own right. Very, that, those colourways, I'm looking quite Art Deco, isn't it? It is, isn't it? it yeah. Is. yeah. All right, so let's bring in my card blank. And again, straight, this is um, A4 cardstock, so that should, that be your 21 centimetres. Yeah. So the card A4 would have gone that, no, gone that way, that's mm -hmm. right, yeah. Feel that. So we're going to have it as a tent fold card. A lot yeah. of my cards, you'll see, I do as tent fold cards. Okay. I like a tent fold yeah. card because it can't pull over. Yes. If you do yeah. it that way, yeah, they you do can... a card that way mm -hmm. and you put weight on, they fall That's over. Yeah. A lot of my cards are tentful. Mm -hmm. Just you'll notice when you see me, <laughs> when you see me crafting, uh -huh. I often do yeah. tent folds. Yeah. There we go. And then we can put black on. So again, this is the black centura pearl out of that pack, yeah. followed by the gorgeous glitter. Mm -hmm. It's beautiful, beautiful glitter card. And I just love the colour. I love that that um, that rosy gold one as well. That was gorgeous. Yeah, it, with the I did. Copper yeah. hints into it. And we've got that chance of getting the three for two. Haven't yes. we? Stay on those as well. So, if you if you are wanting those beautiful golds um, that we can see, you've got the silvers, you've got the gold, and you've got the rose gold we were talking about. Um, and you can see, I mean, they're just amazing, aren't they? So these are normally 19.99 on their own. So that's the rose. Uh, you can then get the silver that we can see here as well. So you can see the difference of, of the silver glitter um, to that. You can buy them individually at 19.99 and the gold that obviously um, we are just using at the moment with, with Corin. And they are today on a one for 19.99 or three for two. So you can get all three for 40 pounds. Exactly. I think if you were doing, I, I like all three, but if you were then yeah. doing some party invitation or wedding invitation to add a colour thing, you'd then want to maybe just buy repeats of the yes, one colour that you were doing. You okay, so I've just mm -hmm. done a lovely little drop shadow with the black one mm -hmm. and I'm going to pop that onto the front of my card just here. Yep. There we go. Pop that just there. And that's going to go on just like Love that. It. Right, so we've now built it. We've got two elements. We've got our card base, just checking I've still got it the right way up, and I've got my top bit. Yep. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take one side of my red liner off. Now, if you look at this, can you see that is, I've got embossed detail there. So mm -hmm. this is just fractionally bigger than what I need it to yeah, be. Yeah. So what this means is I can take one side off mm -hmm. and then I can offer that up. I'm just going to do it to that emboss mm -hmm. line just there, okay. just like that. So now look, that's gone off yes, to the side. Yeah. So all I'm going to do, I'm going to take this one. Mm -hmm. I like that. Just give it a little bit of a bend because there's quite a lot going on in there. Yeah. And then I can bend this one round. Lovely. Just give it a minute. Now, this is why I've used the red liner because mm. it needs some instant stick. Yes. Because I've got foam tape. I've got lots of mm -hmm. layers. But look at that now. Awesome. Can you see? Mm. Can you see? Mm -hmm. There, look. Yeah. Oh, sorry. You lift. There we go. Can you see there? That's yeah. what... There oh, you go. Fabulous, isn't it? Yeah. Wow. So if I turn that round. Uh -huh. So the last thing I need to do just to finish that off is I'm just going to come in here, just put a little bit of mm -hmm. tape and put a little mm. bow on there. That's I mean, nice. that could be male or mm -hmm. female. Absolutely. Let's move the tape pen out of the way. Yeah. But how beautiful. Let's just bend that round. I just squash that down. There we go. So it's nice even. But there we go. Look wow. at that dimension. 
And you know, I change should... that sentiment in the middle, it could be graduation, you know. Exactly. Be... I put happy birthday on, but you could yeah. put absolutely anything. Oh, anniversary. Because mm -hmm. how hard is it to buy an anniversary card for a husband? <laughs> I know. Yeah. yeah, you don't want all hearts and flowers uh, and yeah, yeah, something so like true. that. Oh, perfect. Just perfect. Yeah. Absolutely amazing. Um, and of course, that was the using the the dye that is completely, completely exclusive to us here at Hobby Maker. First day today, so you're getting it that brand, brand new opportunity to be able to get this. And of course, it comes with all three of those nesting dies as well so you've got all of those different um, opportunities to kind of layer up like you're seeing there um, and this is the only place that you can actually get this one from as well if you want to get it individually of course you've got the whole bundle there at 59.99 but if you'd like that individually then you can see that you can get it today at 15 pounds so 15 pounds individually or of course all of them so all of those five different packs coming in at 59.99 has been the most popular on itself uh, on its own no wonder it's exclusive to us here today but of course all of this brand new to us at hobby maker as well um do you remember, you can see behind me, when you basket, it's still available, it's Easter, it does mean that at, you know, everything that you buy, you'll be put into a, a kind of prize draw, one of you will be picked out and one of you is going to win your whole basket to be paid for, that will be announced on Tuesday with Dave, so the more that you buy, the more entries that you get into that as well, so well, well done. Um, okay, just, just really quickly as well, if you do want to get these individually, just to have a quick look at the differences of each of them, they all come with, uh, they all come of course with, with, with three nesting dies in them but it's just to give you a bit of a look at just the difference actually um, that, that we can see so we've got Latina in the first one yeah this one's really interesting this is lovely isn't it? I love this one so mm. where we've got this uh, oh that's this board this isn't oh, it? oh they're board, all yeah. in a different order to our board there we go there we go so look at this so you've got the three dies mm -hmm. and what I want to show you is there's no cutting blade on the inside so they're going to cut you the full yeah. matte layers mm -hmm. but look at this look at that detail lovely, and you saw yeah. we cut that yeah. earlier out of the gold glitter card mm -hmm. didn't we on that yeah. card that trifold card yes. so you can they will cut through the yeah. most beautiful intricate things Amazing. that to me yeah. that one that you've got there mm -hmm. it says dream on it but it is very ethereal in those yeah. colors and then you just change it to blue uh -huh. and it's yeah. more of a teenager or a little girl Amazing. card, isn't it? Can mm -hmm. you see? Same die, yeah. change the orientation. Totally different. Yeah. Totally, totally different. Amazing. So that's the Latina. So if you want yeah. to get that one, you can take advantage of that one. Uh, we can come across next. So we've got the Ferrara. <laughs> Ferrara. There we go. Yeah. Now, this is the one with that gorgeous, gorgeous bubble detail mm -hmm. all the way yeah. around the outside. And what I love is with these, it's not one design repeated three times in mm -hmm. three different sizes. That would have been the easy option. Yes. That would have been Very the, true. the quick, cheap option, let's say. Mm -hmm. but what they've done is every, they complement each other other but they are completely different aren't they so we have got these are all here oh there, there they are yeah pass you there, uh -huh. there yeah. we go so you've got so many different that's the one where i was showing you where it was mm -hmm. on the right. front of the bag oh, look at that of front Lovely, of bag. Isn't it? i think we're calling that a reverse fold back yeah. card yeah okay that like that. yeah we, yeah we tried to name it yesterday and wasn't mm -hmm. sure but you know again like i've been doing mm -hmm. on your dl or oh, a tent fold get your favorite papers out your mats mm -hmm. and those bit of craft card i oh. love craft card i think yes, craft card yeah. is probably the most underrated card uh -huh. that we have isn't it so good though doesn't yes. it like that looks absolutely beautiful it does. it's amazing again so 14.99 then we'll come across the third one so we've got the medina that you can also get oh if is that you this would one like to. oh now this one yeah. is lovely this Sorry, one's really yeah yeah definitely. so look at this i love this because what it mm. looks like is it should come round. it feels like to that. me like it should come round, and then it's been elongated mm -hmm. hasn't it i love that so you've got all the nice curves Curves, yeah. And then you've got that yeah. structure, that architecture mm -hmm. almost on either end. So it's, it's so really, strong, isn't yes, it? Yes, beautiful. Of... And then each one of these nests inside. Mm. So you, you know, perfect for apertures. Yeah, they are nesting so. dies. Remember that. Yeah. So this is our Medina. Yeah, Medina that one is. And you can, I mean, again, the difference of those two yes. cards. Um, you can see they've both sort of been changed the colour. Uh, so yeah, yeah, absolutely um, changed it. And if we just kind of take that one, you can see that that's actually uh, joined just. Onto that just looks so lovely, doesn't it? it? Does, doesn't it? Yeah. yeah. 
Yeah. And then one more that will just bring the graphics in for you as well. It's just that if you want to get them individually, you can do. Um, but of course, there is the bundles as well. So we've got the Luca that we'll, we'll share that one, with you I think. as well. Yes, this is this one. Isn't this lovely? Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Now, remember, each of these, when you look at these, and we've mm -hmm. not really talked about this much, but mm -hmm. they have detail on here so you that do. when you've cut them, you can then run them through with your embossing mat. Okay. So don't forget this detail on here, which will give you lots of lovely emboss yeah. on your um, cut, die cuts as well. Great idea, isn't it? And you can see just sort of one of those um, options that we've got just oh, there as double well. gatefold. Yeah, beautiful way that opens, isn't it? I'll pop that back the right way. Yeah. But um, it's completely, completely totally different. different. Mm -hmm. It is the same one, isn't it? Yep, but there yep, we go. Yep. Look at yeah, that. Absolutely. So you wouldn't know they were mm -hmm. the same die set, mm -hmm. would you? No, definitely so, not. So, so pretty. Yeah. Amazing. And that's £15, um, as we say, for each individually. Um, or, of course, you can get the kind of mini bundles. So these two, will, you know, two will come in a bundle, two will come in a bundle. Or you can get the one on its own that is the exclusive one to you as well. Um, and the big bundle is the biggest savings. So this is where you'd be paying £15 each, but you can get all of them for £60. I know. It's just, perfect, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, it is absolutely brilliant. So just throwing in one for free. We've literally it is. Said, We're giving you the exclusive, exclusive one for free. For free. Yeah. I think that's a brilliant price. Isn't it? It's absolutely brilliant. And you can only get that from here today. And it is free if you get the full bundle, which can take home for £20 a month on that. Right, we've got half an hour well, left. Shall we? Another demo. Yes, let's, let's show you. This is some, a technique we haven't yeah. really done so far today. Mm -hmm. So I want to show you. And I don't know, we haven't used this die. So no, we're going to use Luca. I don't think we've Luca? used Luca. Nope, no, I don't think so. I have, no. When I was picking them, because I've got a few yeah. demos with yeah, yeah, cool. When I was picking them, I was trying to make sure uh -huh. that I'd got different demos. Yeah through you, different the different dies through each huh. one so let me make sure i don't want to pick the wrong piece of cardstock up right i want those mm -hmm. two pieces i've done that before i've had all my mats and layers and all yeah. my spare pieces of card and then i realized that i've actually die cut out of my mats and layers instead oh. of all of my spares so right we're going to take the first one mm -hmm. and this is the largest one yeah and we're going to just let i'm just Paranoid, yes, it is. Mm -hmm. That isn't my mat and layer. So I'm going to take the largest one and we're going to die cut it out of there. Now, just to show you, if you've got, I know this is a bright coloured cardstock. If you've got bright uh, cardstock, look, they will fit on the width of your cardstock. Mm -hmm. So A4 cardstock is yeah. 21 centimetres and they do just fit great so they're it? quite yeah. economical mm -hmm. you know because when you're saying oh i can only get them out of there well yeah. actually you can get one there and then you can get one mm -hmm. there so you know they it's quite economical in that way so mm -hmm. let's put that one onto there now i'm going to do this in two goes so i'll do that one yeah. first oops i didn't press that down <laughs> hold the tape down and then i'll show you because we talk about them being nesting dies, mm. but we've actually used them more as matting and layering dies. Yeah, yeah. So for the next one, I'm going to take both of the dies mm. and I'm going to cut them out of the same piece of card at the same time. Mm -hmm. And that's going to give us a beautiful frame with an aperture in the middle. Okay, amazing. Now I could do this with any combination. Yeah. I could do the largest and the smallest. Mm -hmm. I could do the largest and the second. Yeah. We're going to do it the second and the okay. third. Uh -huh. Think about that. So yeah, you've got, you've got <laughs> multiple combinations. Yeah. But look at that. Beautiful. Even in the white, mm -hmm. that looks so, so pretty, mm. doesn't it? Mm -hmm. There we go. Lovely, isn't it? Beautiful. Okay, mm -hmm. so let's take that one out of there. And yeah. then we're going to come in with our other two. So this is what I was saying, nesting dies. Let's see them at the best. So we're going to put the first one on. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to pop the second one on like that now i know some people don't like cutting two dies at the same time yeah because they worry about dies overlapping mm -hmm. because yes you can it's not good for your dies if they overlap because you you know the okay. pressure yeah of course but if you put a piece of tape on like that mm -hmm. there's no way those dies are overlapping so yeah. Yeah, you can you can do it quite safely without risking mm -hmm. any damage to your dies just think think it through and make sure yeah. if you have those two floating free mm -hmm. the chances are by the time you've maneuvered it into your die cutting machine one might have slipped under the other and you're not going to you know it's not mm -hmm. the best thing for your yeah, dice yeah. like that or you can use your magnetic shim mm -hmm. to hold them in place yeah uh, there we go there we are right so i've got both of these so what this is going to do now mm -hmm. is it's going to give me peel that one out of there yeah. where the tape is there we go and that's going to give me a beautiful Mm. frame amazing so can we see we've not really mm. shown that that much no so there we go That's you lovely. see and then i've got this piece now i am going to use this piece so mm -hmm. oops, let me just get the tape off there we go 
we can use this. We're going to use this as the stopper for our card. So nothing mm -hmm. is wasted. Yeah. There we go. But look at that. Oh, wow. That is so, so pretty, yes. isn't it? Yeah. Now, I'm hoping... Oh, yeah, I've got a piece mm -hmm. of the acetate on. So what we need to do now is I've got my card here. So all I've done, very similar to we did with the one before, mm -hmm. we've created a card base and then we've created our easel card. Yeah. And just to quickly show you, if you want to do this this way, we have our um, Ultimate Pro. Mm -hmm. So if you put this on here and you put it across, mm -hmm. this will go, this will work perfectly with your score lines to score and to score just yeah. down there yeah. to give you the perfect fold. Yeah, so it's absolutely mm -hmm. invaluable to use on there. So let's do on here. So first of all, we're going to do cast up there and paper. Let me just see. Mm -hmm. It should be written on here. Oh, that's from the Masquerade Ball. I oh, knew okay. I loved the Masquerade Ball yep. um, collection. So I've turned that up. Yes, if I'd have turned mm -hmm. it over, I'd have recognised oh, it straight that, away. Yeah. Yes, it's such a pretty collection. I did a masterclass on the Masquerade Ball mm -hmm. the other day. Did some, a whole a whole show with loads yeah. of different projects because it's such oh, a pretty collection. Uh -huh. There we go. We can pop that one. So this is the inside of my card. Mm -hmm. And that's the great thing about easel cards is... Um, you can uh, you see the inside as well, so it gives you extra opportunities to do matting and layering. Yep. Oops, move my mat, mm -hmm. and then turn that over. Mm -hmm. Oh, very nice. It's very pretty, isn't mm. it? So we've got the, yeah. the red. We've got the red in the bundle, haven't we? So that's where I would yeah. put that. So it's like yeah. a cherry, cherry red. Is it called cherry red or Christmas red? I can't remember. Okay. It's one or the other. Look, uh, cherry. Cherry. Yes. Yes, yeah, so if you want just the cherry red or you want cherry red uh, card as part of the bundle, you can do that. It's still available. You can see that beautiful colour uh, that Corinne's just using just there as well. So individual or all together, obviously all together, you are getting that extra saving as well where you're getting all of those colours and the white. But I'll bring it in individually right now in case you want to do, you know, the exact same thing as we're seeing there. £3.99, it's amazing I know. For, for the 10 on its own as well. Um, so, yeah, if you only want, got, want to pay £3.99, then that's your way. And all of those different colours are on the web as well. But then it works out, what do we say? Mm. It's like £2.80 <laughs> equivalent for yes. one of those packs. Yes. So it's, yeah. it's even yeah. cheaper, yeah. isn't yeah. it? Much, much cheaper this way round if you do want to get all of them, which is where you get the 100 sheets. So then you've got the cherry, you've got the opportunity for the white card, you've got the midnight, you've got the fuchsia, you've got the black, you've got the dark chocolate and you've got the mink. So if you're stocking up you know, for any of your projects that you want to do, an amazing, amazing mix of of colours that we can see there. Oh, I love that. Right, oh, no, right. Yes. Now, so all I've done while you've been talking, so I put the paper mm. on the front and then I've got it on these two pieces. So on my easel, yeah. front and back. Mm. So now we just need to decorate it up. So you know this one we've just cut and then we have actually just cut the, the frame. Now, all I've mm -hmm. done on this one is I've put a piece of acetate in yeah. and some foam tape. So all we're going to do is we're going to pop this. Let's put this onto here first. Mm -hmm. So... Put that on there. So this is going to go in the centre of here, just mm -hmm. on there. I'm actually going to do it this way around. So I'm going to take this now and I'm going to t attach that mm -hmm. to the front of my car. And again, it's so easy because I've got, I've almost mm. got markings so I know where everything yes, goes. Yes. So I'm going yeah. to put plenty of tape onto uh -huh. here because I need this to adhere. I'm, I'm doing it this way around just because mm -hmm. I'm going to make... Um, uh, shaker element so I, it, it'll be a bit more bulky to okay. tape down so I can center that completely and I know that's in the right place press that down and mm -hmm. I've no fear with this tape oh, so that's look. going yes. like that you can see how pretty is oh, that I love that right now this is where the fun bit so mm -hmm. I've got this shaker element yep. and I'm going to put that on there so before I put that on I've got look at this I've mm. got some gorgeous gorgeous sequins it's like pad parashery colors that are like coming out I it's gorgeous isn't it let's mm. take that so all I want to do here Put that nice and flat, and I'm just going to mm -hmm. go, on, go flat. Yes, I'll just take the tape off here before I do that because I don't yep. think I'm going to have a lot. I don't think it's going to stay flat for long. So mm -hmm. foam tape, just to give me. Now, if when you do a shaker card, there's one rule: no gaps, no gaps. <coughs> Else it will fall out. You won't be the first person <laughs> mm -hmm. to have done a shaker card and been really proud and lifted yeah. it up. <laughs> and then everything falls out the bottom. And I promise you, you won't be the first person to have done it. No. <laughs> so these are gorgeous. So these are like little, mm. they're almost like red or gold yeah. um, flowers. It's like the lotus flower. That's what they remind me of. Is it? Mm. Aren't they absolutely the of the lotus beautiful? Flower. So we can put those on there. Wow. 
There we go. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to turn this over and I'm just going to pop that just on Amazing. there. So can you see now? Yes. There we go. Just get that to move around. Oh, and I love got the card. Lovely shaker card. Mm -hmm. Right. We're then going to pop our sentiment on. So we've used mm -hmm. exactly the same pa paper at yep. the back, but we're giving it that white drop shadow because mm -hmm. you know how we love to drop shadow. And that is just going to come across here. So mm -hmm. we can bring Amazing. that over there. Mm -hmm. So you st I mean, we call it stamping card that we were looking at, at earlier in the, in the last show, mm -hmm. but it's like your all-purpose card. So you're going to find it so, so useful. Yeah. So that's going to go there. Now, the next thing we've done, remember those ones that we cut, that piece that we cut out mm -hmm. in the centre? Drop shadow it under there. Yeah. Nice, firm foam pads mm -hmm. just on the back of here. And that is going to make the perfect Brilliant. step. There we go. So that's, let me make sure it's straight because my last yeah, one wasn't course. overly straight. There we go. The foam pads are also available as well on the website. Um, I think it's 1,120 that we give wow. the opportunity for people to get. So <laughs> Good it's, well, uh, yeah, it's an amazing way to stock up on those. Oh, yes. Now. It's such a, such a reasonable price. Now, anybody that's following me knows mm -hmm. I love to make flowers. Flowers are the bits I love mm -hmm. to do. So we've got some gorgeous flowers. Again, all we've done is used our flower dies to cut it out of our paper. And the more you give it a little bit of a shape, the better it looks. And then we can take our tape off the back mm -hmm. and pop that on to there in the centre. The last little bit I've got is, this says birthday, mm -hmm. so let's complete that and say yeah. what sort of birthday it is. Happy birthday. Our, our producer's saying 12 yeah, days. Paul wants well, it. Well, I can beat that. Go on then. Mine in two. There, there you go, go Paul. I've gazumped you two. Two days. <laughs> <laughs> Two days for Corinne, you're, you're 12, so. <laughs> there we go. Amazing. There we are. How about that? Oh. Isn't that absolute? Look at this. Look I at love the, that. Look at the sparkle. Oh, my Isn't God. beautiful? Yeah. And don't worry, it mm -hmm. follow, falls down. Yes, yeah, you can still down. post that yeah. and you can yeah. put that through. The, oh, wow, Should that we is write amazing. on the back of this one then for Paul? Because yeah. I think he, he needs a birthday card, doesn't yeah. he? Do, do you want the birthday card, Paul? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I know, I love that. I'm like, don't take it. It's my mum's birthday next week. Let me buy it. <laughs> I'm like, it's way better than any I've seen in the shops um, at the moment. So I love it. That's, that is Gorgeous, incredible. isn't it? Yes, yeah. There we go. Yeah. And all of them elements just coming together is yeah, just brilliant. Perfect. Um, fantastic. So you can get everything from start to finish. You know, we've showed you the cherry card, 399, 1,120 foam pads. I mean, how many uses are you going to get out of them? £11.94. The dies are here on their own at £15 if you want to get them all individually. And of course, it's only that one-off poster and packaging fee between midnight and midnight the tapes as well on a four for three so you can kind of just get everything with these big savings today and then take advantage of the one-off poster I was and packaging. Uh, between the shows yeah. when um, Pauline and Jason were on uh -huh. I was I was sat out in the in the other room yeah and I was watching and I saw somebody put a comment on about the show mm -hmm. and they said you do know it's 1 p.m.p. Yeah. from midnight to midnight I thought yes. thank you good salesperson and the other person went, I'm off to watch. I'm, I'm going to go and see this. Yeah, I had something to get in touch with the other it's day. It's something and that you think about, isn't you it? You do. And they were saying that with the, uh, other channels that they've watched in the past, you know, they would regularly spend £10 on posting and packaging. Yeah. And I suppose that I just hadn't realised that because as Gemporia, we've always done across our other channels a one-off P&P, yeah. but it's a lot weightier, this, this sort of... Yeah. Thing. You don't so want to be brilliant. putting something like your tape pens in yes. and then having to pay a no. quarter again in mm -hmm. your postage, do exactly. you? No. no, no. So brilliant. So take advantage, take advantage. Um, and of course, remember the Gemini, the brand new Gemini machine is still here today with the free goodie bag of around £79 free stuff that is coming with this, taking the Gemini down in essence to around £100, but just for those couple of launch days. So launched on Wednesday. We've got this offer today as well. I don't know if it will happen again, so take it whilst you can. Currently 17 of you still looking at this i can't even guarantee that everybody is looking at it will get it so good good luck with that oh are we going to move to a box? Make a box oh yes i'm quite excited about a box yes i oh. love seeing how things can be created that are a little bit you know sort of different and you can use for different things as yes. well yes okay so mm. let me oh there's my cutting pieces right so let me just show you very simply so this is just mm -hmm. look at this it is a rectangle of card yeah so let me just do so we have got a total of mm -hmm. 11 and 
uh, half inches across okay. and then we're going by 11 inches down and all we've done is we've scored mm. at one inch we've got one inch border up so each one of these is one inch yeah and then where they overlap we cut so we've cut we just cut the diagonals on there and those are going to be the flaps to my box so this is going to make i'm just i'm not going to make it up because i need to to wait for a minute but yep. this basically will be my box and then that will be the lid to yes. go over it so yeah. it's going to be super super easy mm -hmm. yeah, get it the right way around so yeah that's the base mm -hmm. goes like that just like that there we go that goes like that and then right. that's my top so you can Brilliant. make these really really easily mm -hmm. so let's do this one out of our latina okay. so just quickly yep cut these just mm -hmm. to show you how easy it is yeah so i've cut a couple of them to show you Fab. there we go let's cut the biggest two so mm. okay oh. i think latina has become the most popular by itself now in terms of the dark i mean it is really nice i think when we've seen it you, yeah you know, i think kind of when people creates. realize the, the quality the, the dyes yeah and what you can um mm. actually cut out let me just um just yeah. use my Die brush just to get all the bits from the last yes. one out. Right yeah. Give it a fighting chance, you know. Mm -hmm. If you've not got all the bits that we didn't have, should have noticed that those weren't all weren't all out. There yeah, we go. Definitely. Just pop those mm -hmm. out. There we yeah. go. So yeah, you know, mm -hmm. don't just think these are just for um, card making. Mm -mm. You can do so so much with these. So let's just go with the largest one, yeah. and then look at that gorgeous purple. Won't be Crafter's Companion really nice, if you didn't have it? some lovely yes. purple for you. Yeah. And we've got that still. So if you want the purple individually, we've got the opportunity for, for that lovely midnight colour. Um, once again, that'll be three ninety nine on its own for 10 sheets, or you can get all of it. Um, you can get all of it in terms of um, with the rest of it as well. So it's totally up to you whether you want it three ninety nine for one or, or whether you want the chance to get all of them for less than £2.80 per pack. Uh, the deep purple is there. Right, okay. So let's put this through. So yeah, so mm -hmm. if, if you buy a present or um, that you haven't spent maybe as much as you would normally, you make a handmade box mm. to put it in and suddenly that present looks yeah. so much it's more so expensive. true, isn't it? Yeah. It really does. You know, it's a really good sort of cheat way mm -hmm. to, to get it through, you know, get yeah. through. There we go. Now, look at that. Isn't that absolutely mm -hmm. beautiful? Yeah, beautiful colour. And that's that central pearl. That's 310 GSM. Wow. So, you know, we're not messing around. Mm. And then there, this is the cream mm -hmm. or the ivory that you get yes. in the, yep. the 40 sheet mm -hmm. bundle, yep. which is absolutely... Almost like perfect. a pearl essence that's just coming off yeah, the top look, of it, isn't it? Yeah, you see how that Amazing. shimmers. Isn't that mm -hmm. gorgeous? Again, that's all adding to the... The quality of it mm -hmm. you know how expensive it's yeah. looking as well okay so first of all i'm going to take my um white i've got one here and i've got one here i've just been i already put my foam pads on mm -hmm. so i'm going to raise up the purple onto the yeah. ivory there we go take those off mm -hmm. Do you see how easy the foam pads yeah. come off? I know, they're great, aren't the foam they? Pads. I've, never, I've never worked with foam pads that mm -hmm. have been so yielding. So then the next one we're going to do is we're going to pop this on. Mm -hmm. So look at this, we're adding quite a lot of depth and dimension yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. onto here. We can pop that mm -hmm. on there. There we go. Lovely. And that's going to go straight on there like that. And look at mm -hmm. that. I mean, that... You could, you could actually make up panels like this mm. and then is it going to be a card? Is it going to be a bag? Is it going to be a yes. box? And then yeah, you, yeah, away yeah. you go uh -huh. after that. So this is going to be the top of my card here, just here. This is going to be the base. So I've got some card stock. So this is from, I have to try and remember if I can see what this is from. Mm -hmm. oh, country, our Country Lane collection. Yeah. Country yep. Lane collection. So I know a lot of our viewers have a lot of their yeah. um, pads, which is why I wanted to yeah, know what to use. Know what it is so to, people, yeah. people see they can do this. So this one, as long as you've got 12 by 12 cardstock, mm -hmm. you're going to be able to make something like this. Okay. So yeah, it, you need your 12 by 12, but how mm -hmm. perfect. So once people have got our box makers and our scoreboards, mm -hmm. number of people that say, I don't buy envelopes anymore because now, mm -hmm. 
Whatever yeah. your card shape is yeah. or card size, you can mm -hmm. make the perfect, perfect box. Mm -hmm. So once we've done that, we're going to take this one. Oh, I should have put that on first so we can pop this on mm -hmm. here. There we go. And what I can actually do, oh, a bit sticky there, is I can then come round with my dotty tape pen mm -hmm. just round the edge. Just look at that, round there. No stringy bits. Mm -hmm. All the way down. I'm only. I'm just doing it onto that card yeah. so that it doesn't go onto my mat. I can clean it up off the mat. It's really easy to do, but it just yeah, to yeah. speed. And that then is going to go on to my box and just there. And that means, look at that, because mm -hmm. I've got use that dotty tape pen. Mm -hmm. Every little one. That's the difference. When yeah. you've got, when you can. Put, press it down like that that's the quality mm -hmm. if you've got the edges all curling up yeah, and everything yeah. it just adds to that you know and the fact that, that you still don't see it you know the glue like you said yeah. only sticks on to the bits it that does. you want it so. really does so there we go so then we can oops take my yeah. so now this is definitely all i'm doing is i'm doing all my mats and layers before i make mm -hmm. up the box because it's easier to put things like this together uh -huh. before you make it up because once you've made made it up then yeah. it's going to can't be, do the whole pressing yeah, down. You can't press down, yeah. and it you, you're juggling on the side. It's doable. Uh -huh. Don't get yeah. me wrong. Yeah, but it's not as easy. Yeah, yeah. put that yeah. into there. Now I've got thankful mm -hmm. is my sentiment. But again, I like I did on that card earlier where I with the, curve the happy you could letter, stamp yeah. if you wanted to. But mm -hmm. just just remember, you have to think these things through sometimes. Because I've got foam pads, you have to stamp before you put your foam pads on. Yes. So yeah, if you've if you've put it together. Then you're going to have to start thinking mm -hmm. about um, die cuts. Yeah. Um, yeah. If you've not put that last layer on, mm -hmm. then you, you could, could stamp, be, you, you could stamp. Yes. yes. Yeah. And if you do want any stamp sentiments, we've still got the ones from the previous hour. Yes, we so have. They're uh, on the web for you, or we can just bring them up in a moment, and then okay. you can always get them if you are looking for some lovely little sentiments to pop onto. You know. I thought I had like a. This. Thought I had a bow card. Oh, there's my there it bow. Is. <laughs> I thought I did. So let's just put this. I love a bow. I always just think it oh, really does bring an extra glamour. I was always glamour. known for my bow. Was you? Yes. <laughs> always. There we go. There uh -huh. we go. So how about that? That's looking look. Now that mm -hmm. you could actually make a card mm -hmm. very similar to that to fit inside the box. Definitely. You know, because yeah. that is just the basis. So let's do this. So first of all, we're going to do our base. Mm -hmm. So let's just do these. So I'm going to do the edges mm -hmm. here. Take like this. Can you imagine? Mm -hmm. I don't know. I, I remember seeing my kids watching it. These American programs where these kids had the um, what I call totally over the top sweet sixteen. The parties, birthday. yes, I know exactly and they used, the program. And, they used, yeah. and half the party was delivering the invitations. Uh -huh. Yes, and the invitation <laughs> delivery was as if was was important as impressive. Uh -huh. Can you imagine yeah. if you if delivered you did, it, in this. it did an invitation in this? Yeah. Just how, you know, how mm -hmm. fantastic yeah. that would be. Amazing. So I've just neatly just put a little flap going over there because it makes it so much tidier. Because well, even when you get a wedding invite, in a lot of cases, the wedding invite is amazing, but it's yes. just a standard envelope, isn't it? Yes. It's kind of on it. Yeah. Whereas, like you say, to actually get something in this, it just kind of takes it to another level. It does, doesn't it? Mm. And then, you, you know, everything in there can be the, the same theme to it, you know your mm -hmm. invitation your acceptance yes, you yeah. know your um instructions mm -hmm. well, exactly. instructions i mean like direction yeah yeah yeah, yeah. Instruction. <laughs> instructions this <laughs> is what you must do at my up. wedding <laughs> yes <laughs> dress code if there is one mm -hmm. menus yeah there we go right so i've got the base yeah. and then i'm going to do it this way to make sure you know it to get it absolutely right mm -hmm. so i, I just a tip, if you make the base, because yep. this is an all-in-one rather than two separate, mm -hmm. I can fold that over, I can fold those mm -hmm. in and then take off the tape. Now, we could have done this with the tape pens if we wanted, but mm -hmm. just, we've just been organised and mm -hmm. got some red liner tape yep. on our base. So by putting this over there, let's see if we can mm -hmm. get the red liner off there, put that like that, then we can bend this over. Yep. We know this lid... Mm -hmm. has to fit because we've built it round the box yes of course yeah yes. so there we go how about wow. this an absolutely uh -huh. gorgeous box and every time that mm -hmm. lid is going to mm -hmm. fit on there perfectly that is how incredible. about that yeah 
And I mean, I mean, you could even then just put little sweets in or little, yeah. you know, you could put anything you wanted yeah, inside, absolutely. but it just gives that amazing yes. personal touch. It'd be gorgeous, wouldn't mm. it? And I think that's what shows like how much these nesting dies can be used for yeah, as well. Yeah, it's it's just absolutely amazing, you know, whether it's the boxes or anything like that. But I've got five minutes left. What, have we chose a highlight piece that we're going to do? Is it is it this? Is it the Gemini? Well, they, um, you should look at that. Look at that. Yeah. Open that now. You were saying. Maybe I'm. You remember get... that card we just made? Yeah. <gasps> how good does that look? Yeah. Oh I know it's gosh. a different design. Yeah. How perfectly? Oh my god. Does that card? fit yeah. inside and you that suddenly box. literally feel then like you are getting I mean could you imagine you take that out yeah. and I always think it's the whole process yeah. Yeah. Um, like everything is more enjoyable when it's packaged well and everything like that yeah. that, that just makes it so special it doesn't does it? doesn't it yes yeah. Do you know when I was really little, I used to get for my birthday, you know, like a big foam card. Do you remember them? They used to be like yes. stuck on and they were like this and they used to come, come in a in box. A box yeah. And it was the box that I think I enjoyed more you than the, the card. card. Yeah. yeah. And it was always every year I got one of them for my mum and dad because I was like, I had such an excitement from it. But this is like a humongous step up from yeah. that. It's almost like taking yeah. it just to a glass. Oh, I love it. Yeah, well done. And if you want to watch these demos back, the brilliant thing is, is you can easily do that. Mm -hmm. You can just pop onto our website uh, and they're all there. So you can always watch them back when you get your dyes home and then just recreate them. Mm. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Um, yeah, it really is a lovely little quick yeah. project to kind of get going with. So again, remember, you can get the whole bundle or you can kind of in 